will go live. Now there's probably gonna be about seven more things to fix whenever the stream decides to actually start itself. And that's exactly when it started itself, is when I said whenever the stream decides to start itself, it started itself. Really glad that's how that works. Has the live split launched yet? There it is. Now, I need to... Um, segment time. Best segment. How do I... How do I... Cool. Start timer at... 1.12. Let me check the previous live stream to make sure I'm doing this right. Um... Okay, what time was I at at the end? 1.23? One twenty three thirteen. Okay, then that's right. Start timer at one hour twenty one hour twenty three minutes thirteen seconds. Okay. That's one day. Okay, apparently seconds don't count. Oh, that is because of logic and how logic works. Thirteen should be the correct number. No, I was wrong yet again. Dang it, I was right the first one. One hour. 23, 13.99. There we go. All fixed up. I think no one's here yet. I'm going to delete this one because it's wrong. Keep this one. Is it working? Yes, it's working. It's on screen. Here we go. How's everyone doing today? Assuming anyone's there. I've got to close a bunch of Google tabs. Um, use two, apparently. Don't know how that's possible, considering no one's been here this whole time, so... Interesting. Um, why is it... Why can't I see Minecraft? I can see Minecraft. That's the thing. I'm just stupid. Um, anyway. Technically, it's going to count all of the times as correct if I don't wait exactly until those times. You know, I'll just I'll just manually override. It's fine. Whatever. Hi, how are you? English. Hi, how are you, Jace? I'm doing well. I'm gonna get started, but I'm also gonna wait a bit. Today I am beating the uh speedrun created by chat. Good, glad to hear it. I need to get in the game. And then as soon as I do, I'm going to start the timer again. And I have to get speed running. Ooh, spooky. Not really spooky, just uh, scary. Did the split start? Because if so, I need... Hang on, I'm just going to go ahead and... 
I'm gonna do this. I'm on fortress. I'm gonna have to manually override that later. Which right now it looks like I'm doing really, really well. Well, actually really bad, but you know, you get the point. Um, now I just have to find a fortress. These are said and done. Uh, oh, and I have to do it without dime. Probably. Since I didn't set my spawn in the overworld or anything, so it's not like I can just respawn and pop back through the portal and then come back. Ouch, that hurt. Do I have gold armor? Yes, I do, actually. Cool, we're just gonna... I'm just gonna ignore you, actually, for a bit. It's Enderman. You can't teleport away when they're in a boat, so... It kinda just will absorb fireballs, I think. And it went away. Cool. Not exactly what I expected to happen there, but, you know, it works. And it's right back again. Kill another enemy. More pearls. That's good. It's almost as if that's why I was killing Enderman in the first place. It's for Ender Pearls. Eh, whatever. Come on. Thank you, game. Don't need the Nihilium. Hello, duo. Can I get two of you in the boat? Yes, I can. That's cool. Double whammy. Good thing none of these Endermen know how to pilot boats. Or get out of them, for that matter. That down. Almost have 12. Just need uh, one more pearl. Which could be one of you two. Probably isn't gonna be, since I need one under my actually. Only almost fell off a ledge. I'm gonna get a spare, since it's right here. Assuming this drops one, which it probably won't, since I got so lucky. No, it didn't. Makes sense to me. Checks out. The luck's not that good. It's good. That good. There's another Enderman. are none that time either cool well, I'm gonna spread some nylon over here there's an enderman there and my portal is there huh. yeah I guess I do remember spawning a canyon oops need a ball there Not going that direction the problem is well Get over there first. Cool. There you go. Crit makes it easier. Definitely. You think the thumbnail was better this time or not? I don't know, chat. I thought it was pretty good. Then again, that's me, and obviously, I made it, so. Oh, I should trade with you, just cuz. But I already have 12 pearls, never mind. No reason to trade with you. Other than fire resistance potions. Actually, so I do have a reason to trade with you. Cool. Take all my gold. Let me fire res potions. That's a water bottle, that's pretty rare. If this was nether survival, I'd be very happy, but this is not nether survival. This is a uh, speedrun, so. Fire res potion, that's obsidian. Keep that. For one reason and one reason alone. I get enough obsidian from one of these guys, I could technically exit the nether at a different location. One that's closer to a nether portal, I'll take that. Um, you know, just getting to a nether, 
closer to not another portal an end portal another portal that is closer to an end portal that's great and all I already have leather more leather apparently I really need more leather I need fire res potions quartz I need quartz come on don't you and oh well actually that's the right thing it's only three minutes but uh, that, I'll take it but I'll wait for you to be done since, uh, you know, you might give me something better or another fire resistance potion. Better one, preferably. I'm sure do give a lot of obsidian. Obsidian dealer. That's blackstone. Similar color and texture, but not obsidian. Also leather. Why am I carrying leather? Armor? Maybe? Books? Doesn't make any sense. This is in the survival world. Ar yeah, I guess armor for boots. Ah, it's a hogland. This is why I hate crimson forests. Specifically you. I hate baby hoglands most. I'm gonna kill it. Even though I don't need to kill it. Don't lead me to an adult. I hate adult hoglands even more. I hate baby hoglands in this corner. Die. Yes, I did get entirely distracted. Simply because of bloodlust. But to be fair, I really hate baby hoglin. Anything of value down in there? No? Okay, bye. I need a... Nether fortress. I don't know where it's gonna be. I just know it could be in this direction. Could be on this level. Probably over there, though. Maybe not. Maybe so. Either way. I'm gonna choose to go this way. I don't know anything else. I'm not gonna take that route in particular, though. Even if it means going, like, all the way around it. I could've just built. You know, sometimes I forget building is, in fact, a mechanic in Minecraft. Grab that. Head through here. Realize that there's nothing and that there's more hoglins. And more accurately, there's any hoglins. There was no hoglins before. That's a bastion, not a fortress, which currently is not beneficial since I already have my pearls and I am going to die to a hoglin probably no I'm not because I can't get over that and I need to go where wherever the fortress is which probably in that direction Mm, that direction? Maybe. I don't know. I just know this is direct. This direction is better than that direction because there's hoglins in that direction that have blocked my escape, which is really my fault, but you know, whatever. Uh, great island, whatever. Go this way. Nope, missed my jump. I'll build. Since building as a mechanic in this game. I don't see anything in this direction. In fact, I see absolutely nothing. Um, hello? Other fortresses, you love locations like this. Just, uh, all you gotta do is generate real quick for me. Also, where's my hay bales at? Using my boat so much, I haven't uh, bothered to have my hay bales out. Even though it's still good for MLGs. Ah, oh, there's hoglins. Gosh, I do not. I physically cannot hate any mob in this game more 
Oh my god, dude. I need to go this direction, but this stupid... Gosh. The thumbnail look is good? Oh, thank you. That feels like a delayed response a little bit, but... Oh, I hate Hogwarts so much. That's a makeable jump. Assuming I don't do that. Uh, I hate hoglins so much. So much. It is not even funny. Oh, man. Uh, this is why I said in the description, I'm going to be here until I beat this challenge because... This is the ultimate test of my patience. Great, won't well, reset. Yes, I know it's some of my best times. I'm resetting anyway. Uh, my soul, but it's fine. I'll just delete this world. I hate hoglins so much. They are the worst mob in the game. I have caps lock on, there we go. No, and then speed run. Ah, da, 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 da. Here we go. Five hour stream, here I come. Maybe I'll beat yesterday's five hour stream. I'll get a six hour stream today. Probably, actually. I'm gonna have to take a pause to eat uh, dinner at some point. Uh, wait, I need to start the timer. Uh, da, 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 it's a plains biome, so potentially village. Where's the village? I'm in a plains biome. There's a village here. I know there's a village here. Just give me a village. And a tundra, that too. There could be a village there too. Is it right over this hill? No, probably not. That wouldn't really make much sense. Um, one of the other cardinal directions probably holds... Guess who's back? My crippling depression? No, what's you? Welcome back, Goliath. How are you? You ready for a six-hour stream today since I just died and lost my best run yet? No, oh, Clyde Gaming, yeah, I know. I don't see a village in this direction either, which is very unlikely. I'm ready too. I got extra water this time. I have an entire second container of water. And I'm not gonna rule this seed out until uh, and there's the village. Okay, it was that direction. Great, good to know. I'm not going to roll the seat out until I know where the village is, and whether there's a lush cave, and whether there's a pillager outpost to, connected to it, and etc, cetera, etc. Cetera. So excited to watch you struggle for six hours, that's so fun, and I'm excited to learn nothing. I mean, you might learn some things. Who knows? Uh, let's see... See, there's the guy that I need to kill. I'll get wood, complete the village thing. I just gotta remember to press buttons. Oh, I forgot to set the base starting time down. Hang on, reset. Oh gosh, great. That's Stu Hart. That's Stu Hart. Stupid? What's stupid? The idea that you might learn something? Well, I fixed the problem, but now I have to reset. So, new world, let's go, whatever, I don't really care. That world didn't seem that good anyway. Speed run this time. I'm not going to die in a stupid way. You see, I even got a fire res potion. Rewrite that stupid, stupid heart. What's stupid? I'm confused.
the time thing or the hoglins? I hate hoglins. Hoglins are by far the worst mob in the game. And there's planes. Which technically means there's a chance of a village. You know, this looks almost identical to a location in a different seed. The heart in the corner that blocks uh, the message? Yes. It is still there. I don't know how to get rid of it. I don't know what it is, why it is, how it is. I never asked, actually. I never asked, how are you doing, little heart in the corner? You know, I'm real curious since you're in an object. Um, any, any villages around? Yes, Gamma Ray 2 something. Gets 222. Two, two. Even not, though, I can't actually read since the heart's there. Um, you know. It's there. Heart. Um, anything this way? No. Last chance in that other planes biome. That, oh, yes. Gamma Ray 2023. I don't think, uh, quoting me on saying yes is really all that, uh, Substantial or funny since I just said yes. I guess you can put anyone for saying yes because the chances that someone hasn't said yes in their life is very low. Very low indeed. I don't know anybody who has never said yes before. Or no for that matter. Maybe. Maybe there's someone who's never said no in their life before, or yes. It'd be a pretty, uh, confusing person to live with, considering they wouldn't be able to say yes or no, only other variations on yes or no. Which I guess it's still saying yes or no, it's just not saying the literal word yes or no. This is so ins- that's it's so inspiring. I have the most diabolical next three challenges. Great. Well, hopefully other people join and have slightly less diabolical challenges so I can choose theirs instead. Especially considering you already have one in here, I think. Actually, two. You have two, so... You know, fair is fair. And hopefully there is extra people to give me challenges other than that one. But even consider challenges people suggested yesterday before it was even time to suggest challenges. Anything other than having to stand on top of another pillager outpost. I don't know why that's the hardest challenge here, but it seems to always give me trouble. Great. There is nothing good by life down into the cave. And exit reset. We're done with that world because it did not have a village. No reason to keep it. Speed run. Let's predict run. Speed run. Create new world. You want to know what they are? Sure. You can chat up whatever you want. Oh no. People are going to talk in the chat. What would I ever do? Start the run, look around, because it's savannah, and savannas are great for villages, so um, there's pigs right there already, too. No, savannah villages don't seem to have any, any carrots or potatoes. Um, that's a village, there we go. It's not a savannah village, actually, it's a plains village, but no, village is a village. a lava pool and a pillager outpost then i will be plenty happy that's also a flower forest very nice i guess you know all this minecraft playing and all this seeds i've been touring one well, find a stomp and kill a witch inside of a witch hut does it have to be inside the witch hut because that's not that bad of a challenge the hardest part of that challenge is killing the witch inside the witch hut. Because they don't always spawn in the witch hut. Kill the wa kill the warden with your sword. Okay, that one is cancerous. And I'd end up having to 
grind or get like several god apples since you know that's kind of what is required to kill a warden is several god apples as far as with your sword of course i'd probably just shoot it until it has like two hearts and then run it with my sword and kill it you know because that's the tactical thing to do instead of trying to kill it with a anything other than low health on it uh, get me an axe, a hoe, and a shovel. It's axe. This is hoe. This is shovel. Air blue ice spike in an ice biome. Okay, I have potatoes for pigs now. That's good. Hoe, shovel, axe. Great. Dit, dit, dit. There we go. Perfect. This is the exact right number of items. Reorganize. Inventory, take this out of the top rows, put this there, axe, pickaxe, bow, shovel, food, great, that goes away. Need the food first. It's also building block for killing the iron golem, since it's easy to mine and I have to get a bunch of it anyway. None of those challenges, those challenges all seem, like, time-consuming. But, the thing is, if I'm killing the warden, I'm gonna end up spending a ton of time on the run anyway. The only way to save time would be to, like, find some secret way to damage the warden other than a bow, an arrow, or a sword. Because I, I think it's immune to explosive damage. If it isn't, then you just, like, get a ton of TNT and bomb it. Or bring it to the nether and use, uh, bed damage, bed explosives. Uh, I'd rather like hay bales. There they are. Need more. Need at least one for the nether, cause, uh, you know, MLG and whatnot. Now I gotta pop up this hill and kill the iron golem real quick. Uh, hope not to die. Oof, that was close. You can't reach me, right? Nope. Good. Oh, I forgot to move the timer on since I've technically reached the village. Oops. Doesn't really matter. Time's time. Pretty soon I'll get the bucket too. How diabolical out of 10. The warden one is the most diabolical, but only because it makes the overall time of the run way longer. And uh, that doesn't necessarily mean you get to do those. Now, where are pigs? I see pigs. Good. Actually, I should grab beds here first before I leave the village. Because that's what I will be doing next, is leaving the village for good. And I need... 13 or so beds, not 13. I think I only need 12. I think really good speedrunners only need 8, but I am not that, so I shall be cautious. That is not a house that has a blast furnace in it. Not a bed. This house has two beds nowadays. That's cool. These houses used to be basically empty. They didn't even have beds in them before, I don't think. Villagers never used to need beds. It's a classic house. It's now furnished, though, so... I mean, it's just as classic, it's just furnished. Um, anything good? No potatoes, bread. Actually, the bread's not bad, since there's like 12 in that chest. Imagine if I- hello, random videos. Imagine if I remove the water and- I just did an an- Imagine if I had done an anti-MLG. I remove the water at just the right time, so I take damage. It's like the secret speedrun tactic. It's like you all jump into water in order to, to like, you're, you're, you're in a manhunt, whatever. You jump into water, right? You remove the water to die, to go back to spawn, because you're like 20,000 blocks out. And then you just start the speed run over, except everyone else is 20,000 blocks away from spawn. Fun. Maybe I should do manhunts. I probably suck at them, because I'm not significantly better that, at Minecraft than most of the people I know. I, I'd, I'd like to say I'm probably a little bit better than a number of people I know, but not a ton better, and not a ton better than 100% of everyone. I mean, I guess as far as job addition goes, I'm probably the best. Ooh, I want to be a hunter if you do that. Okay, well, that's bad, because you're good at the game. Um... Though, you mostly play PvP on earlier versions, so I don't know how much better at PvP on this version you'd be better than me, since, you know, you play Hypixel, and Hypixel's 1.8 PvP, so, you know, I know you're pretty good at Minecraft, I know. I know. I just don't know if you're 
better at Minecraft than I am as far as the most recent updates go since I'm a kind of a technical player, not really a pro player. And it's one pig. Ah, mm, that's not good. Well, that's rare as well. I think I passed pigs. No, that was a different spawn. Sometimes I play a server called Apollo. Mm, okay, fair enough. I guess modern PvP as well. Minecraft isn't all about PvP, though. Those are pumpkins. Okay. Um, I need to keep my hunger down. There they are, pigs. Uh, da -da -da -da. If any of them have a baby, it'll speed it up greatly. I think I see a baby over on the left there, but maybe that's my vision playing tricks on me. No babies here. I check for baby. How do you know random videos is good at Minecraft? Because I knew random videos before they uh, showed up in my stream chat. The only reason they still showed up in my stream chat is because they knew me before. Now, uh, friend of a uh, friend, essentially. Who I guess is also friend of a friend of a friend, technically. Uh, guy. There we go. Like I said, connections. I was talking about that before. That's that one done. Did I hit the reset button on accident there? No, I did not. Great. Lovely. Um, I need to stand on top of a pillar at post, and I need to find a lava pool. Okay, easier said than done, but my best bet is a pillar at post that correlates to this village, which would be not in this direction, since obviously there's not one over here. But also it can't spawn in a flower forest, I don't believe. I need building blocks and whatever I'm gonna do. Not the fastest. Whatever. There's a cave here. Any lush cave down there? No, and I keep screwing up because I'm looking away. Um There's a plains there, which technically could mean that there. I don't have enough wood to craft a boat, do I? No, I don't, so I might as well go by land. Unless there's dolphins, but there's not, because that's a cold ocean. I'll go this way. I regret going this way. And up, up and away I go. To the woods. I have a switch and a Chromebook. Okay. I'm gonna assume that's what you said, but I can't actually read the whole message because of the dumb heart thing. Um, please be a pillage drop post. Cool. Oh, and an Xbox and a Chromebook. Great. You've covered all your bases, except for the Chromebook part because that's not really covering your bases. Um,. Mm, no pillar drop post, but I feel like going in this direction is pr probably a better bet than um, going in any other direction since there's a village spawning biomes here. And potentially a lush cave, though I doubt it. Petition to remove the heart emoji thing. Yes, I wish it would go away as well. I have a PS5 switch and your PC and I just jumped into a little hole, which is unfortunate. Need to go this away. Mmm, cherry blossom biome. That's pretty, but not what I wanted. However, there is a meadows biome over there, I think, so. Eh, you know, still better direction than any other direction. Also, there's boat travel, but I don't have a boat, so this will just be swimming travel. But fortunately, I have infinite food, which is currently not on my hotbar. Oculus headset. Ooh, not a rift desk. Very cool. Haven't played in a while. I need to pull out of bed. Hey, dude, moonwalking underwater. Why are you so diagonal, buddy? I drown. Okay, we get the pixel perfect. There we go. Pixel perfect swimming on the surface. Which I don't understand why the game makes you have to do that pixel perfect. Cool. Don't swim up, drown, and cause me to get out of bed. Hi, how are you, Kyle? Not Kylie this time. Messed up last time, I'm sorry. There you go. Plays, did you upload yet? 
Yeah. Well, that discussion yesterday, I can't remember, honestly. I'm sorry. I don't know. People were talking a lot about subscribers and uploads yesterday. I just... My memory's fuzzy. I, this is probably a waste of time when I could go in that direction, but I don't have a boat, so... Swimming would be slower than getting to the top of this hill and then uh, walking from there. I can also jump off if I need to. And if it's a meadow biome when there's a village up here, I'll have a better vantage point. Pillager outposts. Plus, I get to walk through the beautiful yet potentially laggy cherry blossom biome. Wow, this is very nice. The grass looks weird. Very crispy. I know. My sister always touches, maybe? Touched, touches, tones, tosses, touches. I honestly can't read what that word says. I know it starts with a T-O-U, and I think it touches my phone. But, uh, always touches my phone. Yes, okay. I don't know how that's relevant to anything anyone said, but eh, whatever. A bee came out of its hive. And that's a plains biome, not a meadow biome. Hmm, well, whatever. Flat. There's villages. Still good. Assuming there are villages. Your foot hurts. Uh, still? Is it still injured? Have you considered going to a doctor? Anyway, I need to find a village, find a pillager outpost, and maybe find a lava pool along the way. You know, just cause, why not? I'm gonna go up that hill. Vantage point. That's a uh, funky terrain generation. Hmm. Okay, never mind. Apparently I'm not going to go up that hill because this canyon is a pain. I'm going to go around the hill. Somewhere in this direction. Since there's planes over here too. I, I love playing chips in BT6. You mean chimps? Oh yes. Don't don't you want don't you want to be petitioned to be changed to chips instead of chimps? Very silly name. Chips. More cherry blossom. Wow, this is like the cherry blossom seed. Dang. Um. You know, I need to check the other direction since there's more planes over there. Could be a village. Which could lead me to a pillar drop post, which could make this challenge less sufferable. I want my monkey knowledge. Yes. Yeah, I think if you complete five, you get two. If you complete, or is that 15? And whatever. You get monkey knowledge for completing a certain number of them. It's a pain. I did finish a third one, though. I have three black borders now, so... Maybe maybe I'll stream uh, Balloons Tower Defense tomorrow. Have to come up with a good live stream for that. One thing should be going pretty well. Maybe I could do a BPD6 speedrun. See how fast I can uh, fully complete a chimps. You have one. All right. Well, you got to start somewhere. Um, only problem with me doing a speedrun to fully complete a chimps is that I don't have any beginner maps that are um don't have any trophies on them or any medals on them what games do you play the most btd6 okay that makes sense sent but i'm pretty sure they just got it is uh the missing piece of the puzzle here as to why they know more black borders despite playing btd6 the most I used to randomly play browser games yes Right, ballot. BTD used to be a browser game. Okay, I found lava, so finished that. Guess I could make another portal here, but then again, I'm 
probably gonna end up traveling a number of blocks in every direction. Kill up blocks, I guess. Dot dot. You're both dot dotting, even though I already read the message because it wasn't like I could I could read it before. Okay, no, whatever. Guess better safe than sorry. Is there any more planes biome in this direction? That way I don't have to spend a million years traveling across the land to be the very best that no one ever was. A Pokemon joke. Now to find a pillage outpost so I can complete this dumb challenge. Um, nope. No more planes. Actually, maybe more planes. I just have to walk in the right direction. Uh, on the grass, really. Anyway. It did really well, but... No, okay, now I can't actually read that. Really well, but... Which wanted to branch out into new... Audio... Audience... Audience, new audience, but I wanted to branch out and do a new audience. Okay, neat. There's a cherry tree on the ground over here, not even on a hill. And what is that? That's a cherry tree. Why is it in the ground? What? Sorry, detour chat. Need to figure out what's going on over here. Real quick, sorry. Waste of time, but also what the heck is up with the cherry tree being underground, potentially. Why can I only see its top? Oh, it's not underground, there's just a dip here. Eh, whatever. Waste of time or not, uh, there's more planes in, direc in, in direction, in this direction. The hit new band, in direction. Instead of one direction, it's in direction. What that means, I have no idea, but, you know. What does one direction mean, other than that it's a singular direction? Band name. There's an ocean here. Hmm. It's not what I like to see, because it means I have to use a boat, or swim, assuming there's dolphins for dolphins' grace. I'm just gonna preemptively get wood for a boat. Because if I do have to travel across the ocean, I'd like a boat instead of swimming. I probably will, unless I go in the all the way back and... Kyle, are you still there? Uh, they probably are. I, I, you know, I can't see who all's here. Not anymore, anyway. I used to be able to see who's in the chat. But I, I think they removed that feature. Um, do I travel all the way over land back to that, um, back to where I saw the planes potentially going? Or do I build a boat and travel deeper into this plains biome that turns into a taiga? Hi, how are you? Phase Killer Fruit. That's a fun name. How are you doing? Okay. I think I restated myself. I think I said, how are you doing twice? Eh, whatever. I'm gonna go down this river. I also need a lush cave biome, so if I find one of those, I'm going to note the coordinates down. That band on PSN. 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 Personal security network. PSN. PlayStation? That band on PlayStation? Oh, okay, yes. What? For Minecraft? 
who got banned on Minecraft? Her online Minecraft? That must be pretty difficult to do. Eh, whatever. The judge. F5. Look around easier. No ban on Minecraft? Just in general? Hmm. Yeah. It's unfortunate. And I'm out of the biome. One of the two people that will like Ultra Juggernaut and BTD6. Ultra Juggernaut's good. It's on certain maps, only on certain maps, but they're good. It bounces good if you're on a closed quarters map. And it bounces off all the walls and does extra damage. You know, tactics and whatnot. Water chat, don't forget to drink water. Boys, guys, stay healthy. I'm gonna travel over land because this water ends. Like the water I prepared for today's stream because it is going to go for way longer than is somewhat reasonable. Um, let me reword that one of the two people that like Ultra Shadow in any map of E6 on Black Ops 3 Zombies. I Age because my teammates are trash. Oof. Yeah. Bad teammates can be rough, but um, you always got to keep it professional, so, you know. Hopefully it's not a permanent ban, though I guess it depends on the severity of what you did. As long as you don't bring that attitude to the chat, then you're fine by my standards. Unless you did something insensitive and have not made up for it. Um, and recency, etc., etc. Doesn't really matter. I don't think that was a fall damage height. The permanent ban. Oof. That doesn't sound very good as far as your reputation goes, but... Like I said, as long as you don't do anything here... I think you're okay. Is it a permanent ban? Yes, it is. I'm just chill. Okay. Then we weren't at some point. What did you do? Hmm. Certainly something. No savannah in that direction. Need to find a... Um... Need to find a village. Or taiga. Taigas have villages, so that works. Um... Ask people out on one for being trash. Okay, yeah. Um. I think. Up over here. That makes perfect sense. Yeah, to some degree. Depends on what you define as cussing. Uh, a lush cave at all? Anywhere down there? No. I'm gonna go. Oh, there's some bees. I'm gonna go in this direction. Hopefully, find a village before this plains runs out, which it will inevitably. Oh, okay. F word. Not the F slur, though. That's good. Using slurs at least. Um probably. Even more perfect sense? Maybe PlayStation does not like the F word very much. So that doesn't seem like permanent ban worthy language. Maybe that's just me. Again, I haven't been deceived before, so who knows? i pop over here. Oh, someone's actually using the annoying little heart in the corner. 
I don't like that thing very much. It bothers me. I don't know why it exists. It reminds me of like something I've seen in Instagram screenshots. I don't know why it's on YouTube, but eh, whatever. Covers up messages. That's me. All right. Fair enough. I don't mind you using it. I just mind that it's there and it covers up messages, so I can't read some of them sometimes. Which bothers me as all. I don't mind people using it though. For whatever reason, when I use it, uh, it appears over top of my face. Does it? Does that do it for you too? Oh, if I have it open, it moves it over to there. That's cool. That's nice. Um, interesting. This seed does not seem very good. Um, I think I'm going to reset before I waste any more time. Cool Minecraft run. Yeah, chat came up with a lot of these. You can also add your own later once I beat some of them. If you stick around long enough, I'll end up beating all the ones chat's come up with so far, and then you get to add more. It's kind of the whole dealio. What makes the run so annoying. I have to stand on top of a pillager outpost before I can go to the nether. And, and I have to get an axolotl. And then um, I have to get a creeper music disc once I've killed, once I've got to a fortress. But I can kind of do them out of order. Since technically, um, as long as I have the item, it gets completed. Ah, uh, not this seed. Delete new world speed run. I should really have that copied to my clipboard so I can just copy and paste the name in there and then it'll be easier. Wait for the world again. Oh, my back. Hey, you want to know what's the three I'm willing to put out soon? Are I don't, I wouldn't say soon if I were you, but yeah, sure, you can go ahead and tell them. Taiga, there's a plains. That's two village spawning biomes. I'm gonna go for the plains just because it's easier. There's already lava there. It's good. And was that a desert maybe? All damage. Huh. Mm. Mountain biome. Actually, that's a meadow. And then a mountain biome. Of some kind. And more taiga. Hmm. I haven't yet to see a taiga village this entire time. In all nine and a half hours of this speedrun. Total from all my attempts. I have not seen a single, um... My main Fortnite skin is Guff. Okay, interesting. I, I don't know what that means. Uh, I don't buy them that way. Actual planes this way. I don't want to get hit off by a goat, so I'm going to not stick around. Go this way. Question. That's a... Oh, that's a village. That's not a question, but... Question anyway. What year did Fortnite release... I hate snow biomes. Oh, I love snow biomes because they snow, and snow is prettier than rain. Find a swap, kill a witch, kill the warden. Uh, rare blue ice spike in a biome. I guess that was the order you told me them in, yes, wasn't it? Uh, yes. Uh, I need to get here, and then. I think this is a plane. Fortnite came out in 2017. Well, then. 2017 was the last time I played Fortnite. Rabbit just died there. I mine this up. That, 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 and that. Make a slim pickaxe real quick. Need that. Is it hardcore mode? No. Fortnite is six years old. Yes. 
Well, that is six years old. That's not that old. But for a game to be still alive after six years, that's not bad. Certainly no TF2, but it's not bad. I need eight total cobblestone right now. I think, no, I only need six actually. Dang. I do need another piece of wood though. I'm gonna make the two more important tools and then grab another piece of wood. Actually, I'm gonna grab a couple since I've, as I have learned, it's always more than a uh, piece of wood. Uh, potato. I played Minecraft on the Xbox 360. Yeah, I think I've played Minecraft on Xbox 360. As a Lytra course and Spleef and a couple other mini games. I think. Not sure though. I don't know if that was Xbox 360. That might have been a different Xbox. I don't think it was the Wii. It might have been the Wii, though. Anything of value? There's potatoes and bread, actually. Bread's of value to me. I need the hay bales. There's one pig. I need two. There's the second pig. Great. Uh, any baby pigs? Nope, just two regular pigs. That's fine. Breed. Also, I forgot to finish the village achievement. Hopefully that didn't reset the run. Did I press the reset button on accident? No, I didn't. Good. Great. That's the best. Where is the iron golem? Eh, whatever. Wrong thing. There we go. And done. Okay, did battle tumble by the Minecraft minigames? Yes. Those were like on the main menu. Um, cool. I'm going to go ahead and need to find the iron golem. Is speed running until he wins? Yes, I will. Did someone ask how long I'd be speed running for? Did I ask? I don't think I asked. Why would I ask? I know that. We're going to die before he beats it? Yes, very possibly. It will probably take about like 90 years just to be uh you know gracious generous generous that's the word hey minecraft on ps4 now eh, well but not any uh online minecraft hello iron golem uh -huh. hello you craft a bucket and then I have completed that part of the speed run exactly three love that great it's actually really annoying um, and I need to go down to who the baby pig or its parents are where are your parents where'd the pig go where's the baby don't tell me it already grew up. Uh, whatever, I have more potatoes. Okay, who's gonna make another pig? You and... Where about this one? Come here. You, you two. Oh, the baby's still alive. Actually, never mind. Hang on. Oh, now there's two. Oh, whatever. One of these needs to die anyway. Where are you? Come here, baby pig. Look at me. Look me in the eye. I don't have hunger. Great, I keep doing this. But I learned. I say take some damage, I'll get more hunger, and then I can actually... Come on. Come on, spend my saturation so I have hunger, please. There we go. Where are you, buddy? Look at me. Look me in the eyes. Don't kill yourself. This guy can die. You can't. Don't run down after it. Look me. There we go, that counts. Orc baby pig complete. I just need the lava pool. And also I need to have a pillager outpost somewhere nearby. Which is the hard part. Mmm. Gosh, I hate the pillager outpost one. Also a lush cave one. Which is actually the axolotl one. So not technically the same as a lush cave. But it basically is. Never actually looked up whether they could spawn outside the lush cave or not. I guess while I'm in the village, I might as well grab some beds instead of just leaving to look for a... That's not a house. FaZe, what do you think about the pork baby pig? 
And it's a very cruel part of the speedrun. Gotta hate Minecraft Bedrock Edition because it's laggy. No, I, I just hate Minecraft Bedrock Edition. I don't have any excuse about it being laggy since it runs fine on my computer. I just hate it. Because it's Minecraft Bedrock Edition. It's very hateable. Very hateable edition. Anyway, I need your bed, my friend. Why are you a cartographer? This is in the house. That's why you're a cartographer. Anyway, don't really need potatoes. You can have those. Wait it for your bread. Hello! Hi, how are you, Robin? Good to see you here. I need a ledger outpost, which could be around this mountain, so I'm probably where I'm gonna go next. Since it's clearly not on this side, since I came from this side, and there was no pillager outpost, and I looked in the other direction too. Hallow is German. Okay, cool. Could have just been saying hello. I think hello is also a couple other languages, not just German. But, you know, fair enough. Climb up here. And skirt around the edge of this mountain, because it's easier than climbing all the way over the mountain. But I might end up doing that anyway, just kind of gives me a good vantage point. And also, it's not that hard. It's slightly easier to go around. Another plains over there. I actually think that's meadow biome, but I think... Don't quote me on this. Villages can spawn in meadow biomes anyway. I'm decently sure I've been in one. Uh, over here... I am a fan, okay? Like the kind that rotates, blows air, or like, ooh, let's go, I love the Mets, let's go, woohoo, that kind of fan. Uh, there's no pillar drop post back here, but there's another village, which could mean a pillar drop post in that direction. You can MLG with this stuff, right? Yes, you can. Anyway, down the mountain I go. Oh, I like your content. Yeah, I, I, I know, I know. Thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, uh, sleep. Sweet dreams. Make a cheese quesadilla. Good, good meat. The cheese and the tortilla. What? Chat, you never cease to confuse me. What is that sentence, Goliath? What year did you start playing Minecraft? Uh, math. It was 10 years ago. That would be... Uh, 2013. There we go, math. Hi, how are you, Cuber? So, feel free to correct me on pronunciation of your name. Assuming I pronounced that wrong. Oh, three, there we go. Yeah, 2013. So I have 10 years of experience. Maybe not 10 thorough years of experience, since obviously the amount I played each of those years varied, but I have never stopped playing for any full year before. Maybe a month at most, probably, but I, I play Minecraft a ton. That and BTD6, they're just about, well, BTD6 didn't release 10 years ago, but there's BTD5, which I did play. 2013, the year Call of Duty Ghost came out. Interesting, I didn't know that. How did dirt get on top of me if I jumped into the snow? <laughs> Whatever. This is really annoying. Um, How do I get out of this? Because I build. Hang on. Uh, pick up and then parkour forward. Uh, do, 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 do. Cool. Great. Uh, okay, that's regular snow. Um, villager, the fact that you're alive is surprising. I need to go in this direction. Never mind, it's powdered snow. Please, thank you, I will go around. Uh, I need to get a water bucket as well. I love COD Ghost multiplayer. Huh, good for you. Never played. Like I said, I've, I've played Minecraft a lot. 
So you'd think I'd be better at it, but then again, I wasn't really worried about being good at the game most of those years. Um, mm, pillar drop post may or may not be in this direction. I sincerely hope the ocean doesn't start in this direction, but it probably will. And I'm gonna have to get in a boat and boat to the ocean, and then so on and so forth. And I'm probably gonna reset the run because it's really time inefficient. Leather boots make you walk on powdered snow without falling into it. That'd be great if I had leather boots, but I don't. I don't really feel like killing some cows so that I don't fall into it. I would love you to join in a YouTube video. Eh. Who knows what the future holds? But probably not. Just gonna keep doing what I'm doing now. Um, No pillage drop post here, even though villagers can definitely spawn in meadows. And any village, any biome of village can spawn and so can a pillage drop post, but that is another village. Just a abandoned one. Hi, how are you, Chico? Welcome back. I don't see any pillage drop posts. Hmm. I uh, don't suppose they can spawn within radius of a abandoned village as well. Perhaps. Where? We live in Earth. That is not the same joke you made last stream. Hmm. How did you know? What a crazy guess. Oh, it is raining, yes, yeah, so the zombies won't be dead. How unfortunate. Put my card PS4 on account. I don't have a PS4. Or, in fact, any console that can run uh, a console edition. What am I looking for? I'm looking for the pill drop post right now. That and I guess a lava pool, since technically, since my current challenge is to get lava, but really I'm looking for a pillage drop post because that's what I actually need. What is that? That's a mushroom, okay. That is another village. Wow, I am like getting really lucky with villages right now. Not with Pillager Outpost, though, despite the fact that they're supposed to spawn within a certain radius of the, uh, village. Just weird. Eh, whatever. I'm gonna pop up here. Played Minecraft TNT mod. That's uh, a good mod. Fun. Blow stuff up. No pillage outpost, but there is a village this way, which I guess means there's probably more biomes over here that can have villages. All I gotta do is climb a mountain without a water bucket. <sighs> fine, game, fine. Up this way. Up and 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 there we go. And I don't even see the village. I think it's over to the left. Yes, there it is. Uh, need a pillar drop post though. Fortunately, there seems to be a pretty linear biome, so it's either in this direction or it doesn't exist. Really narrows things down, doesn't it? Um, please, game, I would like to move on to doing other things like finding lava. Lava is a lot easier to find than pillager outposts. Unfortunately for me. I just realized lava is technically you? What do you mean, lava is technically you? Your profile is a fire, not lava. Unless that's lava and I just have bad vision. Go into here. Um. No pillage outpost. Could technically be over there. But I find an unlikely cave. Well, it fits the color enough. Yeah. Yeah. Go 
Oh, pillage outpost. Dang. I'm at 17 minutes. I don't even think I've even passed any lava yet, so... Not even doing good on that front either. Couldn't even technically take off this challenge. Actually, I think I did pass lava. I just decided if I didn't have a pillager outpost, it wasn't worth stopping and building a portal. That just wastes time. Which it does, to be fair. Wow, big cave. Any lush cave down in there? Can't really tell since it's raining. I don't really like the rain. I'm honestly considering restarting this world just so I don't have to deal with the rain anymore. It's just bothering me. Hmm. wonder if I'm gonna look straight down into an ancient city right over here. That'd be cool. I'm not, but I'm sure if I went down there I could probably look at one. I don't really need to look at an ancient city. I've already cleared like three of them before. And I mean, like, cleared, like, remove all the skull, like, clean it up. Yeah. Cleared, cleared. Go there, lay out, in and out. Ooh, snow, much nicer than rain. Probably gonna fall in powdered snow, though. I just came in. Hi, BRB, I just came in. I'm mildly confused, but hello, how are you? Minecrafting for you. Or whatever else you prefer to go by, nickname, etc. I'm a little confused, but I'm gonna assume that you meant like you joined, but you're gonna have to be right back. And then, you know, doing alright. Glad to hear it. I too am doing alright. That's another village. I am losing a decent bit of my sanity, this. I'm mildly confused, Gamma Ray 2023. Mildly confused. Yes. That's kind of my perpetual state. Mildly confused. I don't know why you quote me on the most mundane things, but... Alright. Any pill... Come on! What? C really? That's not even in a dark oak forest! What is this? Okay. H what? What? What is my luck? Okay, I can't find a pillager outpost, but I can find a woodland mansion that is not even in a dark oak forest. Okay, it is in a, wood, a dark oak forest, but that's the size of the dark oak forest. What are, what are you, what, what is this, dude? What, what? I re you know, you know, I should go to this village and buy a, a, a woodland map. Hey, you got any cartographers? You know, I think I need a map to the woodland mansion. I'm not sure where it is. It also, yeah, you're right. It's like seven stories tall. Uh, hmm. Anyone want to add a challenge to stand on top of a... Woodland Mansion instead of a Pillar Drought Post, because at this rate, it's more likely I'm completing the Lava Challenge. What is this, dude? What is this? No, please. Nobody genuinely add standing on top of a Woodland Mansion, because that's about 500 times more rare than the Pillar Drought Post. And even the Pillar Drought Post is like the most cancerous challenge known to man. Let me get away from the spider so I can take a nap. And it can be daytime and not raining anymore. This is a really bad place to put my bed. Oh, hopefully I don't wake up in lava. Didn't. That's good. Thank you, game. Now let's go see if I can find the entrance to this. It's a it's the rare version too? What do you mean? Oh yeah, that's three stories. Great. So glad I'll be able to mine that obsidian cube and get myself a diamond block while I'm in the middle of a speed run. Well, there is actually a lush cave here, so, you know, this isn't that bad of a location as long as I can find a pillager outpost relatively nearby. Can we count this as a pillager outpost? It's technically an outpost from which pillagers operate. Also, this is by far the smallest woodland mansion ever. I mean, a wood, a dark oak forest. 
we're counting this? Okay, great. You just know I'm gonna get killed by a Vex, probably. That's why I'm gonna set my spawn. And also, I'm gonna take a screenshot of the size of this dark oak forest, because it's stupid. Okay, well, my spawn point has been set. Right, now I'm gonna go up to the top. Count? What do you mean, count? Count it? Okay, I'll count it, chat. Oh no. Oh no, I got what I wanted. Chat, you really had to shout for that, otherwise I wasn't going to do it. Okay, well, the Dark Oak Forest is a little bit bigger, but it's still, like, small. Where's the entrance at? Like, if this is the base floor, where's the entrance? Is it just floating over a cliff? Do they wake up in the morning while they're drinking their coffee in their bathrobe and they step off and just fall to their death? Like, what? Mine in. No, I'm just going to tower up to the top. I don't want to go in there. Hey, seriously, where's the door? Where's the door to this place? How do they get inside? Do they just, like, levitate? Do they have ma- They have magic, but do they have levitation magic? Can they do they just have, like, an elevator powered by Vex? They just carry it? Instead of having swords, they just, like, pick up an elevator car? Is that the secret? Well, I'm gonna go up here. I'm not gonna get a totem. Oh, look, a forest fire. That's fun. I'm glad I didn't set my spawn down there. Teleport using a command. Interesting how they don't have commands. And I don't have any water bucket to MLG with, so I'm probably just gonna mine my way down. Okay, that's that done. Yay, yay, we're all done. Now I need to go to the nether. Actually, I should look in these windows. Just in case, you know, maybe they do have a diamond block room. See, if I tried to kill anything in this building, I would just die horrifically. Hor horrif horrifically? Please don't summon Vex. Please. Don't summon Vex. Just don't look out your window. Okay, nothing to see here. You live on top of a mountain. There's no possible way there could be a player here. Okay, just ignore me. Thank you. Goodbye. I need to figure out where the heck they're, uh door is. Oh, it's right here! Well, of course, why didn't I think of that? It's in a pit in the side of a mountain. Yeah, you know. Uh, you know, they certainly... Uh, yeah, I can see exactly how they get out of here. They come out of their door, and then they simply scale this wall, like, ten blocks upward, and then they, uh, then they walk out into this nice little meadow. Oh, uh, yeah, that makes perfect sense to me. Great. Um, I'm gonna leave now, since I have no reason to be here. Since I have no armor, and uh, also no reason to go in there, like I said. There is nothing in there that I need, even remotely. This is the most cursed woodland mansion of all time. It's cursed and the doorway is cursed. Yes, I'm gonna get the seed after this one. Even if I don't win this, even if I don't win on this seed, I'm gonna get the seed. Uh, now, I'm gonna craft... Uh, I'm gonna go to the village first, actually, because I need the iron. And then I'm gonna go down to this, uh, I'm gonna go down to this, uh, brain function. Knock, knock, is there, uh, any brain cells left in there? I'm gonna go ahead to this village. I'm gonna set my spawn at the village, since it's a more central location. It's closer to the lava pool, it's closer to whatever. Actually, maybe I'll set my spawn over by the lava pool, since after I'm done in the lush cave, I'm gonna come up and, uh, build, a. Uh, Build a portal and then go to the nether. Actually, why don't I build it now? This makes sense to me. That that works out the logic of my brain. I'm gonna spawn right there. Then I'm gonna work on the nether portal. Um, mm, yeah, perfect. I grabbed a ton of this birch, so it's fine. I think this is big enough. Should be enough. Why is everyone doing dots? I already read the whole message. Come on, I can, I can read it. Don't worry, chat. Well, for a second I was like, oh no, not an irreversible mistake. And then I realized that's not an irreversible mistake. That was a single, that was a single bit of lava. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Not even that big of a problem. I don't have a flint and steel. That, however, is a problem. Oh, time to go to the village. Getting flint is going to be a pain, though. Since, you know, flint doesn't just magically fall out of the sky. 
despite the fact that there's no gravity and you can just casually build your mansion like 30 billion use wood to do it i could do that but i'm going to this village anyway so i might as well check if they have a fletcher's chest which will have flint in it you know because why not no reason not to i'm going here to kill the golem anyway so i might as well just rob them too what morals did i hear someone say morals Never heard of them. Uh, ooh, a helmet, thanks. Don't know why I did that, since that wasn't a Fletcher's building, but it's not like I care. Uh, that, however, actually is a Fletcher's building, but it does not appear to have a chest. Does not. You sell me flint? Actually, yes, you will. If I have one emerald and ten gravel, you instant make me... Insta make me? I guess that works, technically. You'll instantly make me flint. Great. I don't have one emerald, but I probably could get you 32 sticks and 10 gravel. But I feel like by the time I've mined 10 gravel, I've probably already have been lucky enough to just get a flint. I only need one, so it's not exactly that important to me. Oh, there's not that much flat ground here, is there? Well, there is over here, so that's fine. Just gotta wait for the guy to come over, and then I can kill them. We get to die a whole bunch. Matt, this sea is crazy. I mean, I am I am a couple thousand blocks away from spawn, but you know, it's not like you're gonna find a, a woodland mansion any closer to spawn. Also, that mountain kind of just casually ends right there and becomes a meadow. I'm not gonna question that either. Um, even though I just did, but you know, you get my point. I do need a second bucket, and I need to keep one for, uh, I need to keep one for, I need to keep a singular one for, uh, uh, flint and steel, but I don't need to keep any more. If I find another iron golem, I can always make myself an iron axe, but for now, I think a stone axe will suffice, as long as I have two, uh, that. But I will replace this, and seems good. Water bucket. Food I already have. There's a zombie burger, and I just yawned for a long time there. Excuse me. Um, you have any more beds? Yes, that does not look like a library. That looks like a bed building. It is a bed building. Great. Have I checked all their houses? No, I think I missed some, and there's the woodland mansion off in the distance there. Did I miss this house? Yes, I did. Free bed. Yay. I love stealing. You guys have any gravel nearby? No? What? You don't have any gravel nearby? Yeah, oh, that's so unfortunate. Well, I guess I'll just steal your hay bales and go back to where I was, because I know there's gravel over there, because... There's a riverbed, and there's also, uh, see it is worse than round 63 and BD6. Uh, it's not, it's not a bad seed, it's just, you know, it's unique. Also, oh, there's my flint. Great. To me, Let's see, didn't get 10 gravel before I got a single flint. It's not really that hard. Go back. Gotta go see ya. Alright, bye. Hopefully I will see you later, since I'm gonna be live for, like, billion hours probably hop through this forest over to my portal i'm gonna light it and then i'm gonna go down to the lush cave do stuff a little bit out of order to save time later in the speed run since you know i won't have to pop back out of the nether to go get me that I thought Nether said father for a second. Oh, well. Speedrunning a father is not really possible. You have to go to, like, an orphanage or something and be very, very cute. And sit here and wait. Waiting. There we go. Great. Um, flower next to my bed. I'm actually probably going to craft full iron armor when I'm down in the cave. Just because 
Why not? You know? This isn't exactly a speedy speed run, and I'm kind of fed up of dying in the nether constantly. Primarily, in this case, to hoglins. Technically that was to the lava, but I was at two or three hearts when I fell in the lava because of the hoglin, so... Not really the lava, it was, it was the hoglin. And the fact that it exists in this game. But they don't like hoglins. You couldn't tell. You hate, you have the worst what? Luck? Worst something, I can't actually read what the message says. Ooh, oh dang. It's helping it go went with dirt all the way down. There was clay there for a minute. When do I get okay? You have the worst one yet, what's the challenge? What's this oh so terrible challenge? Ooh, look, some iron. How much do I have to mine? What do I have to mine? What is the challenge? Mine 64 diamonds or something? Really not that bad. Just trade with the villagers a bit, get a efficiency 5. And if it's to get a full set of netherite armor, someone's already suggested that, so... Certainly not. Terribly creative. Getting a phantom membrane from a cat at night. It's not that bad. I don't... Is that rare? I guess that would take a long time because I have to wait for it to be night constantly. Does this lush cave biome really go this deep? Watch it be another one of those stupid little tiny caves. No, it's a full cave, and I just didn't bucket clutch. Um, is there water down here for them to spawn in? Yes, there is. Cool. Any spawn yet? Hello? Do I have hitboxes turned on? No, I don't. I would know. Oh, wait, yes, I do. I do have hitboxes turned on. I don't know. Let's see. Is there any mobs? I have it turned off, F3B. See any axolotls? None down in here. None in the, the, the damp cave. The damp cave, in English. There's gold. Gold could be used for bartering. I guess I'll mine it. Not really an efficient way of getting gold. There's nether gold is faster. I don't have any light source. Let me turn up the gamma for stream chat. Let's see. That's the wrong thing. Filters, gamma. Here we go. The gamma is up. Great. Any axolotls around? And then I can see with the hitboxes enabled, so. Hmm. Is that a water cave? No. Maybe? I don't know. There's gold here. Really need iron, but I'll take the gold. Trading in the nether will be good. I actually don't have any coal, so... Not like I can smelt more than... Here's the thing, there's a 70% just gonna catch up on. I can't read that message entirely, but I'll just wait until you push it away from the annoying heart that prevents me from reading things. That's a glow squid. Can, it, can the game not give me... Uh, I, I don't have any resource packs on, so you're completely benign. Don't magically draw my vision away from reality. Anything of note here? No axolotls, nothing. Great, love that. Oh, well, oh, there's more gold. Oh, and I just unleashed the floodgates. That's good, though, because I was worried about lava anyway. I don't know why. Still can't read your message. I'm assuming you're telling me it's very, very rare to get a... 
mm, panda membrane from a cat at night. But also, I feel like you underestimate how long it takes to beat a warden, even with using a bow and then only killing it with a sword. Still, with that tactic, it's gonna take a long time, and that's assuming I don't die, and which would make it take even longer. Oh, I got a diamond, yahoo! I really just said Yahoo. Man. Ooh, iron. I need iron. I can make my armor, assuming I have coal, which I don't. But there's lava, so I could probably smelt it with lava on the surface. 0 0.2 is a chance of you getting a fandom membrane. I like those odds. I only have to sleep, like, a, roughly a thousand times. Fine, you know? Is that an axolotl? Yes, it is! I... Thank you, game, for actually letting me pick it up. How much iron do I have? 19. Not enough. I... Dead. And, okay. Now you're dead. That's a creeper. Oh, I should have saved that. Hmm. Oh, hi. Yes, you are still chasing me. Uh, is that another creeper? Or is it a skeleton? More creepers. And that is case butters, which I do not appreciate. On top of that, Gamma Ray has bad luck. I have neutral luck. Okay, I sometimes have good luck, I sometimes have bad luck. It balances out, okay? More diamonds. Maybe I'll make myself a diamond axe. I'll make killing stuff easier. Any more diamonds around, or just the one, since... Probably just the one, since the new update now, everything is such... Rarity. Go through the mine shaft. Or I could not do that. I feel like going around the random tunnels isn't going to help me out there. I am looking for iron ore though, so... Not going deeper probably doesn't help. Since the iron ore doesn't spawn at these levels. There's lava though, that's good for smelting. Oh, speaking of iron ore. Can you die without hurting me? Too late for the without hurting me part, but it died, so... It's good enough, half of my request was completed. By me, but, you know, still, good enough. Appreciate it, nonetheless. That would have been funny if that worked, but that's not how it works. 21 isn't enough. Oh, there's the storage receptacle and then pop this and find that. Go look for some more, uh... By the way, you're on the next challenge now? Yes, I'm on Nether. I, I know, I know I'm supposed to go to the Nether, but I can just get the axolotl Go to the nether and then complete both challenges at once, and so I've technically gotten an axolotl. Even if I have to throw it on the ground and pick it up again, I still complete the challenge, so... It doesn't matter to me how I complete the challenge. Just that it gets done. Same reason I looked for the woodland mansion and did the woodland mansion with well, a uh, pillager outpost before I, uh... Or I, you know, got to the nether, or got lava, or whatever. I don't even remember what the order is. I guess I got lava. I, I, technically, I passed the lava pool before the outpost, but, you know, whatever. The skeleton bomb of a creeper, so it's useless. I go back this way. Back. I'm lost. That's a skeleton. I don't like that. Ouch. Yep, that's hurting me. And there's a second one. 
Great, now I'm gonna die. The third one. What are the chances of that? That seems odd. Can one of you shoot each other and start fighting? Nope, you're just gonna kill me? Yes. Uh, and I'm gonna die because the hole doesn't have water at the bottom, which means if I go down it, I just die. What's the solution? What's the solution? What's the solution? Mm -mm 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 -mm. I don't even know where I was. So, getting back there is gonna be hard. Not impossible, though. Use this tree I dug here. Is that gonna be solid stone? Let me get wood tools. Solution is to what? To what it would... The solution is to what? That's the question. Question is, what do I do? What is the solution? Why did that not craft? Gex it is. Also need a shovel anyway, so... Just to reset, by the way, I believe in you. Wait, glad to know that. I'm just going to... Go ahead and do a bit of... Terraforming. First time in a Minecraft speedrun terraforming is the solution. Bark in that float should be 12 off. Oh, it needs to go down one. On a straight line from here? Yes. I'm not gonna reset the run if I don't have to, since I've already sunk 44 minutes into this run, and honestly, if I can get that iron and I can get going, I, I'd be fine. I just have to get back to my stuff. You know, easier said than done, but. Nonetheless, I just got water here, which means I can go down without dying. Technically. No! Ooh. Close. I might drown, but... No, oh, there's air here. Waiting for Hightail release? That's good. Have you watched the trailer? I've been waiting for five years. Oh, trust me, I know. It's a pain to wait. I'm assuming you knew what Hightail was already, and I've been waiting that long as well, or... Or I've been waiting since I reminded you of it recently. Such a good game, I need to go down this corridor. Or it doesn't fail me, because it doesn't. Hold on, what's 30 times 30, you know, yeah, right, yeah, I retract all my messages. 3,000. Should be 3,000. Because I'm stupid. Or is it 9,000? Fuck. Probably 9,000. Eh, whatever. Uh, where did I go for that iron? Shh, crap. Correct? Is it, it's not 1,000. It's not 3,000. I was wrong. I got it wrong though, that's the, that's the problem. I can do math. Where did I go? How did I get... get where I went? I went down here and then here's my stuff. Okay. The question is how do I get back to where I was? It doesn't matter really if I can get rid of this and this. Is that it wrong? Um... I don't know. Let me check. Yes, I got it wrong. Very wrong. Yes. I prefer you don't... Yes, I know I'm wrong. I was wrong both times. The answer is 900. I do know the rules. I don't appreciate the rules. I don't understand why you chose to do this either, but yes, I, I know what you said. I have I have a memory. Where was I? How did I get here? 
knowing how I got here. I don't understand. Where's the cave I came in? It's not this one. It could be this one. Well, it's not this one, because I didn't pass any lava. Hey. There's a cave here. It was this one, because I climbed up. And so I, I, I do... Do, and so do I say goodbye? I don't know. Don't say goodbye. I'm not gonna, like, ban you or anything unless you're leaving. Bye to all the messages that you sent. Glad to hear that you're waiting for Hightail. Hightail's a good game. It's good to wait for it. One more wood for that. I'll just use the birch. Craft that and save storage space. Make the boots out of gold. My bucket back. Water. I'm not gonna die this time. And also, I need to make an iron axe because uh, your stream is destroyed. Uh, the replay is. It's gonna be kind of confusing as to why you retracted all of your messages. But, otherwise, it's not destroyed. Keep a backup. Snowballs could technically damage blazes. Anything of value over there? Maybe some diamonds? No. Doesn't matter. Gold, I just... The gold for boots. Gold boots. So that piglins don't tag me. And then I'd like a bit more iron, but... Eh, the chances that I find any is slim. Skeleton. Gosh, I hate skeletons. Oh, there's a creeper, though. Wait, shoot it. Shoot. Wait. This is perfect. This is like the ideal situation. Wait, go down there. No, go down. Wait, yes. Yes. Come here. No, what was that? What was that luck? What is that luck? Come on, guys, guys, guys. We can talk about this. We can talk about this. We can talk about this. Don't fall in the lava. Okay, creeper's too stupid to do that. And to get the creeper to come down, the skeleton dying would be hard to do. The skeleton doesn't want to die. To essentially save the skeleton, save myself. Where'd the creeper go? Creeper fall already? That skeleton is dead. Great. Whatever. No music disc for me. Creeper. Bye. Oh, never mind. There's a skeleton. Come here, buddy. Let me just get this creeper out of here. Come here. Creeper. Yo, dude. Bro. Bye. Come on. Don't blow up. It didn't blow up. Just gonna block and then get the creeper lined up in here. This is a narrow space. Can't get up, right? This is perfect. Dude, come here. You can't get up. Shoot at me. Yes. No! Why did it blow- Why? Did they do that now? They never used to do that. Did this update make creepers blow up against other mobs in retaliation? I mean, that, that makes sense, but I don't appreciate it. Because it makes getting discs, like, 40 times harder. And kind of defeats the purpose of the mechanic. <sighs> Gosh, the Minecraft devs right now want to... And, like... Just kill all of them. Not actually, but just... Gosh, dang it, man. That's so dumb, dude. 
How much can they screw up the game? It's already screwed up enough. Leave mechanics be. Don't change them. Ah, pain. Any, any more iron back in here? Nope. Oh, I'll go back this way. I think two iron is enough to get me a helmet anyway, which is what I want. No shovel, but mm, I need a shovel. Cool. And the iron goes in. The iron will come out, and then I'll get a helmet. Wonder what did you actually delete all of your messages? No, you didn't. That's fine. Fair enough. You just deleted most of them. Um up to I gotta go see ya, which would be the last message sent right now. If it weren't for the fact that I can see all the message retracted. Unfortunately I can, however. Ignoring the fact that this is a speedrun I'm doing very well. Now I actually have a way out of the cave that doesn't require me to water pillar up, which is a pain. Oh, look, I can, I can craft bone meal now. That's so good. Guys, look, my Minecraft Let's Play. It's going super well. I can craft bone meal now. And it fell. Dang it. Whatever. Let's get swimming up here. There we go. Should be able to make it to the surface. Without dying, uh, without drowning. Okay. I did without even drowning. We need a robot that just says message retracted every time I re retract a message, or anyone retracts a message for that matter. But no, probably not. I could do that, I guess. But it'd be really annoying. And then people would just spam it like you do. And no, I won't read them in a monotone voice. It'd be funny, but I won't. I gotta de-incentivize. Now, I have flint seal, right? Yes, I already lit the portal. Yes, I did. That's why it has some durability usage. Okay, now I'm ready for the nether. This time I won't die, probably. Wait, can I make a golden apple? Hang on. I'm gonna make a golden apple. No, I'm not, actually. I need to save my gold. person that uh, said BRB never came back. Yeah, they didn't. Or they did. Maybe they just haven't been talking. You know, people are allowed to just watch a stream and not talk. Not a crime. I hate the fact that I'm in a crimson forest right now because of that thing. Those stupid... The horrible hoglins. I hate them so much. Worst mob in the game, honestly. Worse than phantoms. Not that hard, though, since I don't really hate phantoms all that much. Their one requirement is that you sleep, and it's really not that hard to sleep. People just don't want to do it. Or are working or busy, whatever, but sleeping's not that hard. Oh, hi. You mad at me for mining? I wonder what he was doing running for president? Maybe. That seems like a pretty quick thing to run for president. Just, oh, BRB, let me just go run for president real quick. No, 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 I'm so glad you launched me upward instead of backwards. I hate you, I hate you, I hate you. Worst mob in the game. I hate you so much. Why do you exist? Yes, help me. Help me. I will help. I'll help. We're allies now. We're allies. We're allies now. Die. Yes. I hate you. I hate you so much, you stupid hoglin. Oh my gosh. Also, I finished the nether thing. And the any axolotl. Now I just need another fortress. I hate Hoglins so much. 
burning passion. Now I'm gonna trade with you real quick. You ready? Let's get in this hole. Thank you. Take my gold. I need your ender pearls, please. I don't need this, this, or this. Or probably this, or this, or this. That I could technically do with keeping. Fire res, three minutes, not bad. I'll probably drink that like immediately as soon as I get near any lava. Ooh, and obsidian. Not terrible. Uh, don't need it. Arrows, I'll replace the other one since I might get a bunch of these. And if I get a bow, it could be useful for the f dragon fight. Not that I plan on shooting it that much, but you know if it's flying around, it hasn't perched, I can't use my beds, might as well shoot it a bit. Uh, I have leather. I'll keep the leather just in case I need to craft a boots at any point so I can walk on powdered snow. I doubt it, uh, though. Ricks. No. Cry goes here. I need... Ender pearls. Preferably a larger number. I know there's only one of you in the hole behind me throwing trades out, but I, uh, still. Do you know you could have walked on powdered snow? Yes, with leather boots. I know, that's, that's why I'm keeping the leather. It's kind of far-fetched that I'll ever be walking on powdered snow again, but I'm keeping the leather anyway. Water bottle. Black stone. I have a leather- I have 11 cobblestone already. Oh, no. Whatever. And... Nothing? Was that really 26? Well, you probably are, uh, for the blue ice challenge. That's assuming the one I pick is the blue ice one. Which I may or may not do. Did you just throw me? String, backstone. Oh, that's good actually. Keep that in my hot bar. That is not good, however. Burn those. And then off I go. Um. Any nether fortresses? No, no. No, I suddenly have that random urge to run in this direction. It doesn't have anything to do with the hoglin chasing me right now, though. Just, uh, felt like running. No more hoglins in this direction, right? Oh, wait, it's a crimson forest biome, so there will be, because that's the definition of this biome. Not sure. Why not? Let me go through the other worst biome in the nether. Solson Valley, which is full of skeletons. And honestly, I don't know which is worse. Skeletons or hoglins. They are both terrible, so, you know. But, the uh, soul sand Valley is pretty easy to traverse despite the soul sand. And that's a fortress, which is very good for me. Hello, skeleton. I hate you. Goodbye. No interest in talking. Not feeling talkative right now. Ooh, could have just died there. That's another challenge done. Just need to do the creeper music disc thing. This is an odd fortress. Netherite is always under natural bones. That is potentially true, but I find it unlikely. That would make mining netherite kind of trivially easy, considering how many natural bones there are, and, you know, how easy they are to spot, and dig, and etc. Which doesn't seem that likely. 
And I'm pretty sure there can be more than one. I guess there can't be more than one but chunk. Ow, that hurts a lot. Despite my armor. I think now's a good time to drink the fire res potion. I'm not gonna just kill you guys without uh, discretion. You can't hurt me unless you melee attack me. First. And second laser rod. That's pretty lucky, I guess. There's more here. Won't even need to go anywhere near a spawner with how many there are here and how lucky I'm getting. Don't have any pearls, though, so that's a slight problem. And I guess it was just luck that got me the first two. Well, certainly it was. Uh, just luck that got me. Any more blaze ones? More accurately, any more gold in these chests? That's really what I could use right now. Wow, this fortress is almost entirely underground. How? Oh, you melee attacked me. I was like, oh, I guess my fire resistance over. Is that another blaze rod? That's four total. Don't know how much blaze powder there is. It's true. Okay, interesting. I'm gonna bet on that. Ooh, more diamonds. That's great. Love that. Uh, speaking of more diamonds, I'm going to decide to craft. Do I need these? I'll just kill it by hand. Craft a. You know, good old iron. Uh, a good old axe. Do that. Put this as the backup. These in a chest. Yeah, throw the snowballs too. When are challenges available? Whenever I finish getting a creeper from... Whenever I finish killing a creeper with a skeleton. And I need to grab more bread. Just a bit more bread, but I should leave one of these open, so I'm gonna do that. Do this too. We are. Love that. Any gold in here? Yes, thank you, game. More gold, more diamonds, and more obsidian. Not ten yet, but to start. There's a blaze out here? I'd like to talk to them. Hello. You kind of talk about your card extended warranty. No, I do. Uh, any blaze spawners I can see? No, it's mostly underground, it would seem. You're at the fortress. Did you submit the time? I think I did. Yes. Yes, I did. I'm currently working on a uh, creeper music disc. That's the current challenge, technically. Wait, is that guy on a roof? Yes, there's a whole lot of them on a roof over here. Are you coming to kill me, or am I coming to kill you? I'm not a fire res, so that's going to be a problem. Ow. You did not wait your turn, and I did not... Can you get up the stairs? Ouchie, 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 ouchie. And they all choose to kamikaze. Hi, are you coming over here to jump off? I need to kill that blaze. I hate blazes. Not a really good uh, profession, so to speak. Speed running if I don't like blazes. You're dead anyway. You can't hurt me if you're dead. Ouch. You can hurt me from over there, though. And I guess technically all of them only hurt you when they're dead, since they're all dead, since they're skeletons. You fell. Good for you. Um, you can fly. Get down. Get down. Please don't make me try and get a bow. Yeah, go down. Go down, otherwise I'm just gonna dodge all your attacks until you come down. Thank you. Actually listened. Didn't drop anything though. You are gonna die before you reach me. Yep, I did die before it reached me. That one, however, may not. No, it did. Good. And I just need to find more blazes, preferably inside the building, so I can stop running around almost falling off the edge of the map. Anyone? Ooh. Anyone even live in here anymore? There's two guys who are going to hurt me at the same time. Actually, neither of them hit me. 
Those ones must be the incompetent ones. Maybe they send all the competent ones outside. Huh. Ooh, I missed that before. That's unfortunate. They convert a 2, which is 10. I need 12. And that is a... Got my five piglin, so there is no blaze there. This should be an entrance to more above ground ridges, and I fell down the stairs. Regular skeleton. Good thing I didn't jump off the edge to kill it, because that was just death right there. Death incarnate. That is three wither skeletons at once. Love that. Dead and dead here. Where's the other ones? One of them jumped off. There you go. Down. How'd you do that? Oh, well, whatever. Taking up the hostile mob cat, but I don't really care that much. I'm sure, they'll spawn anyway. There's two more wither skeletons here. Watch me get enough uh, wither skeleton skulls for a wither. Oh, whoops. Missed that last one. And it's dead. Of you. Oh, you actually hit me. That's the first hit I've taken from a wither skeleton. That's unfortunate. I was hoping you'd go this whole time without being hit. Is there any blazes in this direction? Really use a blaze. Another staircase. I don't know where that leads. Anywhere? Actually, yes. Is that a blaze spawner? No. It's a dead end. This probably is a dead end, but maybe not. No, oh, it's the blade spawner. How lovely. Does every fortress have one of these? It would make sense if they did, but who knows. Oh, another one. And it hurt me before I could hurt it enough to kill it. How many do I have? Six. Is that enough? Can't that be twelve? I only need twelve. That's all I need, but maybe I should get a spare, you know, just in case. Because why not, since I'm here. Oh, hi. You're gonna shoot. You missed, but you landed one on the ground and there's one behind you two. You're both dead, but you melee attacking me is gonna deal more damage than the fire. But the fire will deal a butt ton of damage, actually. Not enough for me to warrant using my protection potion right here this wall and here nothing beyond this wall can really hurt me compared to these guys oh whoops bop running through here to go kill this one this is at the end of the hallway and I can't uh crap go down here don't hit me down here Safer. Didn't get any more blaze rods. You're gonna what? I can't read. I'm gonna be speedrun my while watching speedrun Minecraft. Great. Get your PB. That'll be good. I'm personally getting a PB for a speedrun that doesn't exist in any official records. Great. That's the spare rod I wanted. Now I have to leave. I don't have to leave. I want to leave. I could always choose to stay. Who knows? Maybe I'll have a vacation here in the nether. Well, that's not good. I have to kill a bunch of... Mm, there's another blaze, and there's more skeletons. Oh the wither skeletons, I don't mind. Wither skeletons are easy to kill. The blazes that bother me, because they have a ranged attack. I wonder if I can just run past all of them. Hmm, actually, this is working right now, which is surprising. Um, wow, I actually did run past all of them. That is the most surprising thing that's happened so far in this run. Who's gonna win, me or Gamma Ray? Um, I have my money on this Gamma Ray person. They seem pretty good at the game. I don't know, just a hunch though. Uh, hi, buddy. And you're dead. Goodbye. Thank you. I'm gonna go back into this place and back to this place because I have to get back, preferably without dying to those. Actually, I'm gonna kill this enderman because why not? I don't have a boat. I'm just gonna fight you normally. Fine. Okay, never mind. You teleported away and now I have to deal with the damn skeleton. It's honestly worse than the frickin' enderman because this enderman is the crazy to be a melee person rather than frickin' 
ranged. I keep saying frickin'. You already get a uh, head start since I haven't updated yet. Okay. I I think it's a little sad if you're having to factor updating the game in, but alright. I wonder where that Enderman were, went. I wonder if it teleported into lava. They sometimes do that. You die. I really hate you. Yeah, good. It's dead. And it didn't kill me. Anyone have an Enderman? No? Cool. I'm going back to the overworld. Actually, first I need to find a... Actually, first I need the Ender Pearls before I go back to the overworld, since the Nether is my best bet for getting Ender Pearls. I've got 12 gold. You want to trade, buddy? Yes, no, maybe so. Apparently, uh, yes, technically. So we got you in there. I don't have any pearls. Do this coal from all that those guys I killed. But there's no hoglins here. Don't have to worry about fighting them. Probably will though, honestly. She's gonna give me that and that. Not very useful now, is it? Um It's not useful either. I would like ender pearls, please. Maybe I should have withheld my gold before I started making demand for specific items. Fire charge. Wouldn't mind regular obsidian either. You know, just in case. Ba 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 da da da. Gotta wait for the. Uh, guy to be done. I don't need crying obsidian. I'm not making a respawn anchor because I don't plan on dying in the nether anytime soon. And I don't need the iron nuggets either. Not crafting lanterns. That's more obsidian. That's great and all. I think that was probably all 12 of the gold. Yes, it was. Well, time to go mine some gold. Uh, there's another guy there. There's also a hoglin there. The eight hoglins. I, you know, hadn't mentioned that already. No gold in this direction. One yet, anyway. Oop, that doesn't stop. Never mind. Wait, no, I just jumped in lava. I don't think I'm gonna die, but that was annoying. Any gold over here? Oh, there's a tiny bit, yes. One piece. Lovely. Can I stop dying? How long does the fire last? Like, jeez. Okay. Some gold. And then I need to craft a gold. No, I only have 35. My 12 wait until I have more. Always quartz. There's hoglins. The worst mob in the game. Sheesh. Anything here? Yes, actually, there's... Yeah, there's gold here and there's gold there. That must be a giant lava pit in the middle. Which I will gladly mine to the point where I'm a safe thing over and then... Bridge on over. Got a speed bridge, hence the speed run. No logic, whatnot. I actually have enough diamonds left over for a diamond pickaxe. Who'd have thunk it, getting a diamond pickaxe and a speed run? In this case, it would actually make the speedrun faster because the higher tier tool you use on nether gold ore, the more gold nuggets you get. In fact, kind of silly, but I'm gonna do it just because, you know. Right and go. Okay, good for you. Good luck to you as well. Almost wait. <laughs> you, did you hit create world expecting it to instantly create the world, but now you have to wait to make the world. That was risky. It wasn't that hard of a jump, it was just risky. Just because it was. 
same gold. This is where I jumped into that lava. And that's a baby hoglin, I think. There's an adult hoglin here. I do as much damage when I pull armor. What was that knockback? I don't know how it knocked me back in that direction when I was facing a completely different direction, but, you know, whatever. Any more stuff? Well, I might as well trade the ten I have with you. Okay, if I can trap you in a hole, that is. Where are you going? You stand there? Nope, you're moving somewhere else now. Cool, now you're stuck. Great. Now trade me ender pearls. Nothing else, just ender pearls. It's what I want. My request. That's crying obsidian. Not very useful. I'm just gonna start a fire there so I can burn whatever useless items this guy gives me. Bricks. Amazing. I wonder if they lowered the rate of pearls for these guys. Because I feel like I've gotten considerably unlucky as far as my pearl drops go. Maybe they removed their trade completely in this update. Crying Obsidian. Gravel. Spawned in a spruce forest. That's not bad. If there's a village nearby, that can be perfectly fine, actually. Out of gold. I don't have a boat, so I can't get down there. I don't have that much interest in getting down there, but... Might need to... Ooh, is that an Enderman? The same Enderman I pissed off? No. No, that hurts a little bit. Well, now you're dead. As long as nothing waltzes up and kills me, then I'll be fine. That skeleton does want to waltz up and kill me. Uh, I have a shield though, so it probably can't hurt me. That still hurt me. Oh, that was the second skeleton, because of course there's a second skeleton. No gold over here, I imagine. Just bottomless pit of death. Precarious path downward that I'm taking in order to reach gold, which hangs in the balance over certain doom down there. Which is where it dropped because I don't have inventory space. Great. Down there I go to be with the hoglins. Hmm. really don't like hoglins. I'm gonna make myself a boat. Why do I need coal? Why do I need sticks? Why do I need leather? And down I go. Off I will have to go later. There's my gold guarded by a hoglin guard. Oh, yeah, the guards guard things at logic. Yep, because you have infinite reach. Of course you do, you always do. I have had infinite reach. My mistake, I forgot you were the most OP mob in the game. Yes, yes, join in the fight. Join in the fight. Don't join in fighting me, though, as soon as I start mining this, since I know you will. That's kind of what you do. Gold hoarder. With anyone who takes gold. Even it's not your gold, it's not like you have mining rights. Let me see, let me see your permit to mine here. Ah, you're coming to kill me, yep, I knew it. Different, actually, that's a different one. The one I told not to kill me didn't come and kill me, that's fun. Creative solution. Now that one's dead and the other one's alive. Hmm. 
Choices, people. Choices. Make good ones. Any, uh... Any, any more gold? Or am I gonna have to go trade my, like, three gold to that guy? Why? I'm just gonna s you just stand there like a, like a shape NPC? I mean, you are an NPC. No thanks. I'm good. I'm gonna go towards this uh, mushroom that you hate. You smell of or whatever, since you have such a massive nose. And up here, I guess. I'm supposed to be going down to find more gold, and yet I've just come right back up. Mostly because there's hoglins down there, and I don't really have any interest in fighting hoglins for gold when I could just find some endermen and kill the endermen. And that will solve my problem. So I do currently only have one ender pearl, which is, you know, maybe less than ideal, but. Hello, how are you, Pengu? You came back. Or you weren't here. Was that Chico that was here before? Who's somebody? Somebody said they'd be right back, but welcome, Pico. Pico? Pengu. My brain. It wasn't even Pico, it was Chico. My brain's rotting a little bit. I just got here. Yep, alrighty then. Well, welcome, welcome. How are you doing? Oh gosh, oh gosh. That's deadly. Deadly is that could have been more death. I'm gonna have to kill this guy up here because I want to mine the gold. I, uh, I. You got a hit on me. Fascinating. Good to see you finally reach Nether after so many hours. I reached Nether yesterday, and then I died in the Nether yesterday. So I don't know if reaching the Nether is a good thing or a bad thing. So far, it's kind of been a... Ah, come on, dude. I thought I killed the guy that was here, but there's another one. Great, goodbye. I put my food away. Well, we're gonna splash that quick, just in case, you know, I need a alternative escape plan, such as jumping down to the lava. There's a hook in there. That's worse than this guy. Um, I'm gonna just throw him back this way casually, since that narrows the uh, route. Oh. Your anger ended? Well, I'm gonna kill you anyway, just because I don't appreciate that you hit me two times. Uh, time to go back to mining my gold, anyway. Hopefully no more guys attack me from behind. Cool. Now, now I can craft the, uh, gold. And I have seven. Great. Have I got, uh, a single pearl from a piglin? I have one pearl, but I got it from killing an enderman. I just got lucky with that. I'm starting to think they removed pearl drops from piglins in this update, which would be a really bad update to be speedrunning in in that case. And then I just have to find a warped forest, which is easier said than done, since I've got lucky with the fortress, but not with being in a warped I had 10 piece of iron in a cave, okay? Normally you don't go mining in most speedruns, but, you know, I guess you do you. The only reason I went mining in my speedruns is because it's unique. My challenge from two days ago is still up? Yes! Because I've decided I'm going to save all the challenges and then kind of just, like, make this a speedrunning category, you know? I mean, I don't have the power to, like, make it an official one on speedrun.com or whatever, but I'm just gonna keep playing. Play on 30F of V until you get an Ender Pearl from an Enderman? No. No. I'm not doing that. There's no, there's no Ender Pearls. Oh, oh, you meant, you meant on the, um, on the thumbnail? I, it's just there. I just wanted to be inclusive. I'm not necessarily actually gonna do it. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I might, I might do it, but I'm probably not gonna do it. I was just including everybody's challenge. Makes for a better thumbnail, and it's inclusive, so, you know, fair's fair. We'll see. If you suggest that once I, uh, get a disc from a 
Creeper being shot by an Enderman, then sure. It's something I found out a bit ago. Apparently, Creepers can voluntarily explode on uh, Enderman now, which... Pretty annoying, but, you know, whatever. It is what it is. Also, I have 10 obsidian now, so I'm probably gonna feel free to travel through the nether a bit till I find a uh, warped forest, and then I can grind out Enderman. And I have another uh, fire res potion, so, you know, it's good. Oh, 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 four! Okay, wait, you gave me four at once? That explains why speedrunners do this. Dang, okay, well... I guess I'll keep trading, probably, since this will be more than likely a bit faster than killing them myself. Maybe not, though, because it takes a while to mine the stuff and whatnot. And technically, I already have blaze rods and pearls, so I want to complete the challenges pretty quickly. That's not good. What's not good? That I got... I got ender pearls. I'm out of gold and you're out of... Okay. I had to leave the game because I got attacked by a spider. Or the cave or the game? The game or the cave? If you left the game by being attacked by a spider, that's... That's rough, buddy, but... I don't know why you left the game over a spider. It's like the people who leave rooms over spiders. Either kill the spider or just ignore the spider and the spider will ignore you probably. IRL, not, not in-game. In-game, the spider will come and kill you, and probably your whole family, too. Um. Not gonna risk things by... Actually, I'm gonna risk things by speed breaking here. It's a speed run. I have to do stuff speedily, so... You know. I'm joining back in, Okay. Have you come up with a tactic to avoid dying to the spider, or are you just joining back in? Just cause, why not? How did I get here? I mean, uh, aside from the obvious, which is building up, but I know I've been here before. I came from a different route. I came from this direction. Yes, I did. I came through this route, maybe? No, I didn't. Well, this is a direction to go, and then I've got ten obsidian, so I've no really reason to follow any set laws or go back to my portal. I can just kind of go wherever I want to go. Another... With three endermen, and they're not even in a warped forest. How lovely. I'll kill them all. Oh, well, you were supposed to get in the boat, but you didn't. You were too. Wow, these are really uncooperative endermen. There we go, I got one of them. And you next. There we go. Ow, I thought I would have killed you by then. Come here, enderman, I need your pearl. So that I can go to the nether, and also so I can skip, hopefully, some of the challenges. I just completing them so fast the chat doesn't have a ch chance to say anything. Oh wait, I said that out loud, and eh, whatever. It's not like I was gonna get away with that anyway. I jump on giving me a new challenge any day. Probably gonna be the fastest typed messages in the history of messages. More Crimson Forest. That's lovely. I do love Crimson Forest. You know what they have in them? Hoglands. And you know what I love? Hoglands. Obviously, since everything I've uh, displayed so far clearly shows that I just adore Hoglands. They're my favorite. They're, they're just so nice and lovely and they don't do any unreasonable amount of damage or knockback or have an unreasonable amount of reach or, you know, any of those things. Etc, etc. Oh look, that's a lot of gold. That's literally eight eight pieces of nether gold. Which converts to a lot with diamond. Oh, it was actually ten. That's even more. Oh, but you want my head now because I mined some gold. I can probably still outrun you and heal up to full health and then turn around and just 
pop you in two hits. Yeah, bye. Yeah, I'll probably have to find a new uh, Pikmin to trade with now, but I don't really care. Just need the gold to hopefully get a bit of uh, Nipperls. What I really want is a warp forest so I can just kill Endermen for Ender Pearls, because at this point I honestly think that'll be faster than trying to trade, because trading doesn't seem to get me anywhere very quickly. It just kind of gets me somewhere, sort of slowly. I died as soon as it became nighttime. Oh, well, usually in a speedrun you don't really want to let it become nighttime. But I guess if you're just beating the game and not really doing a speedrun, then speedrunner tactics don't apply, so do what you want. Normally you reset the world until you get a village, and then go straight to the village, and then you kill the iron golem, you get a bucket, find a lava pool, make a nether portal, make sure you have as many beds from the village as possible, go to the nether, playing RL crap on hardcore, just start a new world, and I'm still not dead. That's good! How many days has it been? And have you been hiding in a hole the whole time? That's the real question. No judgment, though, I'm probably not that much better at RL Craft, or at any good at RL Craft, for that matter. Um, I'm gonna go down. Go here first, though, we'll look around. That wasn't even gold that I came down here for. Dang. Whatever. Well, that's a bit more gold in my pocket. Five days, and I got iron armor, uh, and, and I'm just different, okay. That seems reasonable for five days of the game to have gone iron armor. Let go up over here. Where's over? Oh, there's no warp forest. There's not going to be a warp forest, is there? And this skeleton one shot with the one ar with iron armor. Did they really do that much damage? Oh hi, this was not a good place to boat into. I really hate hoglets. Nope. Oh, what? Why'd you stop attacking? Is there a mushroom somewhere nearby? Eh, whatever. The problem with a forest is that the villagers don't spawn in spruce forests. Yes, they do. They can spawn in tigers. And welcome, welcome, Mr. Oglin. Ow, I fell. Ow, now I'm getting shot. Why are you shooting me? I have iron, I have gold armor on. And iron armor on, but... Oh, well, that guy's dead now. I think he was trying to shoot the Oglins, not me. Oh, you're dead now. I really hate Oglins. I'm just gonna go past this one, honestly. Assuming I can. Assuming I have a reason to look here other than to get away from that one hoglin when there's more hoglins up there. Yay, I love hoglins. Hoglins, hoglins everywhere. Best biome in the game. Everyone loves the Crimson Forest, because... Yep. Uh, new world, here we go. Yep. Well, better luck to you. Hopefully you spawn next to a village so that you can actually do well. Like Crimson Forest? Why? Why do you like it? It's not aesthetically pleasing. Pleasing? Pleasing. It's not aesthetically pleasing. It's pretty gross. It's red and fleshy. Um, and... There's piglins everywhere, so if you don't have gold armor, it's death sentence. There's hoglins everywhere, so if you breathe 
and aren't covered in uh, warped fungus, it's a death sentence. And uh, there's lava and holes and canyons and trees that get in your way. And there's no endermen in it, so, you know. And also, other mobs spawn there, like ghasts and... Uh, why are you attacking me? Aren't you supposed to run away after your first hit? Oh no, it's after my first hit on you. Well, I'm gonna kill you now, so... Maybe that wasn't a wise choice. Line up all the gold, so I can trade it. Got a slow run, so I can fast run. appear out of the blue to try and kill me for mining gold. I'm just gonna mine it anyway. And I'm gonna make you docile by giving you gold. Come in here. Everyone, everyone come in here. No, no, everyone come in here. Everyone come in here. Don't, only some of you. Kill this one and I'll keep the other two alive. Lovely. Good idea. Glad they suggested that by all filing in there neatly. Look at that one, that one guy did. Filing in neatly. Kind of... Oh, you're suddenly neutral now. There you go. Only sunk like 50 arrows into me and almost got rid of my gold armor. Oh, whoopsie daisy, I guess. Now I'm giving you a ton of gold. Please give me enough pearls to leave this place. I don't want to be in the nether anymore. I really hate being in the nether. I've got 15 trades with each you, 30 total, and the chances that I get... Uh, 7 more pearls is kinda low, I just need one of you to give me 4 and the other to give me 3, which I know is possible since one of you gave me 4 before. So, all you gotta do is both get reasonably lucky with your trades and just give me... What I want, which is pearls. Obsidian is nice and all, but I already have ten, so I just need pearls. Just pearls. Pearls, please. Pearls, pearls, pearls. Oh, they did give me pearls. Now I only need, uh, what, three more? Oh, someone actually gave me four. Four. Someone gave me four, and I need three from one of you. That was my request, so... Either of you want to give me three pearls instead of more arrows? Nope. Are we out of gold yet? Yes, we just ran out of gold. That was the last batch. Great. Great. I just need three more pearls, and all I needed was one of them to give me three more pearls, but instead didn't happen, and instead there is now a bunch of hoglins near me that I don't want to be near because I hate hoglins. There's more hoglins. Another wastes biome where I don't have to deal with hoglins. Let's go. I love that. I love that about this game, how sometimes there's biomes hoglins don't exist because uh, not every biome has to have freaking hoglins in it. Except for this one. This one has hoglins in it. Mm. I've spent way too long ranting about hoglins. The problem is they're all around me. It's hard not to talk about them. Maybe they're, maybe they're that kind of influence for influencer. They're not influencers. They're, they're mobs. They're like point stands. They're the kind of people who don't care what attention they get. Good, bad, they just want attention. It's mostly bad because they're mobs and also they're hoglins. Because the hoglins are the worst mobs. Just the worst. That's, I've officially labeled them worst mob. They earned the worst mob of the year award. And I need to make a new crafting table. It's like my sixth new crafting table. Six more gold. I got the other- I got the last set of pearls with 30 gold. 
bars. How many will this one take? Hmm. Gassed. I just want I hit that one. Not that one, but this one comes to the lava and hit that one. And I miss. So far away. Where's the gold I need to mine? Right there. Can you go away for a second, buddy? I don't really do that much damage. Mostly just worry about you deleting some of my gold. The fire is doing more damage than the actual fireball hitting me. How funny is that? We're just gonna leave now. Just as I love the nether waste, there are a lot more piglins in the crimson forest. Just the problem is that there's also hoglins in the crimson forest. They're there. They, they are what they are. gold around. A whole bunch of gold, actually. No more piglins, though. I guess I could just walk back over to the Crimson Forest, grab piglin or seven, trade. What I need. Problem is, I have 15 gold, and it took 30 before. You might say, well, it was 15 per piglin, but it doesn't really matter as far as statistics go. They both have an equal chance of giving me pearls, since I use them both of them, it's still an equal chance, and therefore it still took 30, it just was twice as fast. Same, same lack of likelihood, just you know, twice as fast. Guaranteed, but I did get some with 26, I think, at some point. So, it's gold over here. More gold, obviously. That lava scared me for a second. Um, as it does. That's control, not shit. 32 should be enough for one more thing, and that would not be any piglins. No, there are piglins. Cool. My uh, my armor is intact, so you shouldn't be pissed at me. I just have to get one of them to trade. And I have to get my armor not to break in the next couple. Oh, wait, that's not two blocks deep since it's on a slope. Oh, he didn't fall in. Please, armor, just don't break. Why are y'all so sporadic right now? Why are you in such a sporadic mood? Take damage. I don't care. Uh, and 32. Any want, any of you want to run over here and pick up this gold? Nope, it's gonna go exactly as fast as one of them can trade. I don't want to run over and do that. Whatever. It's fine. Um, I can wait a bit. Huh. <sighs> Give me the pearls. Give the pearl. Give, give them. Give, give. Getting desperate at this point. I hope that baby doesn't drop down the hole and steal my gold. Since for whatever reason they made it so that the babies just steal gold. Don't know why. start crafting those. Not gonna. Gotta wait. Excuse me. Yawn. Oh, I should have kept the crying obsidian so that fighting the inner dragon would be easier. I think two is an I think two obsidian is enough though. Actually, ooh, soul speed three. Wow, I could totally enchant something with my anvil that I definitely have. I don't, but I wouldn't be. I wouldn't mind soul speed three if I have to do any other challenges afterwards. So I might as well carry it around as another one of those like useless items I just carry around, since I have a, a number of those, um, like the axolotl or uh, those apples that I don't need. 
think I only need two obsidian. Not certain on that, though. Don't need crying obsidian. Need pearls is what I need. Excuse me, I yawned again. Double whammy. Just gotta wait until I get pearls. Pearls, pearls. Waiting for pearls. Oh, that was obsidian. Interesting. Don't need obsidian, but now I can make a 12, a 3x3 three three portal if I wanted to. Don't know if that's really a good use of my time, but I could. I'm not gonna, because having extra obsidian is nice for the end fight. Um, I literally have a diamond pickaxe, though, so if I really need obsidian, I can just mine it. Nope, don't need more arrows. Don't even have a bow, actually, so, you know, kind of useless, but I guess I can get a bow. Hello, there's a mummified piglin that just came up, stared at me, and then walked away. That's funny. Okay, I was gonna say, was that really 30? How, many, how much more gold do you have down there? None? That was like 30 gold, and you give me a single pearl? What is this game, dude? What do I gotta do to get pearls in this game? More gold, more gold, more gold to trade for pearls that may or may not get, um, that may or may not exist, and these guys are all gonna get mad at me for mining with gold. I'm just gonna trap them in a hole before they do. Yeah, yeah, just, just go down in there. No, 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 yeah, just, oh, yeah, just go down in there. And then don't mind me, I'm just gonna kill your children real quick. Probably your children, I don't know. They could just be baby piglins, they might just be around. I guess they're gonna be pissed off at me. That's good, because I don't move them in whatever direction I need them to move. Ow, oh, you broke my gold armor, oh no. They'll be mad at me, chat, oh no, whatever will I do. Not, not, eh, not, not beings of this world being mad at me. I, I would be so guilty and ashamed. How could I? I need my crafting table back. Find some gold over here. We all settled when I throw, like, ten pieces of gold down in the pit. That's realistically all I'm going to be able to throw down the pit. I oh, know 12, that's so much better. Now you can each do 6. You didn't even let me give me your offer. There you go. Peace offering. So shiny, great. Trick them. Give me ender pearls. I need shoes. Take down 65 blocks and you'll find netherite? Yes. I could do that. Or I could continue the speed run. Um, you know, since that's what I was doing. Speed running. Any pearls down in there by any chance? I'll go down and sort through myself. You stole my shoes. Those shoes were meant for me. I just throw out my right diamond axe. Y'all better not kill me. And where's my iron axe? I swear. Idiots. I say idiots, even though they almost killed me. Um. There's my diamond axe back, but I like those shoes since I don't actually have uh, gold armor anymore. I might as well get the soul speed, you know? Seriously, no uh, 
No under pearls? Wow, that sucks. Well, time to leave. Trust you? Oh, well, this sucks. Good thing I'm quick thinking. And also, good thing I was carrying that. Get that one out, just in case. That one's not as fast acting. But, you know, it is what it is. Someone clip that, by the way. Any... I guess I'll just mine gold. I think would like a warp forest. He's probably gonna wanna hurt me. Yes. Go in that hole. You run away naturally when I start mining blocks. I mine blocks, do you run away? What what did you run away from? That's my question. The zombified piglins? Are they scared of zombified piglins? Huh? <laughs> this is funny, look, the zombified piglins are tormenting it. it. Really wants to kill me for not wearing gold, but it's too busy uh, being tormented by... Oh, wow, that actually hurts. Oh, look, I'm standing next to a zombified piglin. He couldn't possibly hurt me. Oh, no, come over here. That's really stupid of you. Wow, that was... That actually worked. I just dug a hole and it ran straight into it. That's funny. Did anyone clip that thing before? Can you clip things? Mine isn't actually not showing the clip option. Maybe it's under settings. I really remember. Please kill the dragon with a potato named Benjamin the Third. Well, that would require an anvil, which sounds like the most painful thing anyone requested yet. But I guess it's better than killing the warden. Now I, I forgot my crafting table again. Wow, I'm really good at this. Or getting the crafting table part, not not anything else. Would you like a bribe? Please give me pearls. I know it's only six, but... That's, that's gravel. You can have that back if you want. And that's blackstone. You can also have that back. I found a village. Yes, it's so rare in bedrock. Oh yeah, you're on a Chromebook. I forgot. Are villages really more rare on bedrock? I find that hard to believe, but... Mm, whatever. I guess it's bedrock. You know, you never know. You know, you never know. Yes, well, yeah. Sentences are kind of breaking down at this point. More blackstone. That's not nice of you. Any more... Any more, uh... Any more... Any warp forests of this area? Yeah, wow, the sentences are really breaking down. I'm... And all the crops are fully grown. Yep, that sounds like bedrock to me. Cursed as always. Guess I can't be talking. Sometimes crops are fully grown in Java villages too. Weird glitch. Probably something with the structure block. Another quartz. Soul sand. Hi, Zomify Piglin. I'm out of water in my main water glass. Now I get to actually use my backup. And that's a water bottle. Mm -mm -mm. I do love some water. Great. Feeling refreshed. Just drank some water IRL too, so... Yeah, whatever. No more gold on the ground? Great. Oh, well, there's one over there, but it's one. Much rather check over this horizon to see if there's a... Well, there's not, in fact, a warped forest over here. Means I'm going to have to get, uh, get my own ender pearls. And by that I mean trade for somebody else's. More mining of gold. And 
bartering with piglins. Even though it's the slowest, most boring, annoying process known to man. And it also doesn't always work. The chance that they actually give me a three ender pearls, which is all I need. Wow, also that lava just kind of popped up out of nowhere. The speedrun is going so poorly, but you know, considering everything I've had to do, it's not going horrendously. I'm just been getting insanely unlucky with my uh speedrun bartering. Oh look, more friends! They're already down in a hole, actually. Hang on, let me just... Real quick, hang on. Guys, stay right there. No, 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 stay down there. Here, wait, 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 wait. Bar, uh, here. There you go. Just, and while you're busy, you can just... Try and... Ow! Ow, ow, ow! Crap, ow, crap, 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 crap. Take that, take that, stop being mad at me, take that, go take that, thank you. I didn't mean to pick it up before, actually. Down in a hole, too. Did any of you throw out a pearl before? No, you threw out this pair of boots here, one of y'all can wear that, I don't care. I'm here for the pearls that you probably won't give me. You out of, no you're not out yet. Now you're out, right? Pearls? Nope. You're back being mad at me. Okay, well, I'll leave you two there. In case there's any nearby gold. I guess there's a bit right here. That I can mine. Tiny bit. Literally, like, two more. Which is worth how many ingots? Three, apparently. Okay, interesting. Three ingots worth right there. Is that a four block jump? Yeah, that was. Cool. Nice. Look, I have one iron ingot. Don't need it. I'll throw it out, but I have it, so. Cool. Anyway, you guys want three more gold ingots? Oh, yeah, shoot me. I don't really care. I'm just here to trade. Give me. Three more ender pearls, please. Oh look, you got some obsidian down there, actually. Not bad. Oh well, I'm about to die. Ow. I don't kill me. I'm not interested in restarting the run because I die with all my stuff in a hole, like a thousand blocks into the nether. No thank you, I'm good. I'd rather just have to look for new piglins than die. Am I out of bread? Out of food, I've got nine apples. Well, I'm out of bread. I've got nine apples, so I'm not out of food. I'm just out of that in particular. Ah, which means I need to find somewhere else. I might have to go into the overworld, and I'm probably not gonna have enough food to get to the end portal. There's three endermen here. Made iron boots. What is killing me? You guys are killing me. This is my iron axe, my diamond axe. Thank you for dying so quickly. Anyway, where's my boat? I need to kill these uh, endermen and get exceedingly lucky. That is to say, I need them. Oh, okay, thank you, boat. It's not who you were supposed to capture, but I appreciate it because now I don't have to do that. Um, please. Thank you. Give me pearl. You did not. Technically, I can beat the game with nine eyes of ender. Technically. But that could also be said about one eye of ender, or zero eyes of ender, since you could always just find the stronghold and then get a full thing. You're rich in bedrock? With having, by having iron boots? Pretty low bar, I would say. I don't have gold boots anymore, so. Getting pretty sick and tired of this. I might go for a nine... Uh, Eye of Ender run. Let's see if I can't beat the game with 9 Eyes of Ender. Or 10. 10 works. It's gonna be close. I might have to, you know, craft. Uh, I might have to grab a few pearls before I uh, pop over to the other side, but it's technically doable. 
And it's a better shot than wasting more time in the nether. I'm gonna go ahead and build myself a portal. What's my Y level at? My Y level's fine. I'm at about a thousand blocks out, which means I'm gonna end up 8,000 blocks out, which is not great. I don't think. I don't even know where. I don't know where in the overworld the end portal spawns, but don't build it. Too late. I know I'm going to be far away from the stronghold, but I'm hoping I am not that far away from the second stronghold. Yes, it is in this direction, which is actually north, and I got it back, which is great. The fact that it is directly in this direction means either I'm very far away from it or very close to it. Um, if anyone wants to look up how horribly I just screwed up by building that portal, feel free to do that. I know you want to, Penguin, since I probably messed up pretty badly right there, but you know what? Whatever. I don't have a saddle. I, for some reason, I thought I had a saddle from a, the fortress. I was going to just ride that horse to victory. Stronghold at... How do you know that? You don't have my seed. How do you... How would you know that? Are you just guessing? Hey, you don't have my seed. I'm confused. You don't have the seed of the world, so... How would you know that? Is that just a guess? But, well, let's see. It's not that far away. Um, those coordinates seem really precise. Oh, that's only a thousand blocks away. That's not that bad. You know, I did okay for not knowing what I was doing at all, even remotely. Only gotta travel a couple, not even a thousand blocks in this direction, like 700. Well, actually 700 this, uh, less than 700 this way, a little more than 700 that way, etc. That means the stronghold's is like really close by. So... I'm out of food, so I'm probably gonna have to kill a bunch of cows here in a second, but or pigs. Or pigs. Eat pig. Or if I stumble across a village, I can always just mine. I'd really prefer to stumble across a village. Because stopping to smelt kind of uh, there's me. Any villages here? Just gonna grab the meat anyway. In case there's no village around here. Oh, I still have to get the creeper and the music disc. I shouldn't have slept. Hmm, whatever. I guess I'll spend the day looking around. I could get the disc in the dungeon, and then complete the other two requirements, and then go into the end. And if I complete those challenges fast enough, no one will suggest an extra challenge in time. If I just press the button three times. Oh, I can re oh I've had the gamma up this entire time on the stream. And put that back down. Hang on. Back to normal. There we go. Okay, cool. Any... Anything over here? No. I want to make myself a bit of dinner. Do need lava, though, since I don't have any, uh... Eh, whatever. I'll just... i just... I'll just take my sweet time. It's not like I'm going anywhere. I just tried to make stone pants. 
um, yeah. Six, that's four. And the chest, golden pickaxe says I'm breaking three and efficiency three. How does this have two enchantments? Can, can portal chests have things with two enchantments? Eh, who knows? I'm not, I don't, I haven't read the wiki on portal chests. Um, I'm gonna be right back, chat. I gotta go to the bathroom, and this stuff has to smell anyway, which is pretty boring, so I'll be back. Okay, I'm back, chat. I am indeed back, and that's ready. See, and there we go. Hey guys, what do you think? What do you What do you need for mining obsidian? You need a diamond pickaxe. You shouldn't mine obsidian though. You should just lava cast. That's the better tactic. What do you think about global warming? It's a serious problem that should be taken seriously. Okay, I can sacrifice one thing by thing. Oh wait, I needed that wood. No. This does make me a smoker, right? Yeah. I am back. Welcome back. Thank you. I'm a smoker now. What would I do as president? Um I don't know. Probably a lot of things, but I don't really want to go into politics. Pass a bill that prioritizes renewable energy and practices, like putting uh, fees on emissions. I like from cars, because cars aren't the predominant uh, problem. Anyway, welcome back, uh, Chico. Love the stream open, alright. Uh, that's what Goliath is doing. I'm waiting for it to be night time so that I can get uh, some rain function so I can get uh, creeper and skeletons. I need wood. Where did I put the wood at? Eh, whatever. Just cook it more. I'm gonna cut down a tree, get more wood, then I can make another smoker. I need another smoker. Ah, this is really deep dirt. There we go. I need... Up I go. And I need to... Yeah, a smoker. And... Do that. Oh, that was already done anyway. Great. I'll uh, split this up and that will go twice as fast. And then I think I'm gonna go all the way to the stronghold and do the skeleton thing in the stronghold. I'm probably going to have to set up some kind of elaborate machine in order to get all the guys into the correct positions and for the creeper not to explode. 
and I have steak and pork. And actually, there's still pork cooking. I'm not, I'm not gonna take this with me. There's no way I need that. Uh, actually, it's probably a safer bet than carrying these apples. Just to carry two smokers in case I ever need to make more stuff. Um, apparently, I am going the right direction. According to chat, according to Pangu, it is somewhere in this direction. It's at negative 8, 20, 214, and 3, 214. 3.32.14, I guess, would technically be the correct way of saying that. 3.214. Um, so. Somewhere in this direction. I mean, that was the direction it went, so I'm gonna assume. And I'm gonna assume it's at least a 2i portal. Hopefully a 3i portal in case the last one I throw breaks. Just to confirm it is in fact at those coordinates. And that you didn't just give me random coordinates that happened to be in the direction I was going. Oh, ruined portal. That's fun. Chest. Nothing significant. Could have been an enchanted golden apple, but wasn't. Since those can go in Ruin Portal Chests, I've actually got one in the Ruin Portal Chest before. It's pretty rare, though. Probably can spawn on just about every chest in the game. Look, it's almost nighttime. Or it's about to rain. Or both. I don't really care either way. I need it to be nighttime for skeletons and creepers. And... Rain bothers me, but I'll hopefully be in the end pretty soon. As soon as I get that music disc. Then I'll just auto-complete the ones after that, and then the only chance to uh, give me an extra challenge will be after I complete the portal. So unless I can complete the portal beforehand, and then all I gotta do is make sure nobody manages to get a challenge in before it's over. Now, back this way. I passed it. Apparently. You sure about the coordinates? According to this, I passed it. Not sure how long ago I passed it. But I'm gonna go a decent way this way. Then throw another one. Yeah, it's further back this way. That one, however, broke, which means I need at least three. Ugh. That's not good. Nice. Miss. Nice. At least a 3 eye portal, which, knowing my luck, probably won't get. I don't have the potato name Benjamin the Third. No, I don't, because technically, like I said, you can only submit a challenge after I've completed another challenge, which means you can't just say the challenge at any random time during the stream. New challenges added after each main one is complete. Send a message in chat to submit a challenge. It means I have to complete a main challenge first. And then, I have to pick from all the challenges everyone has submitted, preferably at the time of which I can complete the main challenge. Then I pick it. And it's over here. And that damn break, fortunately, so. It's somewhere here. Probably, like, right down over here. Is that a pink sheep? That's a pink sheep. Well, that's a pretty rare sight. That should be, like, right here underneath this thing. Okay, it's gotta be, it's gotta be under this lake. No, not a second one, dude. It, it's under this lake, I don't even care. I'm going down somewhere over here. And I'm down to eight, which means it has to be at least a four-eye portal, which chances of that are low. It was already a low chance for a three-eye portal or two-eye portal, now it needs to be a four-eye portal. 
I should be like a 12 eye portal. That'd be great. I'm gonna run down though. I'm gonna get my water bucket out. Okay. Oh, Never know. I just don't even know if I'm gonna hit it. I'm just assuming it's here because I had two things that basically pointed directly in this direction. Right here. And I, I don't doubt it's here. Just, you know, if, if I missed, uh, if I miss it, then I'm gonna have to look around and that's gonna be a pain. And I'm in deep slate, which is bad. I think it can spawn in deep slate layer, but I'm not sure. I don't know. I think I recall having one that was in deep slate layer. I just don't remember exactly. Don't think, however, that it spawns at bedrock level, which is where this is taking me. Amazing. Okay. What high level do strongholds spawn at? Genuine question. What why that one? I'm gonna have to go up and spend another potential eye of ender anyway. I least would like to know what why the world spawns at so I can you know, search accurately. Oh boy. Super music is flying up here. I have to get out of this pit. I dug for myself. I was expecting to either fall into a cavern, fall into the actual stronghold, and instead I'm swimming up out. Seriously, does anyone know the Y level that they spawn at? If they spawn at a specific Y level, I can just like strip mine at that level instead of having to dig a ton of holes down or whatever. Using my uh, last eyes of ender to determine where it is. I don't know, I have to spawn more endermen and craft more. Currently, I have enough for since I have four. The foresight to grab extra. And I'm out. Okay. There's a creeper there. Of course, I need a skeleton. Shouldn't be that hard. Oh, that one blew up, but. Here's another eye. Trust me, the portal has five eyes exactly. How do you know? I find that highly unlikely that it has five eyes exactly. Moreover, what happens? What happens if it doesn't break? Then it doesn't matter. Yes, skeleton. Yes, creeper. No, 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 no. No, there's a wolf. No, wolf. I'm gonna kill you, wolf. I'm genuinely gonna kill the wolf because it is crucial for the speed run. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Everything that's gonna try and kill my skeleton. No, there's another one. Get out of here. I don't care. I'm cruel. I'm sick. I know. I killed two dogs. Don't lecture me. No, skeletons. Don't lose aggro. Get over here. Yes. 
Come shoot me. No, shoot me! Shoot me! For the first time in the history of mobs in Minecraft, I want you to attack. It's almost daytime. Come here. Yes, I don't care. I threw my axe. Yes. Don't explode, creeper. Come here. Come here. Sure. Yeah. Run. Run all the way there. Yeah. Cre Skeleton, stop having insane movement speed. Why do you have such insane movement speed? You're in the water. You can't die. You're gonna sink down so low you can't get back up out, but hey, whatever. I don't care. You look like I care. No, don't explode. Come on, skeleton. Walk up out. Yeah, there you go. Climb. Climb up out. Creepers, don't get out of the water. Yeah, I know. I know that's what you're gonna do. Can you hit this, the creeper? And can the creeper not explode when you hit it? Shoot. Fire the bow. Yes. I should also hit it with my axe. That way, when you shoot it from over there, you'll do shoot, fire. What kind of crappy archer are you? To shoot, shoot in my direction. Shoot the shoot, hit the creeper. Just clip it, clip its toe. It's so close to being dead. I just need you to shoot it one more time. Come up, hop, hop, little hops, underwater hops. Just underwater hop your way out. Just hop your way out, skeleton. <laughs> You can do it. Get the hops. Yes, just... Yes! Yes! Yes, give it to me. I don't care about this stone axe. Okay, that's it. That's it. Done. I have... I have blaze rods, and I have pearls. Okay, now I just have to get down there. For one of you who decides to add another challenge. My speedrun is going well. Good. My speedrun is going way better than it has this whole time. Because I am two challenges away from beating it. Assuming none of you do anything cool. Went that way. Okay. Creeper. Uh, you're gonna have to be a witch hut? I have to find a... You have to be more specific. Beat the ender dragon with a potato named Benjamin the Third. I... I... Okay. Witch hut is because the... Hmm. That's not specific. You just said witch hut. You didn't say find a witch hut. You just said witch hut. So we are going to pause the timer and I'm going to add beat the ender dragon with Benjamin the Third. Edit splits. And I'm going to add under portal Benjamin the Third. How's it spelled? Ben Jamin. Ben Jamin. Third. With the potatoes specifically. I should have picked up that potato that that. Gosh dang it, dude. Well, I'm gonna go find a village anyway. Wait, let me find the portal in the stronghold first. Is it, where did it go? Did it go down? I think it went down. Yes, it did go down. Okay, well, we are gonna go down and... Can this not be a water cave? Like, damn. And really, haven't I had enough trouble? I'm gonna go down, and I'm gonna find this stronghold, and then I'm going to go to a village to get a potato. And then I'm gonna- I need enough iron, so maybe I'll mine some iron while I'm down here. Get some coal, since I also need that, actually, if I'm gonna craft a frickin' stupid thing. I- whatever. Need cobble, because I'm gonna have to craft a bunch of furnaces. 
I need a ton of iron because I have to make an anvil so I can name a potato. Need 31 pieces for an animal. Yes, since I need... What? I need 27 and 4. Yes, that's 31. There you go. Your math is right. First, I want to find the stronghold, though. But, oh, look, perfect. Don't need this anymore. There we go. 31 pieces won't be that bad in this update. Got eight already. I'll get three more from the golem when I get there. So really, I only need thirty, which is actually twenty-eight. So I only need twenty-eight. Graduate kindergarten always know my math is correct. Do I always know my math is correct? Okay, I guess. But everyone makes mistakes. This is a cave system. This would probably be more reliable for finding. The stronghold, and easier for getting the iron I need. Oh, yes, there's the stronghold, as I said. And it's dead. Great. Who did challenges? I completed those challenges already. And none of you suggested any quick enough, so... So we get to do add two challenges? No. Actually, I guess you might. But I already finished them, so they're past. So, hmm. I don't know. Maybe? I guess they're my rules. My original ruling is, no, you don't get to add any, because I beat those quicker than you could suggest new ones, which means, you know, obviously you missed your chance, so. Ow. Ow. For the audience? For the chat? Maybe. Only problem there is that I don't really owe you anything. Um... Mm hmm. Uh, da -da 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 down the stairs. Come give me a potato so I don't have to leave this cave. It still blew up. I didn't break the chest. How kind of it. I don't know if about you there. To be honest, this is Ray the Eyes. Just wants to see you suffer, man. I was. Mentally from this challenge because he's really the person who's seen you suffer. Okay, yeah, that sound that checks out. Um, like that. yeah, that make that makes sense. Um, this place doesn't have iron, and I'm not holding a sword. Uh, but it does have chests with books in it. Breaking three, not bad, and an armor trim I like. Is that masochism? Uh, I don't think so. Yeah, pro hopefully not. Um, I would sincerely hope not. And I also want this, because I think I is one of the best-looking ones. And, uh, you know, if I ever go to a village, might as well. More. Yay. Breaking 3 and Soul Speed 3. Oh, I have Soul Speed 3 books, so I don't really need this. Keep this, though. Because I'm getting an anvil anyway. I might as well enchant something. Um... Should think back there. What well, kind is because you're actually hurting yourself mentally? Nah, eh, I'm not that much. The challenges aren't the mental strain, it's the fact that I'm spending so long. I'm not enjoying this. I am enjoying having viewers, but I don't really. I'm completely indifferent as far as uh, the actual challenge goes. I, I could be streaming. The, the, Mario 64 right now, and I wouldn't care if people are watching. I'm happy. So, you know, take that how you will. 
I think the portal is probably over here somewhere. Even if it isn't, there's a cave here, which means more iron for me. Probably, anyway. Yes, there's more iron for me. Not a lot, just one. And more cave. More cave, more iron. More iron, closer to getting an anvil, closer to naming a potato. Benjamin. Just like tank... Uh, just like techno, I think. And... Uh, not actually, since the technical definition of masochist is kind of iffy, but yeah, Techno was pretty resolved and willing to endure a lot of painful stuff to for views and for Minecraft and gaming and whatnot, you know, etc. Very commendable. It's kind of unnerving how how many times this year I've been compared to techno. Uh, I've got thirty, which is should be enough, assuming I find a village. But otherwise, it's not, and I won't be finding a village anytime soon. So you know, whatever. I'm just gonna grab enough since I'm here. I'm gonna go up, out, and I need to find, could be a potato? No, just coal, but I'll take the coal. No potato, though, I do need a potato. Dead end. I need to find, dead end, I need to find the portal. Since my next goal is partially the portal, also partially finding potato. I'll just get some extra iron, because why not? Smelting it will give XP. So I think I already have enough XP. Is there a secret room here? No. Oh, yes, maybe? No, this is a staircase. There's a mine shaft below me. Should I go in? Depends. Is it needed for your speedrun? That was so useful. Three gold. I need a helmet, I guess. Got the broken one too, though. Anything of note back here? There's a door that leads nowhere. Did I mention you need to kill it just with the potato? I don't know if you're allowed to clarify things. Because technically your challenge was beat the ender dragon with a potato not deal 100 percent damage to the ender dragon with a potato which are very different things so mm, i don't know e yeah mm, you might have wanted to be more clear with your challenge there but you know whatever And I would say, still being with a potato can mean that either way. Yes, it can mean either way. And I took it to mean the one way because you weren't more clear. So, you know, we can play who's right for the whole time. But I think part of the fun of this challenge is me trying to outsmart chat. So I'm going to take it the uh, former and uh, not, not going to beat it with a potato 100% of its health because you know this run's already cancerous enough you know maybe maybe I could change the definition up and try a run where I have to kill it completely with a potato but technically you didn't say that when you gave the this first uh the first one also that's where the false wall is not elsewhere what is what is this oh hi oh hi that hurt. Oh look, my entire armor set is getting replaced. This is great. I'm gonna have full armor for- oh, whoops. Either way. I'm gonna have full armor for the thing. For the thing? For the fight. Anything? Yeah, my bad. Beat it how you want. Okay, fair enough. I'm- I- I- I'm probably not gonna beat it exclusively with a potato. Since that's... Not easy at all. Even remotely. Oh, hi. That's a silverfish. 
That doesn't mean I'm near the portal, but I wish it did. Okay, you got a tiny hitbox, so I'm not even gonna bother critting you, because I can just one-tap you anyway. Okay, that's where I found that secret. Let me... Let me find another one of those rooms. Am I down? Where am I? How... How... Where's the rest of the stronghold? I know there's more to the stronghold. Ooh, what's this? What's with this? Does this room just have, like, an underground? After you beat the potato, bring a shulker to the overworld, please. Well, that can be the challenge after I beat the dragon. That does sound cancerous, but at least it's not like beat the warden with a sword or something stupid. Not stupid, but stupidly difficult. You know what I mean. Obviously, I don't think that challenge stupid. I mean, it is, but you know what I mean. It, it, whatever. Iron sword or bucket for portal? Iron sword or bucket? Bucket. Get a bucket. It's a speed run. Can you drop a potato, please, sir? Didn't, but it was worth asking, I guess. The spider. This doesn't lead anywhere. No, it doesn't. There's no secret room. There's a secret room here. This is just a regular room. Um, I should really break the iron doors I've been through. Different staircase, different direction. This isn't the way I came. This is a direction, but it's not the way I came. I wonder where the... Where's the stronghold? Why does this room have no functional buttons? Hmm. I wonder what a good way of finding the portal room is. Oh, there's there was no other door connecting to this place, though, so... No reason to be here. Doesn't every stronghold, like, have two libraries or something? It's going to be so sad if the portal has no eyes. Yeah, it is. Uh, it needs to have four eyes, otherwise I'm going to have to spend a while grinding. But honestly, I have to go to the surface anyway, because I need to get a potato. So, you know, it's not that bad. It's bad, but realistically, it's not gonna. And realistically, I'm going to go to the surface. What is this? Where is this? What is the purpose of this? Okay, well, I'm just gonna start blocking off directions it can't be. Because I gotta narrow it down a bit, you know? It's not down this way. Uh, okay. Prop is not in this direction. Not BRB. I'm back. You know, there's a chance for the pool to be between walls, so you got a mind to enter it. Oh, interesting. Has my th has my timer been paused this entire time? Yes, it has been. That's unfortunate. So, I'm not resetting. I'm just saying I'm not resetting, but... Okay, that was a potential doorway, which means... That's just a roof. Nothing over there. Nothing up there. Except for another silverfish. Same location. Okay, got it with a crit this time. Cave running here. I found this secret offshoot. I had a world that was, like, searching for, like, two hours until I started to use TNT and it's extreme. I do. I don't think I'm going to get to that point, and I don't think it's not here. I feel like it is here. I think I just need to check... 
more corridors. More directions, mine through more walls. Follow more cave systems that could just lead me straight to it, you know? There's always that option. There's always the get lucky option. Da, 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 da. Okay. Um, they, were, they patched all the x-ray glitches, right? Oh, well, that's just the main room. At this point, just go in a direction and find another stronghold. I feel like that's going to be slightly slower than just making sure this place, t I haven't missed anything. You know, just, just a tad slower than that, you know. Just, just a little bit. How did that not fit? I don't know. That just looks like a doorway. It wasn't, but it looked like it. This is at deep slate level. Oh, it's just... Ugh, bruh. Had my hopes up for a second. is just a room. Imagine it'll take longer to the portal than, than reaching the stronghold. It could. Hope it doesn't, but it could. Could also die right now. Won't, but it could. There's light here, it's just glow lichen. That's bricks. Somewhere I've been before. Yes, it's the end of this, which I had not yet overruled as a possible location. It seemed worth overruling, though, since there's nothing there. Close off that. Um, closed off that, that, and that. Was just this. There's always this cave, which could reveal a another section of this place, or just reveal a section I've already been in and checked thoroughly and blocked off because it wasn't here. Hmm. It's gonna be really sad when I die in lava, lose all my stuff, and then. Choose to rejoin in spectator mode and check where it is. Sometimes they technically, some not technically, sometimes they just don't generate with portal rooms. Very sad. Very stupid. Very bad game design. But it's true they do. I not have portal rooms. Not this way. Also, sorry, let me, uh, let me turn the gamma back up again. So you can see, you know, since YouTube makes everything dark and dingy and unable for anyone to see but me. I don't actually know which way I came from, so... I don't know which way I came from, so this is going to be interesting finding whatever room I was in. It was probably this way and then back up this way. Yeah, it was. It's this big old cavern. Or this one. Or somewhere. I was somewhere. It was, yeah, it was this way. 
Let's look around this way. Two creepers. Okay, axe cut on both of them. Oh, wow, that one did not. I'm gonna get up this hill. Ah. Uh... And it unlikely I discover the portal room just by running around in a cave, but you now at this point I'm not feeling very hopeful, so whatever. I don't even think I'm within the vicinity. It hurts me seeing the stronghold generation sincerely in one hour of searching. I would go creative and bomb the entire place with TNT. Yeah, it, it does not... I don't appreciate how they generate, but they generate that way, so... I have to deal with it. Not anything there. Not really worth checking, honestly, but I check it anyway, so... You know. Plus, I have to find my way back to wherever I was before. I think it's down this tunnel. No, it's not. That tunnel didn't turn to the right. This tunnel does. Maybe not. Maybe it is this tunnel. Maybe. Who knows? Probably not, though. Oh, nothing down here. Gonna get back to where I was. I didn't find a good generating stronghold since one at 16. Yeah, because the caves generate so much more differently. I don't think they actually changed stronghold generation. I, I remember it always being kind of crappy, honestly. Just wouldn't... I just... You know, didn't go to the stronghold that much. Just messing with me. Eh, kinda, yeah. One of you give me a potato so I don't have to leave the cave. No? Cool. I'll just kill the skeleton. Nope. Oh, will you give me a potato? You have an iron sword. That's rare. No, not that rare, but it's fair. Oh, that's because there's a zombie spawner here. That's very good for getting a potato. Which one of these chests has a potato? No, but that's other side! Okay. Why didn't any of you give me the challenge to find other side? That's great. 12 hours total playtime? Yes. Over the last week, I've played half a day's worth. This 4 iron is nice, though. I appreciate that. Name tag would be good if I wasn't just going to use the name, though. To name the potato. Not that you can put... Don't, okay, don't confuse, my brain just, my brain did not process there for a second. I wasn't trying to put a name tag on an object. I'm also just gonna build a little farm out of this because I really don't want to go to the surface and I feel like I can get lucky enough to get a potato and the amount of time it takes for me to go to the surface. Oh, well, yeah, I'm trying to give you optimal spawning space, so. Mind me just mining out a zombie spawner so I can get potatoes so I can name it Benjamin so that I can kill an ender dragon with it. Same same priorities as any speedrunner. No potatoes. Really wish I would have grabbed that potato earlier. There was a potato. I could have grabbed it. I didn't. Why did I do that? I can just use their chests. I don't have to make new chests. No potato. I need a diamond, too. I really want to play other side. Okay, thank you, creepy cave noise. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna work on smelting the iron now. High naturally spawning zombies. Not even, not even from the spawner, they're just here. How are you? These guys are from the spawner, however. Specific mobs are known to potatoes too. There are 2.5 chance of dropping them upon death. Without looting? That's pretty good, I'll take that, dang. Okay, let me just make, like, six furnaces. 
That's three, not six. Whatever, I don't care. Just got a furnace. Put like half in there and half here. and That's not how division works, but I don't care. So, whatever. You guys can't kill me. Even if you want to, you can't kill me. Oh, there's a bunch of you actually, so... 2.5% chance I only have to kill like 50 of them, which is not that many. Unless, of course, they start spawning little ones. Gosh dang it. There's like half a heart of damage. I just let you get you in, get you in close here. Close quarters combat, fine. There we go. Now the actually only problem here is dead. Oh, actually, let me pull out the rotten flesh so I'm not wasting the food on zombies. This just heals me just as well as any steak does. The thing I'm wasting here is the durability of my hands. And also patience, but you know. I fill my water up. Since I'm out of water, but I have a, I have a water bladder here that, that'll fill the water up. Mm. I didn't tower up enough when I was fighting an iron golem. Oh, that's a shame. And you only gotta go three blocks up. Pretty, pretty standard formula for not getting hit by the iron golem. Three blocks. Oh, that's another zombie. I better not start doing something now. There we go. I'm to a little bit more. And open up my water. And pour it into my other water glass that I have a straw on. So I think it's easier. Now, I hope I don't die. Okay, I'm gonna die. Time to just kind of like AI walk around because I can't put this water down. I don't want to die, but I'm gonna die. Okay, I hold it with my teeth. But I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm not dead. I'm holding the water with my teeth. I'm gonna draw it because my jaw is not strong enough. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, there we go. Now I can put away. Ow! What's a quadratic formula? Uh, negative b plus minus the square root of b squared, uh, minus 4 times a times c over 2 times c. I think my teeth hurt. That's shame. You're so ready to clip the moon when I die? That's a shame. What is this? 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 That, my friend, is called BS. But you two are too late, because I am at enough health where I can just tank a few hits. Are they just... Is the spawner right up there or something? Is there a second spawner? Where are these guys coming from? Is there a second spawner? What is this? Ought there be a second spawner? This is a really good seed then. Having two zombie spawners that close? It's cool. Okay. There's not a second spawner. It's just it's just them existing the way they do. I don't know. Fall damage. Skeleton. My shield is gonna be broken before. Uh, where's the zombie spawner? Up here? Around the corner? I think it is. No, it's not. It's somewhere else enough around the corner. I don't actually know. Is it really this far? I don't think it is. I think it's back the way I came. Somewhere back over here. It's probably where all those zombies were coming from. Crazy idea. Um, almost as if that makes sense. Oh, hi. No thanks. I think I came down this way. I thought... I'm so confused. 
Is it not this way? Oh, look, an Enderman. I need to kill you. Oh, hi. Ow. Uh, well, there's your clip. You got your clip, chat. Good job. Did I set my spawn anywhere? No, because I break my bed every time. Ah, uh, I have severe pain in my life. Uh, um, there just had to be like a 20 block drop behind me. Okay, well, let's start a new world. I am gonna save these times, though. Just because I think they're cool to keep, okay? I'm just gonna finish off the speedrun as if I beat it right there. I didn't. We all know we didn't. Obviously, it's on it's on video that I didn't beat it there. I just... I just want a time for, you know, to just... As... I just want to update them. Cool, let's pretend I beat that in 2 hours and 43 minutes, which I didn't, and I won't be able to beat that time probably, but, you know, whatever. Now I can edit this splits, and, uh, get, to uh, add insert below, add a split called Benjamin the Third Potato, Benjamin the Third Potato. And before we start, does anyone want to add a challenge between here, here, and here? I'm just gonna open up the floodgates so that I have maximum cancer, and then I can't get any more cancer, so I know exactly what I'm doing and can be methodical in my speedrunning. Since the only thing I'm really good at is thinking, usually, except for when I back off a cliff because I don't want to die to an Enderman, and also because I didn't know the Enderman was there. So yes, anyone anyone get wanna get their things in now? For the first time, I'm just gonna let you give me challenges and I'm gonna put them on the list. Plan on 30th of until you get an enter pearl from an enderman in the nether. That is not how that works. It has to be a challenge between blaze rods and pearls and pearls and portals. And it's usually, like, a goal, specifically, like, defeat this, or do something. Kill the warden with any weapon. Okay. After blaze rods, I have to kill the warden. Cool. Kill the warden. Great. Good thing I know that. So... Chat, one thing I'm going to demonstrate is my ability to get max armor in three hours. So, anything else, anybody? Hello, I'll add the one insert below. Um, bring, defeat the ender dragon with a potato named Benjamin all the way. You can't do that, the, the challenge is already in there, so, you know. Okay, it can't. It has to be more simple than that. And also, there's already a challenge on there about defeating the Ender Dragon, so there can't be two. Uh, and you can't change your. Yeah, yeah. Be sad all you want. I just lost a two-hour speed run. Um, bring a shulker to the overworld. Cool. Anyone want anything that's more creative and less devious? You can't really get anything less devious than killing the warden or bringing a shulker to the overworld because both of those are going to take about 13 hours. 
So I'm probably going to be up till 2 a.m., but, you know, whatever. At least I'll break a record of longest stream, since I've technically streamed for eight hours before. But if I have to beat all these challenges, I'm going to be live for at least nine. Especially considering I've already been live for four. Get the elytra before beating the dragon. Okay. Compared to the other things, that's... That, I'm not with a flying machine. That's... I don't know how to build flying machines. I'd literally rather bridge a thousand blocks into the end. Um, but I I guess I'll do it with a flying machine. Uh, pfft. After pearls? How is it after pearls? Eh, whatever, I don't care. It has to be after portal, so... You're gonna have to choose between Benjamin the Potato and getting an Elytra before I beat the Ender Dragon. Since I physically cannot get to uh, Elytra before I go into the portal. You'd rather me get an Elytra than beat the Ender Dragon with a Pedo? Okay, Elytra it is. Elytra. Ooh, how do you spell that? No, that's spelled wrong. Sorry, I added an E. Elytra, I didn't need to be an E there. Elytra. There we go. So, any other challenges that aren't needing to replace another challenge? I only let you replace that because the other one was also your challenge, technically. There's a few things I'm probably going to have to research. But, you know what's great? I'm going to get max armor. For those challenges, you're going to be streaming for the next seven hours. Yes, I am. Literally, it's probably going to take seven hours. Because I'm planning on getting max gear, which will take at least three hours. Unless I get really good at doing villagers, which I'm already really good at. So if I get even better and can just, like, instantly get max gear which I can't do. I can probably get it in three, maybe two hours if I get really lucky with my spawn and have, like, bamboo or something. But otherwise, no. Third and final attempt at completing the chat's custom speedrun challenge. I'll be streaming into... Yes. I know. I already regret writing it. I regret writing it earlier when I got to, like, three hours and kept going, and I'm still gonna regret it, but I have... Another two glasses worth of water, and I'm probably going to have to pause to eat dinner sometime in here, but, you know. Okay, great. No one's going to add any more challenges? Cool, I'm fine with that. We're going to start going again, since technically no one added more challenges, and I gave you plenty of chances to do so. Don't pretend like I didn't. At least I have the clip when you died. Yes, you do. Do you also have the clip when I lived in the nether that one time? Because honestly, I'd prefer it if someone had that clip. I'll add one too late. I'm going to save this seed, though, so let me recreate it. Um, it's not actually too late. I don't care. You can add one. Might as well go all in. Since I'm literally just going to stop caring about the time. Oh, I forgot to I forgot to send out the message that I was live. That's cool. That means a lot of people here um fun also okay to send this earlier. It's random, just typed it. What do you mean? What's random? Hey, you probably just got a notification. Um... Anyone want to add another challenge? We can add another challenge. You can add a challenge. The seed is random. Just typed it by myself. 
Okay, what? I'm not, uh, you can't, I'm not taking a seed. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna make another random one. Make a hostile mob mover or a tripwire that leads to explosives. Okay, that's convoluted, but fun, I guess. Um, that would be after pearls. Um, mob detonation. Detonation. Is that how you spell that? Detonation? Detonation. Yeah, that's detonation. Take a pig to the end and let the dragon kill it. Too late. Also, I find this one funnier. I'm sorry, Pengu. It's just funnier. You gotta, you gotta admit, that's kind of funny, okay? If it can, if it can't, just throw it off the island. It can kill the pig, definitely. But that... I can't do that before opening the per portal, so this is that's not really an option. If you want, you can replace the elytra with that. If you want to replace the elytra with that, you can. Just saying. I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna stop you. You know, if you want to replace the elytra with that, you know, I, you know, I wouldn't stop you. You can. You know, I'm just saying. I'll wait. Bro, I literally found a village with two houses. That's not good. That's very unlucky. Nah, man, I'm good. Okay, alright, chat, fine. Fine. Well, let's get going on the world's slowest speed run, since clearly I, I I'm just gonna slow run, slow run, slow run. Maybe in the future I'll change your decision. You can't. You can't anymore. It's it's locked in. It's locked and loaded. We're done editing the challenges now. This is officially the ultimate speedrun. This is a crappy spawn, but that's a floating boat. Well, I'm gonna save this seed just because there's a literally a floating boat there, and I find that funny. Oh, the tripwire is like trauma. Hang on. Hang on. Why is it so laggy? Ow, there's so much lag. Oh, because the world's generating. Why? No, why is it so laggy? I don't think this is going to be a good world for a speedrun, just saying. Why is it suddenly so laggy? What did I do to make it laggy? Open two, uh, two tabs open. Um, let me just... Recreate world, get that floating boat seed in there. I can go to sleep for six hours, come back, and you'll will still be sleeping. Yeah, probably. Let me just put this in the Discord. Loading boat. I'm gonna start calling these slow run every time. Ah. Okay, well, let's start the timer. I don't know. This, what a horrible seed, guys. I think I might have to reset. You know, I don't think I've ever gotten a seed where I literally spawn in a village. Oh, look, let me also finish the first challenge there, just because, you know, why not? Or can two shot you in full uh, max netherite armor? Oh yes, I know. That's why I'm gonna shoot it with a bow, because a power five bow can uh, kill it with about a stack and a half of arrows. I know this because I've killed almost eight wardens in my lifetime. Probably more actually. I just can't be bothered to count since I've cleared so many uh, ancient cities. Fortunately, it didn't say to kill it with a sword or to deal the final blow with a sword or anything. It just said any weapon, so I'm just going to shoot it to death because you can sit outside of its shrieking bullet death laser range and just kind of kill it. 
And also, I'm gonna go quickly, but I'm I'm not gonna go that quickly. I'm just kind of gonna go at a reasonable pace because there's not much stakes right now as far as finishing it quickly. Daily reminder: the warren has an 800 yards and has a shining thing that can go up blocks can shoot from a distance. You say that, but like I said, I've killed like eight of them. I know what I'm doing. Though then again, I've killed eight of them while having an elytra, so might be slightly different, but I think I'm good. I, th I think I'm all right. I'll probably be fine. We'll see. Maybe I won't be fine. Who knows? But either way, there's not much stakes on the line, other than the fact that I'm gonna have to get stuff my armor back. Um, I need to make sure to trap all these villagers so none of them die, and uh, I need at least two of them so I can make a breeder, which means I need wheat seeds. I'll just steal the crop from the village. Actually, I probably prefer carrots than wheat. Um, just give me a moment. This is gonna be a speed run to get max gear, which shouldn't be too hard since I'm pretty well versed at doing it. Um, you're gonna get to see my one and only speciality in Minecraft, which is the ability to establish a villager empire on, like, day one. Every SMP I've ever been in. That's done. That's bucket done. Bucket's actually very important for me. Done. Bucket complete. Pork baby pig. I could complete that, but I might as well just complete it later. In the meantime, I'm going to steal all your crops that you cannot farm, because I don't want you farming, because I want your inventory empty. Or full of carrots, but you just pick up seeds, so... It sucks. I'm gonna have to make sure you do carrots, but honestly, I don't care. You work either way. Um, Fletcher is great. Not yet, though. I need you elsewhere, but you're in your house, which is convenient for now, so I'll keep you there. I'm gonna chop down a tree or two. I need to remove every other job, and I need to take that composter, and I need two villagers to be farmers, so yoink. I'll get those later, and I'm gonna take these two composters, because I do need two, actually. Um, and then I need all of your dirt, please, and thank you. I don't want you planting anything, even though you already have. I got potatoes, though, now, so I can, you know, dare. Give you, uh, 50 cents if you get full netherite before two and a half mark. Full netherite before two and a half mark. Ooh. It's gonna be rough. You know what's interesting? I found out that if I get 500 subscribers and 3,000 public watch time hours, you can actually do super donos. Uh, or, uh, super chats, whatever, you know. Unfortunately, they take, uh, 30% of your revenue, so for me to get 50 cents, you'd actually have to send, uh, just under a dollar. Not sure exactly how much. I still have on my pays after spending it on CSGO. Okay, interesting. Well, let's see if I can do that, chat. You just want me to get full netherite, not maxed full netherite, so I'm gonna take you up on that deal. Deal, deal has been struck, there's no going back, I'm sorry, no refunds. You did not say maxed, you just said full netherite armor. So, I'm fine with that. Um, I can do that. No doubt. Might have to reprioritize slightly, but I can definitely do that, because it's not that hard. Uh, do I want iron farms? Probably yes, but first I'm gonna go for the classical approach of getting a... Oh, there's a blacksmith here, that's nice. Get more beds. I need at least three to start off, and then some kind of wool farm. Put this chest, get free iron, iron armor, iron pick, apples, that, that. Put this on, got an iron pickaxe now. Convenient. I'm going to just yoink your house real quick, and I'm going to go for whatever is most convenient to me, which in this case is building something ugly but effective. I actually have 75 cents left. Well, that's perfect. But I need 500 subscribers for you to do that, so I'll just, I'll, I'll keep you to the deal, okay? Stick around till I have 500 subs and a Google Pay account that's properly set up, and I'll, I'll, I'll hold you to it, don't worry. I won't forget. Oh, perfect. You're a volunteer? That's great. Because I want you to stay right there, and I know how to get you to stay right there. I just need to trap you really quickly, and also give you a job to do, because you'll stick around if there's a job for you to be doing. Uh, 
I'm just going to build with whatever I got. And this side doesn't need to be locked off because you're not going to jump off a cliff, realistically speaking. I can show proof that I'm willing to get full netherite. Okay, sure. Then I guess I'm getting full netherite chat. I don't really want to get full netherite because it's kind of a waste of resources, but I will do it because, you know what, money is money, and I think I'd like just to prove that I can. A um, bunch of wood over here, free wood. I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of this. Of course, take that one and mine this because it's cheaper and easier. That is sugarcane, so... Hmm. Farm that, or I could farm sticks, but I don't have spruce, so I'd be farming oak wood, and oak wood's inefficient. If I go axe first, or I mine something. So, what for yourself? Uh, something pretty for yourself? Okay. Hey guy. Babe. Yeah. What? Feed you? Use? Y? No. G's not next to Y. I think actually G is really next to Y. Um, great. Cool. I'm going to go ahead and just... There is potentially more villagers over in that savanna, which means... Villagers... You exist, and you two exist, and you're all becoming leather workers because there is a singular leather working building which has about a billion cauldrons in front of it, which all are little leather working stations. That sucks. Goodbye. No more of that. Nope. And there's one inside, too. Dang, they really want leather workers. Cool. Anyway, who of you wants to become a armor up with this guy they didn't jump off right nope they didn't cool um gonna do this gonna do this and someone's gonna try and path find up here to become a farmer and i'm gonna say well yes you can come up here and become a farmer or no one is someone please come path find to try and be a farmer it's a pretty simple request. I'll put it right there, and then I'll make you a golden staircase up here. And actually, I'm going to boat you over there real quick. Let me guess, the other guy came down? Yeah, well, you'll go back to work when it's time to work. Or I'll trap you in a boat as soon as you walk back up those stairs, because that's really what I'm going to do. But you won't do, because of course you won't, because it's currently meeting time at the town square. Go to your jobs. Or your houses, or your beds. Are you all gonna go to the same bed? Because I left one bed accidentally. Yes, you are, because... Whoops, oh, frick, that sucks. Ah, oh, crap, whatever. Doesn't matter to me that much. Here, what happens if I put a bed up here on this hill? Mm, suddenly everyone's gonna run up here when I ding the bell. Because that's how villager mechanics are. There we go. Let's go ding the bell again, and hopefully... I don't get any of the guys I pissed off. Look, another bed. Not you. Oh crap! Come on. I don't need. I don't need a. I don't need a weaponsmith. I thought I already. Wait. And then where are they getting their job from? Where did you get your job from? Get in bed. Get you. Out of here, you idiot. Go over here. Go get someone else to come up here. Gotta ding the bell again. Please. Yeah, pop back in. Come on. Come on, your bed's in here. Wait, I need to craft more boats. Hang on, crap. The more boats I have, the easier this will be. I'm not used to doing this so quickly. Where did my wood go? Oh, it's in that stack. I just need to craft, like, six boats. Well, four will suffice. Deep and scary cave might, but... There you go, that's one, and I will sleep because daytime's bad. I mean, nighttime's bad. Daytime's good. I'm gonna go ring the bell. Oh, you got a friend in there. What are the chances of that? I just need the one annoying guy. Save a job, that's why they're annoying. I'll go ding the bell, and everyone should go to work. Go up, go ahead. Yep, that's your bed up there, I'm sure it is. 
Great. One, two, three, four, and I win. Checkmate, dude. Don't care if you get in the same boat. Just care that you get in a boat. Lovely. Okay, apparently I can't place there now, but whatever. I don't care. Anyway. This, this can function here. I just have to do this. And I just have to do this. Great, and that's one villager breeder almost entirely complete. I just have to have a way in and out, and that's fine. I'll just, like, dig a hole and pop in and out. I don't know. Think of something. I know exactly what I'll do. I'll do this. They don't understand this. They're not smart enough to understand this. As long as they don't fall down in, which they probably will, knowing villagers. Whatever. Um, I'll be fine. I can actually get them out of the boat now, so it's fine. Then you two are gonna need beds, and I'll make you a bedroom. Doesn't matter. This is four blocks, right? No, this is five blocks. Great, it'll be on this side. This will be the bedroom side. I'll build on this side, and then everything else can be. Cheery days. Yo, I have about 60 different things I can put on the ground right now, but I'm just going to put everything because it doesn't matter. I don't think it matters anyway. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm right. In any case, it shouldn't matter too much. Don't copy by stuff. Oh, do you, should you go in? Yeah, sure, go in. Whatever, I don't care. You might die, you might not die, it doesn't really matter. Now, um, I'm going to go like this. Please get out of that corner. I don't know why you want to be in that corner in the first place. You cannot escape. There is no escape. You will not escape. I'm just gonna do that. I need wood. I'm not going to be able to avoid spending money on building this. Avoid spending money on other things, but not this. Not right now, anyway. Also, I think that's a toolsmith, not a weaponsmith. I need three beds. Of course, the third one needs to be somewhere inaccessible by adults, which means I need a trap door. So, fucking table. I don't need that many, but I'll make it that many just in case one of them finds a way to get in here. And then the ground needs to be made of trapdoors too. It just has to be two like that. And then that's perfect. And then this feeds into a water tunnel. Like so. Where's my shovel? There we go. Which it doesn't matter where it goes, I'll work with it later. And you can be free now. And I will actually work with the toolsmith, if you are a toolsmith. No, you're a mason. That's way worse. Toolsmiths work at, uh, something? I think smithing tables? But that might be, uh, armor smiths, not sure. Garter smiths work at, uh, anvils? Any of them work at anvils? No, one of them works at grindstone, one of them works at... One of those blast furnace. Blast furnace is armor smith. Toolsmith is this, which is important. Because I need a diamond pickaxe and trading iron is not that bad. You clever little villager. I did not even think of that, though I definitely should have, since their pathfinding is the most annoying thing in this entire game. Is a good thing I am not afraid to just drop you down like this is an execution. Goodbye. Stop it. I don't care. You're gone. This is not your bed. I don't care what you think it is, it's not your bed. No matter what you do, this is not your bed. And I will free you, but it is not your bed. It is their bed, because that is what I have said. I have now gained full control over you, so 
take the comfort in knowing that I have not, like, Im forcibly employed you. Don't fall down the hole. Oh my god. They are so unbelievably stupid. I, how, why did it choose to pathfind down the hole? Well, it's a good thing you're going up because I'm just going to boat you into the thing because freaking hate villagers. Oh, can't be bothered. Goodbye. You have now been forcibly employed. Nudge the boat off. Ah, crap. I don't want you if you're going to be mad at me. Run away, run away, run away. You can't get away. It doesn't matter. I'm not going to trade with you anyway. I just need you to breed. Since this is a villager breeder. Not a villager trading hall yet. Great. I should really put a roof on this. And it needs a three high roof for them to make babies. So We'll put a roof on this. You guys probably would appreciate a door too, but can't get that. You need a certain number of air blocks as well, maybe, but eh, whatever. I just need to get full diamond armor and then get four pieces of netherite. Which is easier said than done, but it's also not harder to do than reality. Um, none of these places happen to have a name tag, did they? If one of them had a name tag, then I could make an iron farm, and that would be great and all, but nope, none of them did. Um, just need them to sleep or claim beds. Either way, ringing the bell will make them claim beds. Mm, hay bales, wheat, wheat for money. That doesn't seem terrible of an idea, but also doesn't seem like a great idea. Also trade gold. No, seems like a bad idea. Let me build my first uh, trader, trading person. Get this guy stuck in a boat because they're bothering me. Come here, come here. Thank you. Sure, this shall be the level that the trading hall is on. That is what I have decreed. I need more wood, so let's start dismantling houses. I don't care. These guys are all going to be trapped in trading halls soon enough, and then it won't matter anymore. And then I'll need a Fletcher, because I think, despite this, it'll still be the fast. Despite not having bamboo, it'll be still be the fastest just to build a... Just to do that. And I need, uh, slabs. Slabs for the trading hall, since that's what's required to design. Uh, da, 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 da. I need you on this side, actually, so, you know, whatever. And this does not need to go there. I need to go here. And then this goes across three ways, and then this goes like this. And, of course, three of these just for precautionary. And I forgot to close this off, so that would have been disastrous. Anyway, now this works. And in theory, if I do this, and I do this, this, and all I gotta do is take you right here, and rotate the boat, rotate the rope, should put you in there. Okay, no, it put you in the slab, which makes sense, but there you go, That that's all I needed to happen. And realistically, all I further need to happen is that you get right in front of your job site block and and I can just do a that. Just just move over just a little bit. Uh just 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 a little bit over. Oh no, suddenly you can't move anywhere other than in front of your job site block. The horror. Oh there we go. That there we have it. That's the first one in. Nice and easy. Kind of. It was it was a little janky, but it wasn't that bad. All things considered. It is almost night time, but I'm gonna get let it get a little bit night time. And I'm gonna have to buy a bunch of those, aren't I? No, I'm not. Oh, right, this is an axe. 
fun. Not gonna stand for that. Give me a different trade. I know you can trade iron. No oh, crap. Now I'm stuck here and I have to didn't die. Not die, I didn't hit the villager. Which is kinda worse than dying in this situation. I think there's still a bed over in this one. I make sure these guys have gone to bed though. How did you do that? Who are you actually? And of course you did that. That just makes sense. Okay, I'll fix that in the morning. Mmm -hmm, pain. Villagers. Doesn't matter. Still better than dealing with fighting the warden without max gear or anything. All I need to do is not die of suffering. And then I shall get my reward. <coughs> we'll be beating the speed run today, sometime, some point today. Not sure when today, but some point today. Oh, person, I'm just gonna... Will you ever do a manhunt kind of thing? I was actually discussing that a bit earlier in the stream, I think. I don't know if you're here or not. I was considering doing a manhunt. I have a few people who might be willing to do it. YouTubers I already know. But not. And I'm just gonna go over here to get out. Where'd my door go? Fine. 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 Game, fine. I'll do it your way. I won't cause a problem. Or see you hunted down? What? Yeah, that's true. In the whole cave, I found eight raw iron, and not that's not much of a success. I'm gonna be real with you. I'm gonna be real with you here. That that much not that's not much of a success. Okay, now both of you actually need to be. Uh, both of you should be this. Want a job? Yes, you have a job now. now I'm gonna go ring the bell and try and get you a bed too. They have just a job. Which is what you currently have, and I turn one and a half of these into that makes some bread, but keep the wheat because I might want to trade it for money, etc. I need stone right now. I need wool for beds and a bunch of things, just general stuff for my success in this game. Currently at a half hour almost, which means I still have two hours to get full netherite. Now, did they both claim their bed? Or did another villager come and try and get the bed? Did not claim the bed. It's trying to get elsewhere. Both of these beds have been broken. Claim your bed. And claim your bed. Are, are either of you claiming this bed? I'll break this bed. No more bed. Need one of you claim this bed. Also, don't please. Oh gosh, that's gonna be a pain. I shouldn't have put that in the center. And eh, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna go down and ring the bell again, and hopefully they'll go to their actual beds. Um, ding, 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 ding. Also gonna go harvest the sugar cane spread it a bit because why not farm the sugar cane because technically that produces money and i eventually might need money of some kind did you guys get your beds properly there's no one else trying to get to your beds i'm gonna assume you guys are good for now anyway how are your prices did i punch any of you i punched you what about the other one though also punched you, apparently, or maybe I just made all the villagers angry, which you can do, by the way. Now, let's also go talk to that Fletcher. I'm just gonna leave the Fletcher in the Fletcher's building. I can't be bothered to move it. It's gonna chill over there while I inevitably will... Actually, I probably will eventually get tired of having it over there and move it, but for now, it's gonna stay there, because it's technically one level below where I need it to be to actually move it into one of these other houses. And two and a half is kind of greedy, so I'll give you an extra 30 minutes or three hours to get full. 
I'm getting minute ahead. I can almost 1 a.m. Oh boy. Okay. That's fun. Anyway. I'm just gonna grab all this. Got 20. That's not gonna be a whole lot. Um, I chopped down some corners of other houses. I'm adding a lot of time on that achievement. Why don't I just... Oh, I gave away all my potatoes. I can get more. Not potatoes. There's a farmer over there. That's not okay. You're supposed to be unemployed, and I'm supposed to own all your crops. Nope. Woohoo, I guess. I don't want beetroots. I don't want poppies. I don't care. I'll grab any of them, please, sir. Be very rude of you. Don't care about cauldrons. Great, now I have seeds. Well, better than nothing. Don't really need saplings either. Got one potato, but I have ten carrots. So that's fine. Uh, this is great. If I ask, we're just gonna, just gonna, my brain not working properly. Okay. Try not to though. That that's usually bad. And also, I don't want to have to delete your messages, or time you out, or etc, etc. I'm mining away. The building there, that I could mine as well. Oh, I don't know why I'm trying to get in the lines. I need to be smelling the flowers, I need to be, uh, capitalism. That's what I need to be doing, is capitalism. Rampant capitalism. So, I'm gonna go over to the stick guy. Hey, stick guy, you still alive in there? Yes, you are. Come here. Actually, I'll go to you. I don't really care. I'm just gonna pop over here. You're not a stick guy. You don't sell sticks even remotely. How can I get in there without you getting out? Cool, I need a refresh. Days never finished, man. Bro. No. So much nope. Well, that's definitely a deletable message if I've ever seen one. Yay, sticks. Uh, uh craft sticks. I'm just gonna casually, uh, don't. Don't do that, though. Bad joke. Not funny, didn't laugh. Literally, I didn't. Um. Yes, what a deal, what a deal. I just made six crafting tables. Well, I'll probably use six crafting tables by the end of this, so... Might as well be reckless with it, I guess. Make... Hello again, welcome back, Celeste. Good luck. Yes, I am. Yeah, I'm gonna sleep for four hours, coming back later. Okay, fun. Enjoy four hours of sleep. Um, as you can tell, Celeste, um, oh, by the way, how are you doing? Um, the challenges have gotten slightly more ludicrous. So, yes, I have to defeat a warden now of, of many things that I have to do, including getting an elytra before I defeat the ender dragon on a flying machine. Not great, you know, not not the best outcome I could have asked for. Um, but you know, it is what it is anyway. Got plenty of water, so I'll be good for a while. I'm gonna go ahead and get some storage going as soon as I get more wood. I'm currently speedrunning villagers and stuff. Um, Get some chests. Since I need that double chest will work for now. Let's put stuff away in like this stuff. And this and this and this. And this and this. 
Not this, actually. I need this, because I need to talk to you. You want to get a job, don't you? You not want a job? Okay, I guess you don't want a job. Anyway. They're really not getting a job. Um, I need a better wood type to farm. I swear, dude. No, you, that, this is not how this is gonna work, okay? We're not- we're not doing this here. That's not- that's not today's challenge. That's not today's thing. We're not doing that here. What is this seed? What is the seed? Um, uh, what do you mean? The ones in the Discord? Those are just different seeds I have collected so far. Uh, this- I don't know the seed to this world since I don't have cheats enabled, so I can't check. So, uh, we'll find out what the seed is when and if I fail to complete the speedrun. Okay. Kind of a unfortunate, uh, choice that I have. Left up in the air, but yeah, it's the only one. Okay, you got the job. I need axes. Specifically axes. Can you just... Does that require cheats? Oh, no, it doesn't. There you go. There's a seed. Have fun. Can you take the job, dude? Why can't you take the job? Too late at night for you to take the job. I'm gonna go to sleep. That's a seed for you. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. I mean, get the job. Take take the job. Is someone else trying to take your job? Yes, they are. What is that? What was that, dude? They just did a drive-by on the ceiling. How did they even get up there, dude? What was that? How did you do that? You can't get up there. How did you make that parkour jump? Really? A great note to self. I cannot do anything. Oh, this game trying to screw me over. There we go. 15 coal. How did... Oh, I'm stupid. Never mind. I'm just slow. Oh, now you're in here, buddy. You don't really want to be in here, do you? Get out of here. Yeah, get out of there. I'm just gonna uh, put a trap door so I can get in and out. Can't be bothered. That is not in the right spot. I'm gonna trade coal with them. Plus, buying shovels is actually an okay trade right now. I would like to buy a shovel. Actually, two. Actually, I could just... I could just level you up all the way with the emeralds I have here. Now I just have a ton of sh uh, shovels. Now I can trade iron, which is great for business. Let's go. I'm in business. Uh, basically, I am, anyway. Need another chest, though. And then, um, i gonna... If I had a name tag, I would build... Actually, I can put it in a boat. I guess I'll build an iron farm probably next. Put the uh, zombie in a boat, and then I can just build an iron farm. But at the same time, I could just mine the iron manually, which isn't that bad, honestly. Just need to find a good vein of iron to do it. Preferably a Mega Bane, but, you know, maybe not. Who knows? We'll see. Lagging a bit. There's coal there. The thing is, I have to smelt the iron, which is expensive, but, hmm, who knows? I don't know what's better or worse. Finding it manually or not? Hmm, we'll see. Plenty of sticks. Trade sticks for money. That requires me to chop wood. The problem with chopping wood is I only have oak trees and I don't have any spruce or anything along those lines. Could go on a journey to get the other stuff, which would work, but mm, I don't know. Uh, there's a lot of coal in this cave, but not a lot of iron. Be 
because it's a very low level cave. Or actually, it's very high. It's not deep enough, it's not low enough. In case that joke didn't make any sense before. Um, great, I'm leaving. Oh, there's more coal actually, I'm staying. This coal's good, I need to smelt stuff, I just... I think about the logistics of killing the warden right now. So I won't have an elytra. I can't get away from it fast enough. Hmm. Another acacia tree there. Interesting. Lots of forest. Could chop down manually. Not get a better wood type and sell sticks. Or I can do it this way and trade coal. Oh, I don't need iron. I can trade coal. That's true. I just call, trade coal straight up. Actually, it won't really get me anywhere. I'd rather just trade the iron and keep the coal for myself. Lots of good food here. Um, gotta get thoughts out of my head. Think about the game. Actually, I got, gotta get thoughts into my head. I get productive thoughts into my head instead of random ones. There we go. Axes. Do I want to trade the wood for s sticks for emeralds? And uh, in turn, obviously, wood for sticks. Have I never been in this house? Did I not steal from your chest? No, I didn't. Uh, it's empty maps anyway. I don't really need that. Could find a woodland mansion. Chop the whole mansion down. Give me a lot of wood wouldn't have to grow any trees. It'd be an insane amount of wood, actually. Yeah, swamp for slime? No, the swamp is just there. I literally spawned in this village. It was very lucky, actually. So I decided the seed was good enough and started going, because I don't really care. You know? Could clear the swamp. Be good. Give me a ton of wood. That assumes I have a fast pickaxe, or a fast axe, not a fast pickaxe in my brain. Um, in order to chop the wood down with, and I don't really, so take a lot of time to do. When I really need to go kind of fast on the money production, which means I need something, uh, Easy, like bamboo. I, if I had bamboo, that'd be great, but I don't have bamboo. I have forests, which are... Mm, it's debatable whether the wood or the bamboo is better. I don't know which one's better, really. I just know that what I have is bamboo, and how did you get there? Oh, you're just another villager? Yes, you are just another villager who decided to take their job. I don't appreciate, so I'm gonna remove you because this is not your job. And I'd appreciate it if you stop trying to pretend it's your job because it's not your job. I'll break this to make it sure you don't count it as your job because it is their job. And they need to reset their trades, which they haven't done because you took their job. I need flint so I can make more fletching tables so I can turn more of you into fletchers since there's actually a ton of unemployed villagers here. Surprisingly. Double. There we go. Then I need flint. So I can make more fletching tables. And more fletching tables. Really? 
enemies? Like, I don't know. That's probably good enough. Uh, since I can just put this in my offhand. I get somewhere other than grass is annoying. this for a bit. And we'll have plenty of flint. You know, if I lose a few over in the water. I got eight, which is four, so that's good enough for now. Um, I'm not gonna move you over yet. I am, however, gonna take sugar cane and continue expanding it because it is just free profit. As I said before, it is strictly speaking just free profit whenever I want it. You still are unwilling to trade, but your crafting table is useful still, whether you're willing to trade or not. Just make a few of these. Only four, because why not? Get four, and you are going to go take my bed, maybe? Will you do the warden challenge? Yes, I'm going to kill it with a bow, because approx they take approximately uh, a stack and a half of arrows with... A power five bow because I've killed about eight wardens before, so I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty good as far as killing the warden goes. I'm not worried about that. I just know I need to get good enough gear to not die on my way there and lose a whole lot of progress. You know, I just yeah, I gotta be prepared for the worst. Um, speaking of which, go to sleep. So that there are no enemies. And then the goal will be to... Um, I, I can find you to deep dark. You could, but that would be cheating, technically. And that's kind of, you know... Loses a bit of spirit to the challenge. So I'd prefer it if you did not do that, please. Um, I would ignore it anyway, probably, and then that would just inconvenience me because I'd have to find one that is in a complete opposite direction to whichever one you give me the coordinates of. So don't, don't do that. It's not, it, it's not fun doing it for a long time, but uh, it's less fun if I cheat. And also, right now, I'm not making bad time as far as uh, getting good gear goes. Thank you, Celeste, for respecting my wishes. <laughs> it's not everyone would. They just send away the messages, and, uh, you know, then I would be uh, screwed as far as that goes. Here we are. I have one bed for you that's already done, and then I'm going to go ahead and Put you right here, spin you around, assess a bit, and then pump the boat, and then push you into there, and put blocks right there. How did you do that? You just deleted the block I had already placed. Okay, buddy, if you want to play your that game, play me at that game. You'll need to walk a lot, though. Yes, I will. But, you know, whatever. I'm also contemplating if I want to just go ahead and uh, get my elytra just beforehand. Because why not? You know, why not? It doesn't matter. No one's stopping me from just getting it already. Just skipping the burden and just...
grabbing it, nip, just nipping it in the bud, just, you know, going straight for it. It's like 2 a.m. here? Oh, alright, well. I'm happy you're here. But honestly, you could probably leave the stream and then come back tomorrow morning, and I'd still be live for your time. You're in India, right? Or is that somebody else? Ooh. That one was India. That one was in India. I don't remember who. Got some sticks. Great. Not enough. I'm from Turkey. Okay, you're in Turkey then. Somewhere. Well, I wonder who was in India. That might have been Pengu. Someone was in India. One of these days of the week that I've been streaming. I've streamed every day of this week. Or this week. Like work week. I haven't streamed on the weekend. I didn't stream on Sunday. I did upload on Sunday. I probably will stream tomorrow, but... Otherwise, I've only streamed the five days of the week. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Since today's Friday. I'm flies when you're streaming Minecraft like every day. <laughs> I'm leaving CS six hours later. All right. I may or may not be live six hours later. We'll see. I hope I'm not, but I might be. I did say this would probably last seven hours since it's difficult. Uh, into here. Go over here. Sure, that price is only minimally raised. I really need money right now. We get money pretty dang quick. Minerals are basically free. That's cheapened right now. Go mine iron, or I could keep training with this guy. Oops. Coal. I'm gonna trade my coal, actually. That wasn't worthwhile. Yeah, whatever. Not worthwhile iron. I need iron. I'm gonna trade my coal. Dang, that was a mistake. Misplay, one might say. Though I'd say that's kind of a pretentious way of saying a mistake. Um... And I can put some of these beds away. What I could do with getting myself yet another thing. I really need iron tools. Um, I gotta go find a cave. Why is there a villager up there? What are you doing? Eh, whatever. Everyone's just, like, huddling around this thing. No babies have been produced yet, I'm just gonna assume. I haven't heard their annoying sounds. Um, yeah. Fortunately, there's a ton of villagers around here. These two are still in here, farming wheat in particular, which is unfortunate because wheat is the worst crop they could be farming, I'm pretty sure. Up they go. There's a witch! There's a witch. That's interesting, which can probably kill me pretty well. As it's coming to kill me. I don't think they die in sunlight. You just put jump boost on yourself, or is that speed? Come on, are you gonna attack me, or are you just gonna stand there? No. You're just gonna stand there. I think that's the first time I've gone monster hunter from killing a witch. Interesting. Whatever. Um, no caves, there's water. Water, which is annoying. There's potential cave. Nope, no cave. Cave here? Nope, cliff, though. There's coal there. I actually need the coal since I accidentally sold all my coal. I need to farm some sheep, but farming the sheep will be easy once I have wheat, which means I need to farm some wheat. Or I could find another village, get more wheat from there. Hmm. So many potential thoughts, potential strategies, etc. Hmm. 
more coal. Could just trade coal, but kind of annoying. Considering coals on that high of quantity, I don't have fortune. Hmm. Gotta get enough coal to supply my eager villager empire, which needs coal. It's like actual capitalism. You burn coal for profit. I'm just gonna start a coal power plant. Just completely end the speed run. Just start a coal power plant instead. I'm gonna... Mm, what direction do I go and go over there? Yeah, I guess I'll go this way. My bed's with me, so that's fine. And sleep becomes night. I'll grab the sugar cane since it's kind of on the way. Make sure cane is productive way of getting emeralds. I wonder if I can make a librarian, which I can because I have a lectern. Pigs. Some sheep, too. There's sheep at the village. I'll breed them and then shear them later, and that's how I can make the wool for the beds to do the mining. And there's a lot of lag right now. Also, plenty of coal in this mountain area. And there's sometimes iron in the same biome, I'm pretty sure, but maybe not. I don't know how iron actually generates. I'd have to look it up again. It's changed a number of times. They raised the ore spawn height for, like, everything. I don't have the... I have an iron pickaxe, but I don't want to do that until I have some iron. I should make an iron farm. Making an iron farm will be faster than doing that, but it means I need a lava bucket, which means I need enough iron to get a bucket beforehand. I already have a bucket. Never mind, I'm fine. I should make an iron farm. I'm making an iron farm. Great, we're making an iron farm. Cool, do do do. I just need one lava, and then I need enough iron to... Make a hopper, but I can handle that after I get the uh, lava for the iron farm. Making an iron farm will be faster and easier. I can get the lava from here, assuming this has even a single piece of lava, which it probably doesn't, knowing my luck. Yeah, it does. That's the kind that does it. Great. Well, free iron either way, since that has one piece of iron, not even two. Dang. Kill with magma. Could kill with magma. Our golems do die to magma. Or I can just get the lava from the lava pool that's right here. Fun. Um, let's sleep. Gamma ray. You change your profile picture to Hightail? Yes, I did. Bruh. I do that every time a new uh, post comes out. It's just that it's been a year since they did a blog post. So it's been my main thing for a year. So... It's not as weird as you think it is. It, it's actually a pretty normal thing I do. But most people who know me, have known me for longer than a year, know I do that back when they actually came out with it every, like, couple months. Sort of, you know. Or back when they did postcards and stuff. I do, I do it occasionally. Um, yeah. Like I said, I've been waiting for Hytale for five years. I've been waiting since the very first... I've been waiting since the trailer came out. It's it's just I've just I'm waiting for it. I really want it. It's a cool game. I, I want the game. Maybe I'll have overhyped it in my mind. It won't be as cool when I actually get it, but I suspect it's gonna be probably just as cool when I get it. Is there a bed in here? Ooh, free bed! Yay! Woohoo! I clearly haven't raided this far out into the village. Let me go check these houses. Hang on. I need beds, both for mining in the nether and for my uh, training hall, and then etc. There's a mushroom in this house. That's not good. You know, usually fungus growing in houses is bad. Wait, I'm going to expand my sugarcane farm since I got so many more. Oops, didn't mean to do that. 
not even just not even that fancy with your cane farm. I just kind of decided to plant sugar cane along the side of the cane. Because I might as well, because eventually this could become lucrative. Since uh, I can sell the sugar cane as paper. Great. There we go. Um, then I go put away some of these and convert the iron. And I need to make shears, but I don't think I should do that yet. I think I should hold on to some of it. Hold on to the iron. For a little bit, anyway. Um, hmm, brain function, please. Ba, 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 ba. Think, brain, think. What do I need? What do I want? I need you to level up. This will not level you up fast enough. I was making an iron farm. That's what I was doing. I need building materials, and the cheapest one will be wood. And the fastest way to get the wood is by chopping trees, because the logs are worth four each, but take the same amount of time as chopping planks, so demolishing the houses isn't really efficient anymore. Even the ones that have logs on them will probably be slower than just chopping trees in the forest. chop all the trees down in this forest and then I'll have enough logs to build me a uh, iron farm and I'll sell billion sticks to villagers since they love sticks they love buying sticks the speedrun timer thinks I'm in a major detriment right now because I technically am way behind since I've been stuck on pork baby pig for the longest time but you know whatever kind of just been playing the game which is nice and all it's not what i'm really supposed to be doing I'm supposed to be speed running the game but you can't exactly speed run killing a warden unless you're really good at the game i could get like four stacks of arrows and two regular bows and sit there shooting at it for like an hour and that would probably work technically to kill the warden um feels like a bad idea though you know because it'd be so slow and whatnot um yeah Chopping wood. Also gone to five hours now, which is almost to my record from yesterday, which was five hours and like 20 minutes or so. So, pretty good. I mean, good as far as streaming for a long time goes, but not really good the eyesight, eye health, opt, my optometrist would not be happy. I say that as if I have an optometrist, but I don't even wear glasses, so I don't really have any reason to have an optometrist. Um, I need to build the iron farm like 20 billion miles away from this thing, so I think it's at least 20 blocks, but I think it may or may not also actually be more like 100 blocks. Um, where am I going to build it? Where would I build it? Hello, how are you, random videos? I am doing the world's slowest speedrun because I have to kill a warden, so... Not exactly easy. And I also have to find a warden. I have to not die on my way to the warden. It's not hardcore or anything. It's just that if I die, I lose a lot of progress, as you probably know. Um, you know, whatnot. Is this far enough for an iron farm? Eh, I don't want to be risky. I'll build it over here. Needs to be a certain number of blocks off the ground. I think that would be high enough. I need a platform for the, the zombie to go in. <laughs> I need 
rooms for villagers. Includes a bed and a job site block for all of them. You make an iron farm? Yes, I am. Because, uh, I need iron. And it'll make me money, too. Does not seem like a good speedrunning tactic, but considering I'm also going for max gear, let's just say everything in this run is not a good speedrunner tactic. This run is not a good speedrun. It is a slow run. I'm sure if I really wanted to, I could probably kill the warden without max gear. How long are you going to plan to take this? F take for this? I don't know. I I can probably finish all the villager stuff in three hours, maybe. I, I'm sure I'll be able to get max gear in three hours. I'm su uh, supposed to get full netherite, not even enchanted, in three hours. And someone's promised me a whole 75 cents if I do. So that's nice, you know, earn 75 cents for it. That's great. 75 cents for three hours of work. You know, well, that's always great. Um, but, point being, I'm going to be here for a while. And I, now I just need to trick villagers into going up this. And I can probably do that with fletching tables. You know, because why not? Who wants, who wants a job? You already have been streaming for five hours? Yes, I'll probably be streaming for... Like, 10 hours today. It's not a healthy amount. That's 25 cents an hour? Yes, it is. Unfortunately, if he, if it goes through YouTube, then it will be less because YouTube has a 70% uh, markup. Is that the cartographer? I really need to destroy that cartography table. Hang on, let me go do that. It's really... N oh, this is a house. Free bed. It's really not a good idea on my part, but, you know, I technically said in the description I wasn't going to stop streaming until I won, because I was very overconfident in this other save file I had, which I genuinely almost beat the game with. No, they're just running to my bed, hang on. No, 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 this is no one, none of your beds. I have a, I have a genius, I have a better idea to trick them all here. We're just gonna get beds, and I'm just gonna put beds over in this general direction. Yes, go towards the beds, yes, claim the beds. Good job, you claimed a bed. Now, I'm gonna go put a bed up here. Does someone race to the beds now? If I bring the bell with me, does someone race to the beds? Does ringing any bell work, or does it have to be their bell? Because I can just buy another bell. Like, legitimately, I could just buy another bell. Apparently, I can't buy another bell, because that wasn't enough. You reset yet? You did reset. That's great. Lovely. I'm going to make some more money. Now I can buy another bell. Great. Never have actually bought that before, I don't think. That was a pretty dumb purchase, but... You know, it is what it is. I gotta do what I gotta do. Now, did these beds lure in a villager? No. Yes, they did, actually. Let's go. They're so dumb. Did they in two? Just one. That's fine. No one at a time works for me, I guess. As long as I can get them squared away properly one at a time. Do you want a bed again, sir? Does that not count as your bell since you walked away too far? Oh, no, you're coming up. Let's go. This strategy might actually work. Leave this here. I'm gonna go put a bed up here. Wait, where'd they go? Dang it, man, dude. Sucks. Come on, find your beds, guys. Everyone go to your beds. 
Yes. Yes. Go up the hill. Yes. This is so dumb, but it works. Come on up. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Uh, oh no, your bed got broken. Find a bed. Find a bed. Oh no. I guess the closest bed is up here. Watch this. Up in this weird building up here. Who knew? Who knew there would be a bed up here? Oh, well, let, let, let's just walk onto the bed. Ah, uh, yeah, there you go. Cool. Great. <laughs> okay, I just need, just need two beds per person, and then that's all I need to do to get them to come here. Just gotta get them... I just need to lure them away with the prospect of having a bed. Crazy. I'm gonna put a bed here, and then... I'm gonna put a bed... up here, and then I'm gonna... I'm gonna do a bit of ring around the rosy. I need to actually grab a, a, a bunch of beds if I'm gonna do this strategy. You know, just, just cause, why not? Might, might as well commit fully to the, the wacky strategy of bed luring. Give me all the beds. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Okay, who wants to go to this bed? Ding, 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 ding. There's an open bed within the vicinity of the village. Yes, y'all can run to your beds, but these guys need to go to their beds. Come here. You seriously completely unfazed by the dinging of the bell? Do you not need a bed? I know there's more villagers in the main village. Like you, yes, you. Are you within range of picking up on that bed's trail? Pathfinder the bed. There's no bed over here. Where are you going? You're trying to take that bed. You can't. You can't get in. There's no way to get that bed. Take a different bed. Yes, are you going to a different bed? Or are you going to my the bed I put down? Ooh, no. You're being stupid. What? A villager not being smart? Crazy. Go for an easier bed, dude. You can't get to that bed. Yes, there you go. That's a bed. Cool. Go to this bed. Why do you want to go to that bed so fast? You can't. It's impossible. It's physically impossible. Why can't your pathfinding figure out that it's physically impossible to go to that bed? Can I just breadcrumb trail you over? Okay, great. There's a perfect clear bed right there. Ding. Where are you going? I don't understand. Yes, go over to this bed. There you go. How do I make this bed more impossible to get to? I don't understand. I just slightly walk towards that bed, and then when I ring the bell, I go to that bed. No, no, wait, 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 come back, there's a bed here. No, dude, there's a bed here, come on. Where are you going? Go back to that damn bed, no! No, you can't get to that bed! That's it, you're getting in a boat, and I'm bringing you over as close as I can to this other bed. Why are you so dumb, villager? So very, very dumb. You just have to go up this hill to the other bed, okay? And you can't go back over to that stupid bed that's not your bed. Go up the hill. I'm gonna ding the bell. You're gonna come up the hill to this bed because that other bed is physically impossible to reach, okay? Come here. Oh, it actually is. That's, that's surprising. Not surprising is how much you can save with I code. Switch and save 15% or more. 15 seconds could save you 15% or more on your car insurance. 
Woohoo. I don't know why I felt the need to make that convoluted dad joke. But, you know, whatever. It's what it is. Great. Oh no, now we have to go up there. What do we do? This is actually working. It's painful to get them to here, but from here it's much easier. Okay, well, you got... No, 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 no. There's no, there, there's no reason to stand on that block, okay? Great. There's no reason to stand on that block either. It's just your friend. Just go this way. I don't want to walk forward in a second, aren't you? There you go. Great. That's one of three down. I need to somehow to get a zombie in a boat up to there. Fortunately, I think... Oh, there's a lava pool here. I think if I go... Yeah, I can build a bridge over to there, and then that'll be good enough, probably. Bed down here. Just need to get a villager close enough over to here and whatnot. Et cetera, et cetera. Um, but I gotta pause, Chad. I gotta go to the bathroom really badly. Hey, I'm back. I'm back, chat. I think I unpaused the timer. Anyway. Now, I just need to get one more villager over to here. Just considerably easier said than done since this path blocks trap you, so I'm gonna have to run essentially a channel. Where'd the guy go? <laughs> Excuse me. Got hiccups now, apparently. Maybe that guy? I don't know, I just need a villager. Okay, or who it is. Hiccups. Dang it. This sucks. Whatever. Not gonna kill me. Just gonna make it really annoying to stream. I wonder where in evolution hiccups came to be and why. Just curious. I don't think they're that bad of a thing. But they're just weird and I don't know what they do. And I don't know why they do it. And I kind of know what they do. I know it's a spasm of a certain thing in your lower part of your throat, but... I don't know why it does it there. Don't immediately run away. Come on, come on, let me ring the bell. Let me ring the bell. I should have just left the I should just have the bell at the bottom of the hill. That's the that's the idea. Come on, dude. Come on. Be within range. No, 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 no. No. You don't get to go back. I'm gonna put a bet over here. 
ding the bell and hope they don't try and get into that superstructure. No, why do you all try and do that? And how did the baby get out? Oh, it just escaped because I'm stupid. Um, that's how. Yeah, that's my stupidity. And as to how the baby got out, because it's one block high. Of course it got out, because it can just walk out. And here it can just jump out. And where did you come from? Oh, you're that guy I sent over. And you're about to try and jump in there. Now the baby should be... There? Where did the baby go? Why is it not there? Oh, probably because I closed the trap doors and I never opened them. I am so stupid. Oh no. Why don't you go on that why don't you go on that bed over there? That nice cozy bed. Why don't you go on the cozy bed? Cozy bed over there, you know? Nice cozy bed. <coughs> don't you see the cozy bed back there? Don't you see the cozy bed? Don't you see the cozy bed back there, dude? I'll let you find it on your own. I'm going to bed myself. Here on the ground. Hopefully that other villager found an actual bed instead of just running around. Since there is an actual bed over where I placed one. Hello, where'd that villager I had over here go? Oh. Man, these hiccups. Where did they go? Why did they go there? Hello? You went back- It went back over here. Dude, could, could you maybe not, please? Is it that hard to just get up a hill? Just to follow orders? Now oh, that broke the lily pad. That's fun. Gosh, these hiccups. <sighs> I think I'm about to officially break my uh, current most recent record for uh longest stream so that'll be nice i guess now if i go up here and ding this bell 17 times to make sure you get the point actually Break the bed that's right behind you so you don't pathfind it either. You should be pathfinding to it so you get out of the thing. Also, I'm going to break this other bell over here and bring it over so that I can uh, ding the bell near you such that you can uh, make sure you know where you're going as soon as you get out of the boat, which is up that hill and not back over into the machine you can't get it to because that's not how it works. Ding, 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 ding. There's a bed up here, yes. You're gonna want to uh, pathfind to that be bell. Ed, and yes, you are, in fact. Where, did, where are you going? Where are you going? You, what? I'm, you know, I'm curious. Where are you, where do you think you're going? Yes, you're going to this one, right? Great. Or just stick there for a minute. I'll put one further up here, and then pathfind it. You actually did just pathfind that one. You going to that one? You going to the other one next? Or not? I can't tell. Where are you going? Are you going to it? Yo, hi there, Lyric the Gamer. How are you doing? 
I'm trying the, like, most pain- Come on, go to the bed. Go to bed. There you go. Okay, just tricking the villager real quick. Ball them up, and then trap them in, and then I gotta build the whole platform that this thing rests atop of. You can't get down now. It's too late. Great. Now I just need to build the top platform right here. For the Iron Golem Farm. Because that is what I'm building right now, is an Iron Golem Farm. Since I'm gonna be here for a long time. I have to defeat a warden. I don't know the exact design specs on this. It matters mostly, uh... Where the water flows, and then I just gotta falls off the edge somewhere in this direction. I need fencing somewhere, etc. But you know, somewhere down here, there's gonna be lava, probably like here, roughly here-ish. Get more wood, that way I can build more parts of the thing, and then I need to get water and build all the different parts of the iron golem farm. There's a witch hut right there, that's fun. I wish I would have taken the witch hut challenge instead of killing a warden. This is birch wood. I don't really want that all that much. Oh. And I'm gonna mine this too. Picky birch, uh, oak sapling. Then I just uh, go over here. 25 may or may not be enough. Probably not going to be enough. I need another crafting table. Do I have a crafting table here? No. Nope. Great. Build fences. Gonna need more than 30. And more than that many, too. That might actually be enough. 57 could be enough. Um, but I'm going to need more wood than that, so, you know. Also, however, going to need another axe if axe breaks which it will before i have enough money. noticing that you spawn on this world was very good 10 10 second village yes i spawned in the village i literally spawned in the village so if this was a normal minecraft speed run this spe this seed would literally be like a god seed because i spawned in a village there's a lava pool literally right there i spawned down there the iron golem was there, the lava pool was there, and, uh, yeah. And I basically have full armor from the village, so. You know. Yeah, if this was a regular speedrun, this would be a very, very good seed. However, this is not a regular speedrun. Instead, I have to do all of the random stuff chat has suggested over time. They also see a blacksmith. Yes, there was a blacksmith. And there was an iron pickaxe in the blacksmith. One of the main things you want in a speed run. So, you know. Yeah. Great. It, it's just, you know, it's just... It's just it's just how things have to be. That's just my luck. Because, of course, as soon as I'm not doing an actual speed run... Uh, I spawn in the world's best speedrunning seed, for random seed anyway. For set seed, it's obviously not, but, you know. And, I, you know, the portal's probably a 12-eye portal, too. Because why not? Makes sense to me. Uh... 
I'm just gonna quickly go up here and build a little staircase doohickey and... Get one up more. Oh crap, that's not a straight line. I can only really speed ridge in a straight line these days. Not these days, I was never able to... Yeah, I know, that sucks. I, diagonal speed bridging is clearly much harder. Because I can do a regular speed bridge now decently well. I'm just gonna settle for diagonal speed. Diagonal regular bridging. Maybe if I need to go straight, I'll speed bridge the last section since I can now. It's not that fast, but whatever. Anyway, oh, you guys need jobs. Hang on, that's my bad. You need a job, too. You take this. Get your job. Don't wake up on the outside of this structure, though. That, that would suck if I accidentally freed you from this thing. Need to drop all this down. Clearing, because why not? Of course, why not? <laughs> why not? If I leave this up, you know, the villager will just uh, get out of bed on the wrong side, and then it'll be screwed. Probably, anyway. Any zombies? I need zombies. Also need this to be kind of finished, and don't actually need a name tag. My my villager breeder is not very protected, which is kind of annoying. Hello. Any uh, any potential zombies around? You know, perhaps, perhaps. Uh, mayhaps a zombie spawn in? Is that a zombie I spy? Zombie, come here. Come here, zombie. Come here, no skeletons though, that's kind of annoying. Is that like a leather armor on, basically? What, what's, what is a seed? Slash seed. No spoilers, by the way, I don't spoil anything on the seed. There's the seed. Um, come along now. You are the remaining survivor. I sent it earlier, but you weren't here yet. Uh, come on up here. Just uh, follow me on up. All I need you to do is get into this boat on accident. Fortunately, I don't think I designed this correctly, but it's fine. Yeah, no, I did not design this correctly. Great. The farthest villager can't get scared. But... Uh, technically it kind of works. I just... Poorly designed. Whatever. Uh, fine. I think it'll still work. It's just slightly ineffective. Maybe. If I'm lucky it'll still work. Zombie won't despawn because it's in a boat, but it also won't burn because it's under a roof. For 
that? That guy's still burning down there. That's funny. Either way, it, it, it'll it'll live there, and if I get a name tag, I'll fix it. But otherwise, I'm just gonna have to deal with the fact that I did that wrong. Which sucks, but it is the case. And I don't think it'll spawn an iron golem, because only one of the villagers is scared. And defeats the purpose, because both the villagers have to be scared. Or all three do, I'm pretty sure. Or at least two do. At a time, anyway. And hopefully my villager breeder hasn't been ruined by this endeavor. Though it quite possibly has been. Especially considering the villager breeder produced a grand total of a single baby villager. Obviously. It's villager breeder, not just breeder. Um, and I need to get diamond armor soon. Then I need to get netherite armor, which is still doable. I've got an hour and a half. I do that an hour and a half. Is, will this thing spawn an iron golem or not? Very important. Find out in a bit, I guess. Oh, well, crap. Here goes the run. Not actually, I, most of that stuff was renewable. I, that wasn't really, it's not really worth an hour and a half. I'm just gonna pick my stuff back up again since only some of my stuff got burnt. A lot of stuff that's valuable. Uh, a lot of wood got burned, but that's about it. Nothing else of value. Not my 32 emerald bell. That's good. Appreciate that. Wish I'd covered this up with something, like a piece of dirt. Really wouldn't have been that hard for me to have done that. Yeah, yeah. Now that I think about it, yeah. I want to hope that there's an iron golem standing on top of that building right now. That when I get up there, there's going to be just a magnificent iron golem waiting for me. And I need, uh... Some kind of, like, iron golem catching chamber down here. No? It's going to be falling down and then... I need to fall into a spot and then... I can funnel it and then it'll burn to death. Just gonna build a big old funnel of death. I don't really care. I have to pause in a minute anyway. Or soon enough. I have to pause. Then I'll be back. With a vengeance. No, I'll just be back. I... I'll just be back. And have to continue working on this thing, which hopefully will work eventually. Seems the far villager is also scared, which is a good sign. Is there an iron golem up here? No, however, there is not an iron golem up here. And I forgot my water bucket, which means I'm kind of stuck up here with no way down. Great. I'm so smart. Eh, whatever. I'll just get working on the fence while I'm up here. Oh, the fence is exactly what I lost when I died. Great, of course I lost specifically the fences. Why would I lose anything else? Not my crappy leather armor or anything like, or the iron sword that I don't need right now. None of that, nah. Just specifically the thing that I could have used to not waste my time, but no. Oh wait, why don't I just do this? All of that into sticks. Don't have to worry about the sticks then. Make a bunch of fence gates. I need a ton of fence gates. I need, still need more wood now that I've done that, but whatever. At least I've got all the fence gates I could need for this build, and then the build will be done. I don't know why it hasn't spawned any iron golems yet. Since it seems all three villagers have been scared by the zombie, which is a good thing. So, you know. 
which means it should work, but it hasn't yet. Which could mean a number of things that I'm not sure of. That's a stack. That that should be more than enough. Why hasn't it spawned one yet? That's the question, that's the mystery. If I go... A log on the ground there. Seriously, no, no guy yet. Wow, that's crazy. I didn't need to do that. I'm just gonna assume that. Okay, I'm going to have to pause here for an amount of time. Um. Um, no. Okay, yeah, I have to go for a bit chat. Alright, I'll be back.
Hey, I'm back. Surprisingly, it seems like there might actually still be people here. But then again, they could just as easily disappear as soon as I said that. All chopped up. Not chopped up, all placed in. Then I just gotta figure out how far the water will flow. Uh, two, so I can make this. Yes. And I'm gonna make it three more for now. Because I need to get down. And up. I need to get another water. Climb up and out here. And up. And cut back on this. There you go. Let that go a more reasonable distance than what it currently is going. It's all the way. This doesn't spawn iron golems. I don't really know what though. Um. Do I even need to make this? I think I can do this with three pieces of water. I just have to block one of them, two of them temporarily, and then they'll spread a little bit and create a wider water thing, and then whatever. I also would appreciate if they would, uh... Okay, never mind. Apparently I can't do this with only... I have to fill the whole thing in. Whatever. That's not an axe. I mean, that's not wood. Um... Water is blue. Dabba dee dabba die. Yes, yes, my brain. Making stupid ass jokes. As soon as you make. Yes, my brain. As soon as I. That's not that dumb of a joke. It's just a dad joke. No, it's not a dad joke. It's kind of a dad style joke. Yeah, whatever. Why do I have to justify myself to the non existent stream viewers? Or the existence stream viewers, either way, I'm, I really have no reason to justify anything to the chat, because the chat is uh, just as cursed, if not more cursed. Um, now I just need to get them funneling, and also I need to make sure they actually spawn, which they don't seem to do. So I think I have to let them sleep in their beds, or try to sleep in their beds, and then as long as they have their beds set as their beds, they'll be good? Maybe? Not entirely sure on the logic here, but, um, mm, hopefully the villagers will start spawning, is basically what I'm saying. In any case, yeah. I'll chop wood while I wait. And I hope that they will spawn. I might not be able to keep streaming. I want to, but... I might not be able to. Actually, no, I probably can. I'm just gonna have to BRB again. Which sucks. I need to get that music up again. I'll get some music up. Um, I get a music. I gotta get a playlist up. Not a playlist. Just, just music. Get the high tail playlist up. Hang on. I'll be right back, chat. I'm just gonna get the high tail playlist up for the chat here. Let me get the high tail playlist for you. Just give me a second. Uh da -da 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 -da. library. This this does not hang on, just give me a second here. Uh where's my playlist? Show more. Where's Hightail? Hightail, Hightail. 
I have the high tail place. Here it is. High tail OST. There we go. Enjoy that. I'm gonna go. Okay? I'll, I'll be right back. back chat i'm gonna assume that that was probably way too loud and that i just blasted everyone's microphones or speakers not microphones um back to the game unpause this timer why did it fade to black hang on why did the stream break what's wrong with the stream hello why did it break? Oh no. What did I do? Oh no, it fixed itself. Scene broken on my end. Hello? Why am I so much quieter all of a sudden? Why am I like 40 times quieter? Hello? Oh no, I'm not any quieter. I'm a... Seem to be at the normal volume, maybe? Not sure. Honestly. I don't know. It hasn't spawned any iron golems yet, and it's bothering me. Spawn iron golems, dude. Are you not all getting scared? I, th I... I know I didn't do it entirely correctly, but... Please? Game? Pretty please? The cherry on top. The far guy not getting scared. Is one of them not getting a job? What? What's the deal? One of them die? Ah, uh, crap. I almost just died myself. Died myself. Okay. Changed color. Five, four, how many hours? Seven minutes according to this. Oh no. Been live for six hours. No, oh, that villager didn't die, it's just not scared. We should be more scared, villager. It gets scared. All of them are getting scared. 
Why aren't they spawning an iron golem, though? They should spawn an iron golem. Is, that, is this too high up? What? Why not? Why no iron golem? I'm so confused. I'll do that anyway. Put a nice little pen. Maybe if, maybe if I put a platform like down here, I'll spawn it over here or something. On the same Y level, be able to spawn over here on this platform. One down the ground. What? What's up with this? Okay. Gotta figure this out, game. You got all. You got three scared villagers. All of beds and jobs. A zombie scaring them. They should spawn a iron golem within 20 blocks in every direction and four blocks upward. I think excludes the upper spawning platform, but I don't really care. I just want it to work at all. This is annoying. Damn. Yeah, this is really annoying. Um... Come on, work. Why won't you work? You're all scared. You should spawn an iron golem. Okay, well, let's go check out the villager breeder, because maybe that's been going better. I don't even know it's been loaded this whole time, and there's probably zombie villagers or something, and everyone's dead over here. No, they look alive. The baby villager appears to have escaped because I neglected this little hole here. Yes, go back in. I can fix my errors. Have any of them collected in here? Yes, there's one, which means that's the second baby villager I has been made. Cool. Great. At least the villager breeder is working as intended. Of course, that doesn't help me because instead of having iron to sell to one of my villagers, I just have more villagers, which is great if I had anything to sell to them. But I don't because I can't. I don't have any more iron or anything, so... Nothing to sell, which means no reason to have more villagers to sell to. Really, anyway. I guess technically I, more villagers means more potential trades, which means uh, I don't have to wait as long for refreshes on the trades, but it doesn't help me because I guess mm, it does kind of help me. I guess I could trade sticks. A lot, a lot of sticks. I will trade a lot of sticks. Actually, not a bad idea. Just to ignore, just ignore the fact that I can't get what's ideal and go for what's not necessarily like go for what I can get. This shovel goes away really fast. I mean, it's golden. I don't know what I was expecting, but like, dang. Even for golden, it goes fast. Right, no, let's get one of my many regular shovels. I say regular, but just dirt, just stone. Not necessarily regular. Irregular. It's just about stone, not stone. Then I can make four more, um... Need 
one of these to be. This is the most effective way of doing this. Mine, apparently not. One of you give me... Wait, there we go. Put the other one away. Four. There we go. I need a number of these and then four more beds later. Not now. I'll... I don't care right now. I'll put this back away and put this, this, and this here too, and this. This, 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 and this can all go together with this, 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 and this. And then later I'll make four more fletchers, and this can go in here. And so can this. And then I'm going to take these out. That too can go in there. And I'm just going to really quickly go chop down a ton of trees. And by really quickly, I mean kind of slowly since all I have is stone axes. But you get my point. Or you don't. I don't really care. I'm going to get trees and get wood and get wood to sell for sticks. Sell, sell as sticks and not for sticks. I don't need sticks. Well, I do need sticks, but I don't... My brain is running out of mental capacity since it's past hour six. What are you doing over here? It is six hours into the stream, so understandably my brain is kind of... Uh, melting, since I'm not used to streaming for this long, even remotely. But so far, I've been doing pretty good. This whole week has been pretty good for me. Not gaining any subscribers. I gained one this stream, but it would nice to gain more, but, you know. How much can you really ask for? What I need to do is upload a video, and I've got a video idea, and I'm really working on some stuff to improve my videos and do some other things. And I was really hoping to have finished the uh, speedrun in the other run, the other world, and have been done with it. But now I have, like, the most outrageous speedrun ever. So, you know, whatever. I keep shopping away at this... I don't... Also, I'm... Mm, I'm I'm legitimately just contemplating casually editing what the description says and then ending the stream. But, mm, maybe... I think I said the word ending the stream and then lost a viewer. That's how it that's how it starts. They hear ending the stream and then they flake away and then even though I'm not actually doing that, I just said I was considering doing that. I don't know why. Like my words are poison and every time I misstep people just die instantly. Like certain things you just physically can't say during a stream, for whatever reason. Not sure why. Just how it is. Not like anyone's watching anyway. Late. It's too late. Been streaming for six hours, so... Understandably, people are kind of have lost interest, especially after my first really good run ended, and now I'm just playing the game, basically. Which has no intrigue at all to it. Even I'm for kind of. I'm also kind of having fun, but that's just because Minecraft's fun. But it's not that fun, so, you know. I'd be more interested in working on a video right now than I would be in, um, you know, making th this stream go on forever. I can always just continue it tomorrow. I was so determined to beat the challenge today, I never considered, what if the challenge got infinitely worse?
I can only stream for another six hours tomorrow, and then six hours the day after, and then if I can't beat this speedrun in, what would that be, 14 hours? Then I don't think it's worth beating. until all my axes broke, but that's a pain. Now let's do it anyway. I need wood. Uh, we should only have an hour to get to another right otherwise I won't get my 75 whole cents it's raining great that'll be amazing for my bit rate I really want to work on a different video or Honestly, just go do anything else, but whatever. I'm gonna keep chopping wood. Can't be quiet. I'm gonna turn the music back on. I, I think it's royalty free, but. No, it's copyrighted. Eh, whatever. It's, I probably shouldn't play it since it's copyrighted. I'll just go find myself a different, uh, did I save it? No, I didn't. Did I save it to watch later? No. No, I did not. Damn. Damn. Oh. Okay, I didn't even pause the timer, so that was just on my clock there. Whatever. Foot's going numb. I don't want to lose my foot. Not much good commentary for chopping trees down, you know? It's almost as if live streams are supposed to be entertaining. Hmm. Funny how that is. Huh. I think it'd be more entertaining tomorrow, but... Maybe not. It's more entertaining if there's people watching, ironically, but in order for there to be people watching, people have to endure this for a bit, enough to create their own entertainment by channeling it through me, because comments, reading, my suffering is probably somewhat entertaining. I just don't know it, because it doesn't entertain me, because I'm suffering. Not badly, though, I'm just chopping wood, really. God, always... Look on the bright side of life. Silly song. Through here too. I'll go for six and a half hours. Seven, maybe, probably seven. Oh, I'm, I think I'm gonna call it quits at seven hours. Maybe less. I'd really like to get work done on something else on a project of mine, on a video, so that I can release that video, and then it can actually get views, and actually get, I can actually get somewhere on YouTube, rather than what I'm doing right now, which is not really getting me anywhere. 
I don't, I don't know if that video will do well. I think it'll do well. Also, there's a full savanna over there, which could mean more villages, which could mean hay bales, which could mean profit. Hmm, I could get the hay bales, sell it to a trader, and then that'd be great. Or I could just build more trading halls elsewhere, and I wouldn't have to use the breeder, but the breeder already works. What I really need is the iron farm, and the iron farm doesn't work. Hmm. So tricky, 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 tricky. A puzzle. It's a puzzle that no one listening to me solve, so... Is it really worth solving it out loud? I don't know. I kinda talk to myself outside about normally. Whatever. My catchphrase is just, eh, whatever. Or, well, it doesn't really matter. It's a great catchphrase, really. Kind of shrugging stuff off. Not a good life motto, though. But, you know, whatever. I see, I just did it to the exact sentence. My brain. It's a miracle. I don't even have that many stacks of wood right now. That doesn't help that I'm using the stone pickaxe, or stone axe. <coughs> I need water. Otherwise my voice is gonna get super gravelly like this, which I don't know if I really hate all that much, since it sounds better than my normal voice, which is high-pitched and tweaky, and then it's all gross and weird. It's not that gross, but... It's not gross at all, it's just high-pitched, and I'd prefer it to be lower. At least a little bit lower. I just think it sounds better. My jokes are kind of, you know, monotone and drab and sarcastic or deadpan humor in general. So having a excited, high-pitched voice, it's not necessarily excited, high-pitched voice, it's just a high-pitched voice, is not beneficial, but whatever. Some saplings. I keep chopping wood. Wood. This is just the deforestation percent. I should do one of those videos. How many trees can I chop down in 24 hours? Or chopping a million trees in 24 hours. Attempt number 37 because that's like physically impossible. is not technically broken yet. I'm gonna break before I finish chopping this tree, though. Oh, yeah, but only by one block, so that's fine. It would have been better. I mean, not better. It would have been much worse if it had broken at any other time or right after I finished chopping that tree. It would have been considerably worse, because then I would have only broken one block on another tree, and then I had to break the whole thing with my fist or leave it floating, which I dare not do, because... Floating trees is just a bad habit. Good bad to leave trees floating, especially on a public server. Or any server, for that matter. Fortunately, this isn't a server, so, you know, whatever. Let me go over here. Still no iron golems spawned in? Crazy. I think that's literally the spawn chunk, so they might be permanently loaded there. That's good. Good for me, anyway. Any of these guys grown up? Yes, one of them actually has. That's cool. That's that's doubly cool. Double cool events just transpired. That's pretty rare. Two cool events happening at once. That is pretty amazing. Miraculous, one might even say. It's not really miraculous, though, honestly. Emeralds, emeralds. 
Emeralds, so many emeralds. Don't really need arrows. I mean, I'll need arrows later, but not now. Um, I actually have another villager to make. Another villager trading thingy. My brain. Villager trading thingy? Yep, that's definitely what it's called. Good job, brain. You got, you got it. Ding, ding, ding. Villager trading thingy. That's, of course, what it's called, as we all know. That's what I've been calling it this whole time. The villager trading thingy. You guys all heard my signature name for this, uh, thing. Villager trading thingy. Make another little hall. Make another section for the villager trading hall. I actually need my materials. Two, because I actually... I need to go to sleep myself. Otherwise, that's gonna happen. And I made it. Cool. But I got a hit on me. Got two hits on me because I didn't back up far enough. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It's it's gone now. Can't hurt you anymore. <laughs> Bad zombies gone. I can't hurt you anymore. Don't worry. Oh look, there's two. Please don't both get in this boat. You both got in the boat. That's exactly what I told you not to do. Actually, I didn't even tell you. It wasn't even like an annoying command. I just asked you kindly with the word please, actually, for once. Despite the fact that it's villagers and you never ask for anything, never do anything for you. Cause it's just villagers. It's just villagers. Uh, is that what I have set up for all the other ones? No, I don't believe it is. I think I legit... Wait. Yeah, no. No, no, it is. These are on the same level, so... Yeah, that, that's that's what I have for all of them. I'm just gonna do that. That works. Now, I have a boat here, so I'm gonna break that boat. And then one of you... Both of you is gonna run into each of these boats. Okay, you got in that boat. Not really the boat I wanted any of you in, because... I... That doesn't make any sense why I'd want you in that boat. Fortunately, this... You stupid villager. What are you doing? Who do you think you are? Can I... Can I get out of here? Wait. No. No. Why? Why are you like this, dude? At least one of you go... No, neither of you can, in fact, because you're too stupid. Get in the boat. Get in the boat, one of you, please, just get in the boat. Thank you. Never both of you. Oh no, you're suddenly found that you're stuck. It's almost as if that's my goal here. The whole reason you're tr literally trapped and you have nowhere to go. It's there's, there's nowhere to go. Nowhere to run, there's nowhere to break free to. You're not escaping to anywhere. I, I'm... Very, very confident that you are. Um, what do I do? That. You want to voluntarily be trapped? Here, I'll put a flower down. Go stand by the flower. Seriously, just go. Nope, too late. I'm gonna have to trap you in a boat now. Here you go, get trapped in the boat. You can walk to the end of the room and make me have to boat you all the way into the room like you're a toddler. Sure. This way. The holding, holding location, your, your little temporarily... Jail. I say temporary. Your permanent jail is over here. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, no, you're taking damage? Ah, that's horrible. I, I, it's such a shame. I, I would never see a, want to see a villager come to harm. Genuinely, I wouldn't, because it would make them raise prices, and it sucks. Can you move? How are you so solid? How are you solidly, so solidly unmoving? What is your secret? Can I have this much knockback protection, please? Well, now I've screwed myself. You have three blocks you can move to. Yeah, you officially have two blocks you can move to. Officially have one. Great, there you go. That was my shovel for a second there. 
You have a flower. You're flower villager now. That's the wrong job. Wrong trades. Still the wrong trades, dude. Give it to me. Thank you for the money. Fun. Let's go. I need to make more sticks and put this stuff away because I have handled all of the villagers I need to handle. Go. And let's do birch this time. Like sticks. Here we go. Fun. Let's talk to this one now. Talking all the town NPCs to finish a quest. Let's trade with all of them. Great. All right. 48 emeralds. This is a great number, and you reset your trades. That's cool. And for the same price, nonetheless. That's, I think, the coolest part here. The worst part is I don't have enough sticks, and you're probably going to reset them again before I get back. Craft all the sticks I can. That's a full inventory of sticks, basically. Please don't have reset. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, that's even better. Thank you. Never mind. You only trade a tiny bit. What about you? 31 as well? That's great. Love that. How many do you have? 8 trades? 16? Emeralds? Great. That's amazing. You went up in price. That is not amazing. Guess I didn't get you in quick enough. Whatever, I have a ton of money now. Ooh, and more ones. Oh, and you're open again, too. Let's go. Good job. Probably gonna majorly raise prices after this, but who cares? I don't. Are you open, too? No, you're not. I wonder why this guy opened trades so quickly. I could get a crossbow. I could also trade string in for money. I need that. Could buy more bells. Should I buy more bells? I should go check if the villager breeder, not villager breeder, the villager breeder is working. I know that. I should go check if the villager iron farm is working. Villager iron farm? I mean, technically it is a villager iron farm, but there's no other way of farming iron, so it's just an iron farm. Unless they're going to add one. That'd be cool if they added a way to farm iron that doesn't involve villagers being constantly terrified. Maybe one that's a little more effective, apparently, because apparently this one's not very effective. I clearly did something wrong, I just don't know what it is. They're scared. They all have jobs, except for that one. Is it literally just because that one doesn't have a job? Why don't you have a job? You have a job site block, don't you? Yes not have a chance to get your job? Oh, because there's a block there. Wow, I really hate the fact that that's probably literally all my problem was. Get a job, dude. Can you take a minute and get a job? Please? Please, just get your job. Yes, okay. Great, now it's probably gonna work immediately. I really hate how that works. Now, while I wait for that to spawn an iron golem, I'm gonna fill my water. And this time, hopefully, I won't die to a zombie almost, or almost die to a zombie, and then run down a cave, and then get lost, and then try and fight an enderman, and then die to an enderman after backing up away from it and falling off a 20 block cliff and dying instantly without even a fight. But I guess there was a bit of a fight. I just started backing away, and that's what killed me. <clears throat> Can it spawn now, or no? Was that not the problem? Was that just a, a coincidence? Or some other problem preventing an iron golem from spawning? Okay, cool. That's full up. Got another full glass of water, so I can repair my throat, which is currently starting to actually hurt. It's not just gravelly, it's actually going to hurt which is unfortunate, because I'm very much liking my voice right now. Super gravelly. Ooh, dramatic. Ba-ba-ba-bum-bum-ba-bum! Oh no, is that open? 
Oh, she opened it. It was just a little damp. And it's not gonna spill water all over my desk. That's good. Because I just kind of laid a water sack on my desk. Water in a bag. Like milk in a bag. Hilarious. Why is there no iron golem spawning? Can you not produce an iron golem? Is this a problem? Is it on the ground already? What's up with it? Don't understand the problem. Well, I'll leave them be. And maybe they'll produce an iron golem. Meantime, I'm gonna go get uh, my axes and I'm gonna... Wait, I can just craft them over here. I'm gonna chop some trees down over here so that I'm within the radius of this. That way it's nice and loaded. Which will be great for them. Not great for me, however. I'm probably not gonna be getting that 75 cents. But, you know what, whatever. I don't really care, I can probably get, I can probably get 75 cents for just completing this whole thing just by asking somebody for 75 cents, like, hay, I did this cool thing, can I have 75 cents? Someone will probably say yes. I hate trees like this, but I started cutting it down, so I'll finish cutting it down. Hopefully this one will be nice and easy, unlike most trees like this. Oh, that's an iron golem. It's not where I was expecting it to be, and hopefully it doesn't kill my zombie, but that's an iron golem. Hello, friend. By friend, I mean person I'm about to kill. Oh, well, I'll sleep. Dang it. Ah, I'm stupid. I screwed up. Screwed up and I died. Ah, that's what I get for being stupid. Just kill me, I'm going. Great. Well, I will fix this thing right up. And I'll leave you alive so that I don't have to deal with new ones spawning in. Just pop up here. Deal with this wooden pillar and then deal with getting a proper system for uh, killing you. And I need to make a hopper, so hopefully you drop five iron. And then whatnot. And I probably won't be getting full iron, but. I do have the money for it, I just need to get a, uh, armor smith and get full diamond armor and whatnot and, you know. If this was a server, I'd be doing pretty okay, because I probably can get diamond, full diamond armor in the next half hour. I just have to do the right stuff and make the right choices since I have a stack and a half of emeralds, but this isn't a Minecraft server. This is a, supposed to be a speedrun of sorts. And as such, of course, it won't be going perfectly fine. It's my luck with speedruns. It's not great. Um, lava is here. Uh, really, the middle's more like there, so I'll just, you know, whatever. I'll just move stuff about, about move the lava a bit. Need to get some signs so that I can get the lava suspended above a hopper, which can feed into a chest there or somewhere. I don't know. Need that much room. Oh crap. Um, whatever. I can do this. It's, uh, dirt. Sure. That's fine. This is a good distance for it, and I need a bit of, uh, Need some signs anyway. I said signs. There we go. And yeah. That 
Should be good. It is. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Know where the nearest water is, but I know I need to pick up some of this stuff. Nearest water is probably exactly where the nearest water seems to be, which is right here. I just have to stop thinking as if there's going to be some better solution. And there's not always a better solution. That sounded way deeper than it is. I was just talking about where water is, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> if I can be accidentally, in, like, deep and very profound, why not? You know, who cares? Who cares if I'm inadvertently profound? Should kind of do that decent amount, but whatever. These all seem to flow in the right direction, so that's fine. Yeah. Don't know if that'll catch them all, but... Not Pokemon. Don't need to catch them all. Actually, I, I do, otherwise it'll break the farm, but... You get my point. I can upgrade it. I can always upgrade it. Always start over. I got exactly three, which is enough for an axe, which is what I really want. Nope, I need to save for a hopper. It's like I just, it's like I just realized I need to spend responsibly. Don't spend all your money in the same place. <laughs> hey, I got three iron, let me make an axe. Nope, I need to buy a hopper. Make sure not to spend your money in the same place. Buy a hopper? Crap, not buy. Oh, that's uh that's the second one. Great. It's already working very well. Perfect. I can get the money from that. Can I please have that iron? I need it for a hopper. Yay, that's enough. Really? I don't have enough wood, so I'm gonna spend the three to make an axe. Just literally what I just said I couldn't do is make an axe, but I, I have enough now, so. And I need to afford a chest to make a hopper, and then I need a second chest to have the hopper feed into. And then the iron farm will be done, and I have infinite money, and then that's compounding, and I can uh, get full diamond. And then I need beds, and I need to go to the nether, and then I can get the netherite, and then so on and so forth. Ooh, that was close. Glad that didn't remove my lava. Though then again, the lava was literally right there, so it's fine. Wow, I'm just building like a pool. This is just like... This is just a fun water park for the iron golems. You know, up until they die, but yeah, whatever. We're not gonna think about that. We're just gonna pretend like this is a pool, they're having a pool party, none of them are dying horrifically in lava. You know, it's fun, it's fun. Though there is sitting water, which means it's not flowing, which means it could uh, potentially not kill them. Uh, yeah, that's a slight problem. Can I just do this? Yes, I can just do this. Because all the water is over there, actually, so I can just remove all the still water because I accidentally formed a bunch of non still water. Wow, I'm really just trying to drown them out here, aren't I? Didn't even mean to. You can't drown them. What are you doing? Oh, you're going up. I've created a loop. Well, eventually you get stuck, so that's fine. It's slight inefficiency. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. I can use wood to build this since there's gonna be water on it, so the fire can't get to it anyway. And I don't even think the lava reaches that far. Hopefully this does actually work, because otherwise there's a slight problem, and which is that it's not working. This was meant for hoppers, so I should do that instead of just leaving the iron stand down here. Well, not stand. It's an item. It can't stand. 
Well, it kind of does. I guess they float, but I, I'm just getting sidetracked by my own brain. That's the most common thing to sidetrack me, actually. Whatever. Oh, hi, another visitor. Wow, this is actually a really good farm. Surprisingly. I, su I surprise myself every time I do something that isn't utterly stupid. It's crazy how I, in fact, have a functional brain and can do smart things, not just dumb things. Is this gonna make it taller, or just... Hopefully it won't make it taller. Is this gonna make it taller? Yes, it is gonna make it taller. Can we not do that whole deal? Can this thing not become a giant swimming pool, please? Seriously? Like, legitimately, seriously. I, I don't want a swimming pool. Oh, crap. I didn't mean to place that there, so now it's just gonna get bigger and bigger and bigger. I don't want a swimming pool. Cool. Because this works. And this is removable water, so I can just... They're wide enough that I, I don't need water every single tile. I can do it every other. So I can actually just make it like this. This is really cursed looking, but... Functional? No, still not functional, because they keep swimming upward instead of down towards where they're meant to be going, which is there. They actually fixed it? What? Okay, well, now I need to get signs there to fix it permanently instead of temporarily. <clears throat> wow, the voice is really going. Almost as if I've been talking for how many hours? Almost. No, oh, it's a good thing there's water right here. Can this water... Okay, Stop it. My farm, my rules, stop ruining it, dumb water. You're, you're not here to do that. This is you're here to take the iron golems over to here, into there. If you're not doing that, then you... How did you manage that? Did I build this tall enough that you can spawn there? Yes, probably I did, actually. Do that. Uh, crap. Hmm. Right, I'll put fences around the edges. You really want to kill that guy badly, don't you? Well, reasonable. That's like your core. No! God damn it, man! This sucks. Big ol' swimming pool of iron golems. Let's go. Woohoo! Swimming pool. Okay, how many fence gates do I need to craft to fix this problem? Fence gates? These are signs. My brain. Really going down the drain right now. Wow. Ooh, well, this is a pool of death, and hopefully a functional pool of death, not just an ugly one. Well, you're stupid, aren't you? You had a direct way up to me, instead you chose to stand down here like an idiot and die. Well, free stuff. Okay. Alright, I need the fence gate so they don't spawn down there. I really hate this. Mostly the part where I got the challenge, kill a warden. Which is very unproductive because killing a warden requires an immeasurable amount of preparation and you deserved die because you're just standing outside these poor villagers house don't change priorities i'm going to sleep Ugh.
I've got a half hour to get full netherite. Interesting. Don't explode. I don't know. Okay, you exploded anyway. Because for whatever reason, that doesn't reset fully when you get hit or stop exploding. Uh, any more iron golems over here? No. None. And you're dead. Yeah, shoot me. Surprisingly, it didn't. Now, eh, whatever. Doesn't change anything. Still a skeleton. Just uh, didn't shoot me. Or maybe they could be friend. Fender of oh, yeah, whatever. Iron, yay! Can you produce more of those, please? Oh, you just did. Cool. And I'm going to surround this in fence gates in case they're able to spawn down here. I don't know if they are or not, but uh, you know, you can never be too careful. Also, it looks a little better with a fence on it. Generally speaking, though, this thing looks, you know, really bad. Um, really ugly. And, uh, yeah. Frick! Oh, doodles, I'm stupid. Well, might as well fix this side, too, while I'm at it. I don't know why that side decided to flow and this side didn't, but you know, whatever. I don't care or anything. I just put a freaking piece of obsidian in here. Which I am gonna mine because I don't wanna try and redesign this farm. It's this thing. It's gonna take me two minutes, I think. It's gonna take a while either way. Maybe not two minutes. It's gonna take a long time though, and it's gonna be painful and Whatnot, but it's better than redesigning the entire farm because I screwed up. Or I could go level up that guy and potentially get a diamond pickaxe. That could work too, but that would require a large amount of iron that I don't have, which this machine produces, generally speaking. Of course, it's not producing right now because that happened, and now I need to get lava in there, which is... Not that hard to do because the lava pool is right here, but you know, whatever. The English. Please. And thank you. There we go. That's great. Now I'm going to go trade all this iron away immediately. Despite probably having better uses for it. Like taking iron out too, so I can chop trees down so I can trade the sticks for money, which I will do actually, but for now. Since I have one iron axe, which is enough to chop down the equivalent of a two or three stone axes, I think I'm going to stick with what I got and not bother. Um, where are you? Hi. Take some iron. That way I can level you up and then just buy you out by buying diamond hose. Ooh. It's cheap, but it hurts me because I'm buying diamond hose. Oh, right, I can only buy three or so. So you, uh... I can buy three or so of those as well. And that, there we go. That gets me the better tools, right? Ooh, and you leveled up. And diamond axe! Let's go, baby! That's what we're waiting for. That's what it's all about. I'm just gonna buy a couple of these because... And do that again, and could do that, but nah. Okay, now I've got tools, tools, tools galore. I've got all the best tools in the universe. Don't ever need an iron axe again, because I got diamond axes, baby. Now I can produce so much uh, wood. It's not even funny. Get rid of all these stone axes. Which means I can make so much more money, which means I can do just about whatever I want, kind of, uh, you know, for the most part. Minus the part where I don't have any more new villagers. I do have a new villager, great! 
They're gonna be an armorer, so that I can get full diamond in the next 30 minutes. Getting the netherite part is gonna be impossible, but... You know, at least I'll have gotten the diamond armor part, and honestly, I think I'm, I'll am i be proud of myself for getting diamond armor, and, uh, you know... Diamond armor in, uh, three hours. Full diamond armor in three hours. This won't be maxed. This is mostly because of... Nothing, I just overestimated how fast I could set up villagers. To be fair, I got pretty darn close to the mark of three hours. Uh, is how long it takes me to set up villagers, but... Whatever, you know, it is what it is. Realistically, I couldn't actually expect myself to do that. I, I just really wanted to for the stream and whatever, you know. Just putting generally unrealistic expectations on myself, as I usually do. But you know, whatever. You know. I can pretty much uh, almost do exactly what I would said I'd do. I'd have to go very, very, very insanely fast to actually get full netherite in the next 30 minutes. Or actually 25 for that matter. The baby got in? How did the baby get in? Its hitbox isn't even tall enough. That doesn't even make any sense, game. How'd you do that? Did it jump into the boat? What is this, dude? I honestly don't care if you escape, child. I do not. I do not care. Actually, I do care. I, I need you. I need you. Stay there. Stay there. Yes, get in a separate boat. There we go. Okay, me versus you, and I won, baby. A, to a hydrogen bomb versus coughing baby. Let's go. Oh, that's too too tight i need this no how did you do that i did not even know you could physically do that go get a job you gotta step down to get no you apparently don't get a step down to get a job um move this get get up here get pushed slightly come on dude come on yes thank you i don't care this is toolsmith job i stupid i need to make a blast furnace or have a blast furnace is this town have a blast furnace no of course it doesn't why would it have a blast furnace what town would have a blast furnace that's so silly of the town to do that how would they do that that would actually be logical and make my life easier but that's illegal no making my life easier this is completely unheard of I like how because I saved the other one, now the live split seems to think I'm doing really, really, really badly on my speed run. And I'm just like, well, you don't know that I added killing a warden as part of it, so... Mm, all things considered, I think I'm doing okay on my speed run, actually. Thank you very much, live split. Uh, don't need your criticism, really. That thing can grow up in a boat, right? I'm pretty sure it can. I have apples to eat. I can actually probably make bread with all this wheat since I don't really need, you know, wheat anymore because it's not like I'm going to trade it. Um, I do, however, need a furnace to smelt some uh, stuff. Up, and then a second furnace to smelt that stuff a second time. And then five iron, so let me go over to the iron farm. I could do with harvesting my sugar cane. Because the paper would be good for leveling up a librarian. Which I need to do so that I can unlock their enchanting book trades. Actually, wait, no, they start with enchanting book trade, and that's how you reroll them. I'm stupid. My brain's just forgetting. 
how villagers work because it's kind of shutting down. You know what? I, I, my brain is dying a little bit, and I've been live for seven hours in one minute. So I'm probably going to end the live stream in, in like, very shortly, in one minute, probably. Uh, because I just don't feel like uh, doing this. Not any fun, really. I mean, it's fun, but I could always have fun tomorrow. Oh no, I'm just gonna edit the description of this video, and then nobody, and then... And then, um, just, uh, remove any and all evidence that I, uh, ever said I would stream forever. I don't have a furnace. This will be the furnace. This is Blast Furnace now. Great. Good thing I remember that crafting recipe because really I probably don't. I'm surprised I did, but the only reason I do is because I've had to craft it so many times for villager trading halls. Uh, armorer. Yeah. Uh, no. No thanks. Can I at least get one? No, 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 please. No. No. No form of iron armor. No thanks, please. Can I at least get a chest plate? Thank you. One of them. I'll take a chest plate or two. Great. Now I have an iron chest plate. I think I was out of. Uh, am I out of emeralds? Yes. Crap. Whatever. Okay, yeah, that's gonna do it for today, so have a good whatever you're doing next. Maybe I'll see you next time. Bye! I, I'm just gonna continue this tomorrow. Oh, you're back? Wait, were you here before? You just got back as soon as I was about to end the stream? I was about to end the stream. I said I wasn't gonna end the stream until I beat this, but then, but then, uh, killing a warden got ended of the thing, and suddenly... It meant this live stream will probably last till like 2 a.m. And I don't really feel like that since the stream has been going for seven hours. What do you think, Raiden? Do I keep going or do I end the live stream because it's been seven hours? I could probably go for more hours. There is other things I want to be doing. Like making other videos and working on things in general. Or just relaxing. Can you get out of the way? I'm gonna move this guy out of the way. I'm going to diamond pickaxe, too. Pretty good. Pretty good deal. Buy more diamond hose. Since that's exactly what I need. And? Okay. Thank you. I, I really need that. Oh, hi, wandering trader. What do you sell? Nothing good? Cool. Gunpowder's not bad. Okay. Well, have a good way we do next. Maybe I'll see you next time. Bye.